Let him lead you. It doesn't. I don't. It doesn't matter what how you feel. Saying he's led by God, but you feel like God is not telling y'all that. Do you still follow him? You said something interesting, East. You just said like men don't think the way that women do. So it almost sounds like you don't fully trust their expertise. So how could you successfully be led by? So the majority of men don't have kids. Y'all are picking wrong. Y'all are literally picking the minority. Every man that's on this panel, y'all have more kids than all of us women. Fifty-one percent of black men are single and childless. Excuses for the for the statistics. The, the statistics don't go well in your favor. So you say things like, "Okay, are they are they uh, are they shooting blanks? Or are they?" Is his 
because men i don't feel like men are overall passive the aggressive the majority of men do you think that silence is that passive aggressive because we will do that yeah if you because there's niggas that are used that as a form as a, a way to trigger a woman like because a lot of time a woman to tell you like when you're silent it makes me feel like i'm ignored so a nigga will do that intentionally yeah, no, I'm just because I didn't agree with the passive aggressive part until Mary said that. I'm like, OK, I can see men and be like, you know what? I ain't saying nothing else. Well, unsubscribing from the Democratic Party helped fix black America. Let's just unsubscribe. No, you got to know why. I don't think so. That's the only thing that get black people together. You know what I'm saying? Like that <laughs> shit like that. Shit like that. Shit like that. Wow. What I think will fix is if black people under truly understood politics. I because think. for a guy, because listen, it's, it's so many different reasons for a man to want to hang out with his friends. AJ, I'm not going to let that slide. I heard you. Why do you think that it's older single women who share that opinion? Sometimes that's the case. There has to be that. Explain what White History Month is. It's honoring the achievements of the greatest ethnic group in human history. Wow. I think all of that shit deserves a put him in a bathroom. <laughs> Would you rather have a whore of a daughter or a gay son? Um, let's see here. Um. Bruh. Because if she's a hoe, that ain't my problem. Hell, she just be a hoe. Shit. <laughs> That's a that's a whore. Definitely. Like yeah, what I just going to college a waste of time. Absolutely. <laughs> I it, it's ridiculous. Hey, and can I just piggyback on that that yeah, I read this for me, Q. Okay. Five five dollar super chat from Omega Green depends. Go for STEM, medical or law. However, if you go for BS degrees like communications, is that supposed to be policies? Or Facts. criminal justice, Poli -sci, political science. Poli -sci, okay. yeah. Or criminal justice, it's wasted time. Final thought. When you take a man's time, it's like taking his money. When you take a man's money, it's like taking his time. Simply put, we want something for it. If you're not interested, don't go out. Sis, hit me up. Let's clear your coochie balance. <laughs> <laughs> Do women should they still be covered by men do women need to understand what it takes for men to feel like they should be covered by men yeah absolutely like women don't value men anymore and, it, and it's evident for women to admit that they're not equal to their men women have to come to that conclusion that you are not equal to your man are you for spanking let's go around the room yes or no q are you for spanking absolutely Mange. Mm -hmm. Okay, so big kids don't get spankings. Mm, you gotta fight them, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> There's no difference between divorced women and single mothers. The man will, in both circumstances, suffer comparably with no benefit to himself. The benefits don't outweigh the cost. But not, it's still not as, it's still better to go with someone who doesn't, who hasn't gone through that. It's still better to not choose. Have men been getting over on household duties all this time? Listen, but I don't, I don't touch a trash bag to save my life. So, so let me ask you, could you and your wife switch roles and, and what you do versus what for that person hold y'all back or let y'all go? Physically can't nobody hold me back. Ain't no such thing as a fair fight. Direction, choose your own path. You know, this is the home of We Major, Me Frosty, Unfamous, and the restricted clothing brands. Let's get it. The message is always in the cloth, the colors, the designs, the fit. Basic. Pay attention. Stay alert. And remember, choose your own path. Direction, choose your own path. Don't just wear anything. Wear garments that mean something. We got hats. We got sweatshirts. We got jackets. We even got
that hoodie. Let's not forget our classic tea. Direction choose your own path. The message is always in the cloth, the colors, the designs, the fit. Basic. Basic. Stay alert. And remember, choose your own path. Yo, 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 we here, DJ Hampton Stampede, we in the building. DJ like, share, subscribe, tell a friend, tell a friend, hit that like button right now if you can. That helps the channel the most. Perfect. What's poppin'? I apologize for our late arrival. As you can see, some of the ladies are late. I was trying to wait, but it is what it is. They'll be here in a few. We're gonna get this shit popping regardless. You feel me? Perfect. Shit like that. Shit like that. Shit like that. Alex, what's good? Hey, Ham, how are you? I'm doing the right thing, you feel me? I'm trying my best. Hey, you looking like a person again, you know what I mean? Shit like that, shit like that, shit like that. Shit like that. You know what, I'm just gonna say thank you, Ham. Thank you. Uh, nah, you know what I mean? Your face, your cheekbones back showing and all that. Wow. <laughs> I'm back in the gym, I've been cleared. Thank you very much. Word? What yes. you been working on? What you been doing? You been the Stairmaster? Um, no, no stairmaster. I don't fool with that. Not at all. What you use? I do hit exercises, and then for cardio, I'm on the tread and the elliptical. Shit, hit is really good. cardio. Yeah. You keep your you keep yourself in the orange as much as possible. I don't do orange staring yet. Brother, brother, brother. You, you gotta watch, don't you? Yeah, I'll share. I'll share it with you. I'm gonna request you on the. Yeah, the share watch. with me. Key. Share with me so I can hold you accountable. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> shit like that. Shit like no that. Doubt, shit no like doubt. No doubt. Miss like Nay was goody. What's up, ladies? What's up, Ham? What's popping? How you? I'm good. I'm good. I'm excited because this week I have another book chat panel with local black authors. Shit like so that. I'm really shit excited like that. about that. Like that. Like that. Can you give us some? Um, location and something like that or what it's gonna it's gonna be at the wesleyan university bookstore in middletown huh? connecticut what time from five to eight what day thursday this week the 28th this thursday yeah you better get you some recolas i feel like you need to cough yeah i think you just need to cough <laughs> one good time i always had a raspy <laughs> voice though yeah, but it's raspy, raspy <laughs> right now. <laughs> shit like that. Shit like that. Shit like Damn, that. Lauren, you still got the book handy? I do. Oh, thank you, Lauren. <laughs> <laughs> and I got my shirt. Mm -hmm. Let me see the shirt, Lauren. Hold on. Shit like that. <laughs> shit like that. Shit like that. Shit like shit like that. Shit like that. Shit like that. <laughs> That's what's up, man. We representing. Where can they get the book at, Nay? On my website, www.shanaefulton.com. And Hank been capping? Yes, Hank did not. <laughs> I see the numbers that come in. <laughs> <laughs> salute, salute, salute. Just Jay was popping. What's good? What's good? I appreciate the invite. I'm well. How are you guys? doing good we doing good man we trying our best that's what you, you think do. you feel me what you think of the title you got something to add i don't even know just yet I... <laughs> when i got the invite i was like 
out of all the titles. Okay, let's get it. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm with it. <laughs> Damn, man. Lauren was popping. Shit like that. Shit like that. Shit like that. I took a lot of notes. You took a lot of notes. Yeah, because I was like, wait, what? How From they... your own brain? Yes, because I, I told you I have a bad memory. <laughs> you gonna ask me and I'll be like, uh, I can't think of anything. Put him in the fucking bedroom. Get him out of here. Come on. No, we're gonna try our best, man. Uh, the uh the backup should be here shortly, man. It should be a good time. You good? You you uh, y'all drinking? Y'all straight? What's up with y'all? I've been drinking. Wine Word. and water. Yeah. Wine and water over here. Or what kind of wine you be drinking, Nay? Eh? Whatever they got at the gas I'm, station? <laughs> no, I only like red wine. So you, you be on your, keep keep it real. You be on your MD shit. What's that? MD twenty twenty wild Irish rose. <laughs> That's what I got. Wild Irish rose. <laughs> no, I like, I'm, listen, I'll be some cheap stuff. It mixes stuff. well. It makes it well. Or <laughs> you drink M- mad dog? No, just a little wine cooler. Just a little wine cooler. Oh, okay. Oh. okay. Yeah, man, wine, cool, wine coolers. Are- <laughs> <laughs> Alex, you drink? I know you back drinking. You, Hamp, I don't drink. I do not drink. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You don't drink. I got you water got like- and a slushy. Oh, oh, big bad boy. <laughs> Thunderbird. Hey, Mike, go ahead. I don't drink that shit. <laughs> that shit, that, yo, back in college, that'd be the only shit that you could get real late. That right, bad right. Against it. <laughs> Damn, man. Let me see you in the chat real quick. We got 130 people in the chat. We have 50, 60 likes. So almost half. Y'all get the likes up, man. Shout out the world class. He became a member. What up, what up? Welcome to the family, my G. Oh, for all y'all country motherfuckers. Buzzing is how you say cousin if you slash C's and then he says cousin later. So as you know, if you're a member, third cousin, second cousin, first cousin, immediate family, hence the What up, buzzing, buzzing, bird, flipping, dozen, dozen. Okay. I, your boy, boy, you got your cousin, I thought that was gang related. It is. <laughs> <laughs> You were right, Lord. I, 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 I wanted to tell him or so. I wanted to tell him so. <laughs> They're going to send you to maximum security, girl. Don't get in trouble. Right. I know. <laughs> Mel was... <laughs> Mrs. Hey. JTK, Dead Pill. My Reed, what up? Tatum, I see you. Devin in the building. Jerice in the building. Almond eyes in the building. Almond eyes, you come on, you bring your ass up here. Chocolate bunny in the building. Who else we got? Alex, stay out the chat, Alex. That was earlier, Hamp. <laughs> Brave. Now we here, man. We here, man. I was just, I was just, you know what I mean? Dragging it out a little bit. Granville, what's popping? Isaiah, you already know. Jock Quinn in the building. Salute to hitting the panel earlier. Impressed. We see you. That merchandise on the way too. Victim Olympics, shout out. Travel One was popping. I think his lady died. Lady died was goody. Big bad bull in the building. All right, man, I like it. AP, appreciate you stopping through. I, Mr. Ray. All right, man, we doing good. We doing good. We doing good. 140 people in the building. We just started, man. So it's going to be a good time, man. All right. <clears throat> so Rainbow Kid was popping. Jess was popping. Yeah, they look they look decent. They look decent. That's that's the that's that's the homie. Shout out to Jess. Jess, the look, they looking real, real decent tonight, Jess. You gotta keep them humble, you know what I mean? Wapo was popping. <laughs> Yo, RBN. Said, what's up, ladies? With a ten dollar ball, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Tim was good. Damn man, Hank was popping. Lover girl was popping. How are you? All right, man, we in here. We in here on this Baltimore shit. <laughs> like, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. Hit that like button right now if you can. It helps the channel the most. <laughs> Black America said, "Crit me, I can't play." That. <laughs> shit like that. Shit like that. Put him. Put him. 
with the bacon. Damn, man. That's oh. what I love. <laughs> I know, man. I you out of here, man. Damn. All right, man. Get the likes up. 140 people in the building. We just getting it popping. So we have so many conversations in this space, right? And I'm always trying to mine them out before, during, and after the conversation. You know, there's definitely a disconnect. The young boys saying they don't know they don't cold approach anymore. Um, they say it's not worth it. There is some merit to the fact that, like, you know, with the Me Too movements and things of that nature, there's there is a perceived risk with cold approaching, right? Um, I also think with the with the plethora of cameras, I think the embarrassment of approaching a woman, getting shut down, who know who watching, who recording. I think that's probably the thing that weighs on people the most. Cause it was hard back in um me and Lauren Day just being outside without all the cameras. You feel me? What, Lauren? You ain't want me to tell everybody you was old? We're not in the same generation, though. Yes, we are. <laughs> no, we yes, are. we are. I was born. What year were you born? Lauren, what year were you born? Why we gotta why do we have to go over this? <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, so I was just looking. So I said, okay. So if men are kind of rusty on approaching for several reasons, uh, there's definitely a divide. You guys heard of the movement such as MGTOW, men going their own way. Um, you have, you guys heard of like the incel? Yeah. Right? And you have these things. I think men just don't know what to say. But there's also a sentiment out here that says, women want know they want you when you when you initially walk up to them before you say anything is that true just jay me first um i wouldn't necessarily say it's completely true what i will say is there is something to the genetics that causes a pull and attraction on on a base level okay so when so a man so if he's attractive all right so this is what this is what the sentiment is to me for me to be clear okay they say you know you're gonna give him some cheeks within the first 10 seconds of meeting them personally speaking that's not accurate okay <clears throat> uh well let, we'll dive into it but let me see lauren what do you think about that technically no we don't know that necessarily but we know we're very attracted to them physically first okay 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 alex what do you think about that sentiment i'm with lauren i'm with lauren the thought the thought is there but we're, we don't know for sure up until they go oh. ahead and they say something stupid so you saying okay so when i was outside right and some, like a woman walked by that was physically attractive right one of my first to second thought is man i would tap that ass are you do you guys have that thought no it's 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 y'all would say like, like, like oh say? dang he he looked good like in my mind it's just like oh dang he all right i see you he fine so, like it ain't like oh the things i do to you like i don't <laughs> that, so that's you not don't happening have that. in two seconds yeah, what do y'all say like, women, like, they say or beg that it might have been a I would give, give him my him number some. if he asked for it. Oh, so you don't have a I would give him some thought. No. Personally nah, speaking, no, talk not first. in no 10 seconds. Mm -mm. No. Well, okay. I'm I'm guess I'm gonna have to be um opposite of the ladies because I do. I feel like I'm gonna <laughs> trap with somebody. <laughs> Shit like that. Shit like that. Be honest. If you see if you have an attraction to them mm -hmm. automatically, you're like, damn. I would think automatically. You mean I say so right you, then and then within the so first Nay, hold on. Let's let's mind Nay out real quick. So Nay, you saying you see him like y'all give him some cheeks. Yeah, you just don't know when, but <laughs> you really attracted to them, yeah. Oh no, I damn. get it, right? There's that sexual attraction, right? I'm just saying that ain't my my thought initially, like, oh, I'm I'm gonna put that thing like I I you know what I'm saying? Like my mind ain't there, but I feel you. Like if you see somebody super attractive, like yeah, I'm not gonna deny. It. Oh, okay, yeah, he he look good. Okay. So you, don't, right, I ain't so thinking about all the things I'ma do in ten seconds. But you don't think that there may be like a guy you would look at before and say, okay, he's somebody I think I would just want to give some to because we've done that too, and this is one that like maybe I could take maybe serious. I don't know. You never had that thought. 
I don't know. I feel remedial because my mind don't my mind don't be on that. And then, like, I, I that just not that fast. I gotta hear his voice and I gotta smell some cologne. Yeah, but when you see them, yes. The oh, first oh, thing you're me, gonna you're visual me, first. You're gonna let see me dive, them. Let me dive into that. Bird finder was popping. Fifi was popping. Great tea. What up? So all right, Lauren. So you say so if he got a squeaky voice. That, yeah, that's not gonna happen. Yeah, that's a no. Okay, and then if he doesn't have cologne on, as long as he doesn't stink. Correct. Okay, so if he doesn't he stink. He could smell he like can... dove, and I'll be like, okay, he cute, okay. and he know how to take a shower. <laughs> so he cute, he know how to take a shower, and he has a regular male's voice. Do you, yeah. at that point, be like, okay, I will give him some cheeks? Now it's up to him to not mess it up. Okay. All right, so the th okay, so there's merit too. He walks up, he presents like let he just he says hello, right? And he clean like a grown up should be. At that point, as long as he don't fuck it up, he can get the cheek. So it's true to an extent then. Eventually, not like that day. Yeah, not right away. That's why I said not yeah. right away. But you'll look at them and you know that you have an attraction, and at oh, some point you are going to do it. Let, let's That's let's stop. Saying. Let's stop. Can I interject right quick? Can I yeah, say you something? can interject as soon as I finish calling Cap. Okay. Okay. Stop. Niggas could get cheeks ASAP. Stop. Y'all don't do this that, to me. Yes, that does happen, but that's not what I'm saying. Yeah. But yeah. Y'all be like, as long as it's the third day you known him, you lasted more than two days, he can get some cheeks. Stop. I mean, if we talked all day and <laughs> it didn't went into... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we done FaceTimed all day. We done went out for a full day. We done hung out. Like that's like 20 dates. So it can happen. Yeah, go. That's all I'm saying, man. Go ahead, Judge J. And you kind of summed it up for me. I, I'll just leave it short and sweet. You said what <laughs> kind of where I was headed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and then cause just say if you want him and he he vibing how you should vibe, you gonna make a reason. Okay, we FaceTime for an hour. Um, he tried to call me, but, but I didn't see him. There's a will, there's a way. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Oh, so I gotta stop. <laughs> okay. Um. Now let me ask y'all. All right, y'all could choose whether or not the end. Alice, you getting yelled at? No, he was asking something about the baby. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Kule, my brother, man, what's popping? <laughs> Oh, what's up? All right, let me. I gotta ask y'all a question slightly off the topic. No, no, it's right there. It's right there. Let's mine this out. Y'all ever gave up cheeks on the first night? Keep it real. No, I definitely got cheeks on the first night. No, yes. Now, now, let me ask y'all. Now, let me mine this out. Just because you woke up the next day and decided to give cheeks, that counts. That's still a no for me. No, I'm not knocking it, but that was never my story. Right. Lauren? One time I did. No. Stop the cap. Alex? No. Stop the cap. Just Jay? No. Stop the cap. <laughs> Whatever. Nay? <laughs> Nay? Yes. Yes. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. All right. Now, Nay, so when you met him and that happened, did he have to say the right things or you already had it in your head? I think because I was just, I was angry over <laughs> somebody else I had broken up with. So I was like, I don't care. You trying to get somebody back? That's how it felt because they was the same nationality too. So I was mad. <laughs> bodies, 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 bodies. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Like, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. Hit that like button right now if you can. That helps the channel the most. Next level was popping with the final so shout out to the ladies. Salute DJ Hint. Just Jay. Don't hold back. <laughs> I don't think she does. AP was popping. <laughs> The credits for the wonderful and beautiful Just J. Check her out, y'all. Shout shout out to the host DJ Hand. Appreciate like you. That. Shit like that.
Hank was popping with the five thousand. Nay sounded like the LGBT community <laughs> is about can't. to lose one. <laughs> Hank be out of order. No. Just me was popping with the five thousand. A woman know within a, that day if she would let him hit in the near future if he doesn't mess it up. It's not the initial thought, maybe the second thought. Okay, okay, because I guess that is the part That's of it. That's why you right? get the number. That's why you accept what they're saying to you. Okay, okay. So let's start from the top. Okay. Let's say he walks over, right? So it's the initial contact in person. What can he say that dries the vagina up? He looking good. He's smelling like Dove. He got a regular male voice. What can he say that dries the coochie up? Is that a better word? That shit sound corny as hell. <laughs> huh? What can he say? Give me an interaction that you've had in your life where he approached, he looking good, smelling good, and then he just dry the shit right up by something he say or how he does or a mannerism. Give us the game, man. I don't like when niggas pop their lips. Break it down. That 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 you know, you know how we be like women be talking and our lips like pop like like the ghetto pop. Not that one's extra loud, but any kind of pop, any kind of do it. Yeah, I don't know what you mean. Go ahead, do it. What she she kind of showed you, but it's just a lower volume. You feel oh me? God. Like if if he's doing a lot with his lips, or if they like got way too much chapstick, I, it's, I was, it, ooh, yeah, I was gonna say that lips can't anything. be shiny. Like it's just certain stuff. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. what's happening here? Then it's gonna take too much time to try to start assessing what like, it, it, it take a lot of energy, a lot of brain power. So when he first approached, too much chapstick, or he like doing what though? Popping his lips. Like, say a sentence and pop your lips so we can understand. Do it, Nay. You could do it on command. I can't do it on command. I have to be in a mood. Like, Nay, say, Please. hey, how are you? And then add the pop so we can understand. Hey, how are you? <laughs> <laughs> he better not do that. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, so popping his lips. He come up with greasy lips. So that's before he even say anything. Um, are you speaking to mannerism, just Jay? Yeah, for the most part. Is you, are you speaking to like effeminate mannerisms? I guess that's what it'll be considered as, generally speaking. So, what if he got his hand on his hips? Mm, no. What if he's sitting? Let's say he's come sit next to you, and he crosses legs at the ankle or the knee. There's levels to this hand. Knee. Do we got on a suit? Uh, it's a it's a See, lounge. I so think too much. I think too much. It's an after work attire, so maybe a suit, maybe cat. You know, you got your tie off and shit like that. It depends on how refined he is. If he's on, you know, classic man type vibe, and he me. crosses his legs at the knee, cool. But no, no, a regular like me, dude, like me, like me. No, no, you crossing your leg at the knee? No, I'm good. <laughs> So, no. so if he got that, if he has like that, that I don't know, I don't have a better example, but like a Kevin Samuels like type of vibration. Yeah, like, I probably let that slide. You feel me? Like a more refined, you know, polished look. I, I, I might let that slide. You feel me? But like a regular, like regular dude. I don't mean regular, but just you, you get me. Nah, not really. What the hell are you trying to say? <clears throat> A dude that's not as refined or polished crossing legs at the knee would be a no for me. I can use big words and speak well if I please. This is true, but you're not up here with a whole full suit on. If you were sitting right here with this hoodie on and you cross your legs at the knee with, with, with what you got on, I've seen mm -hmm. you clean up nice. If you was in a lounge or something, y'all over there puffing cigars and all this kind of stuff, and you cross your legs at the knee, I, I might, it's levels to it. That's all I'm saying. I, I don't want to draw it out. I'm just saying it's levels. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Lauren, give me something. He woke up. He, 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 he looks the part. He smells the part. What can he say? What can he do that drives the vagina all the way up? <clears throat> First thing is breath. 
Because if you hear me with that, hey, how you doing? And it's hot. Mm-mm. Why he got so much Mm-mm. H in this shit? It, it, hey. the, the people with the funky breath always got the hard H's. Is it? Yeah, and it be warm. <laughs> mm. Damn. Mm-mm. So they be like, hey, yeah. how long have you been here? Like they just do yeah, all it's like, mm. And you could be okay. fine. And I'm still going to be like, nah. Because you should have known. You now, smelled Lauren, that before I smelled that. Uh, fair. Now, what if he had like French onion soup? Is that is that breath like okay? You just ate something, but you know how some people breath stink. No, you can tell, what. yeah, yeah. So like that, it's tart, a different like from the stomach shit. Is that the one that like you I, said, remember being, you I remember being? I remember being at the club, and this mm-hmm. dude's breath smelled like pork and beans. And I asked him, "Did you just eat pork and beans?" And he was like, "How did you know?" It was concerning. Mm. Okay, so so is that the vagina dryer? Or is it the one where you know it's coming from their stomach? Mm. Both. It, I don't, if I can smell it, period, and it's not like minty or just fresh, then it's a problem. Because you came into a club. <laughs> it, the worst mm-hmm. it should smell is alcohol. I shouldn't be able to tell what you ate okay. or the fact that you haven't ate all day. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Okay. 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 All right. So bad breath. Okay. Bad breath. I, I can understand that. But the game, though, let's get into the game. So the mannerisms, I think, are a part of the game. I think you got to be aware of what you just eat and things of that nature, you know? Like, if I just came from eating, I would probably take a shot because that's more acceptable smell. You know what I'm saying? If you get too close. But what about the game, though? What have you heard upon first approach that it just put the dryer on your vagina? Uh, Tell me about your job or car or where you live. Talking down on people that don't live in the same area that you live in too early, like that bothers me. All right, let's do let's role play. All right, you approach Alex and be the guy that's talking about his car in his house. Go ahead. Hello, gorgeous boy. Hey, I'm good. I was just I'm, in no, the why? area. Oh, yeah. Why she roll her eyes? See, see, that's the problem. See, that's why niggas don't approach you. I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why. Because that hello gorgeous right there is also a turn off. Like, stop. That's right, how they always come turn. though. It's always hey, it ain't your turn. No, no, Lauren, don't let her fuck your game up. It ain't your turn. I'm not. We role playing, right, play right? Go ahead, Lauren. Hey, how are you? I'm okay. <clears throat> you look amazing tonight. What brought you out here? Thank you. I'm out celebrating my homegirl's birthday. Oh, okay. So what y'all gonna be doing tonight? Just y'all just gonna stay here? Y'all going somewhere else? Yeah, we're just here. Okay. Well, I was I've been out all day, so this is like the first club I've been to, and the people here is just ridiculous. And you can tell they from the south side, and I just I can't get with it. They just it's trash people. And I just I when I saw you, I was like, she in out of place too. So let me go talk to her, see how she doing. Wait. Why don't we go somewhere else? I know a spot that we can go to where it's nice. We can sit down and talk. We can have another drink. What you think? No, I'm good. I'm here with my girls. We came together. We leave together. I'm okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, Lauren, look at that. was just terrible, though. <laughs> that was good. Hey. I'm not used to talking to number pizza. Oh, I was watching the show. Hey, look, right, right, right. Hey, look though. She tried to give you the short answer, right? The short, like, and you never stop when they trying to give you that short bullshit. You feel me? You got to at least do two or three more lines. But you saying the one that may annoy you is they talk about the niggas in the club, they better than, essentially. Uh-huh. You did good, Lauren. Hey, well, why are you here? If you are at this club and it's ratchet, why are you here? <laughs> right. Yeah. And what do, why do you think they do that, Lauren? What do you what does that say to you when they get that approach? They're trying to make it seem like I'm I shouldn't be here. Like you're better than this. Why are you in here? And that's why I chose mm-hmm. you because you look like you're above it. And it's like, no, I'm here because I'm ratchet. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> no point. I want to hear the music. <laughs> like like yeah, this there's, like there's always times you go out where you want to hear and be around what you want to be around, period. You know right. what I'm saying? Um you know, uh, when I go home, there's a club called the park where you got to dress up when I since I don't live in D.C. anymore. Very seldomly do I DJ there because everybody can't just get in and have a good time. You know what I'm saying? You got to be mm-hmm. in the mood for that shit. 
you know so okay so that yeah that that like um would you consider that a level of dirty macking yes y'all know what dirty macking is so that would be dry dirty macking what yeah what's dirty macking i didn't think yeah so essentially like talking down on niggas around you or somebody who involved to try to squeeze your way in so i guess it would be kind of like a dry dirty mac a little bit Hmm. Yeah, cause it's not an, it's not anyone in particular. Mm-hmm. But it's just like I'm better than these niggas, so right, you know. <clears throat> okay, okay, okay. So you saying you want them to be humble? No, just don't talk about nobody else. Like uh, you came over here to present you, so talk about you. Yeah. Not how you better than other people. Yeah. Okay. 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 And have nice oh. breath. <laughs> shit like that shit like that shit like that shit alex like that. Shit like that. so that yeah. first approach man yeah like what's the, what what just turned you off man if we're going on the lauren scenario right the hey gorgeous is just so just a stop just say hey how you doing and then you can give the compliment after the fact oh you look real nice tonight so forth and so forth but it just it's given like you're trying too hard like just be casual so if you, what if you say time. well let's run through them Hey, gorgeous. Yes, no. No. Hey, sweetheart. Absolutely not. Oh, toots. No. Oh, it's hey. How you how doing? About, it's getting worse. How about hey love? Like how about hey love? No. Hey ma. No. Honestly, excuse for me, it depends. Hold on, hold on, just Sam. I'm running through. Excuse me, miss. That's a little better. I like that one. That's exactly what I was I gonna like say. That. <laughs> that nigga don't listen to hip hop. I don't even know where I got that from. You don't even know where so I got that. From. To try. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so excuse me, miss. How about ma'am? No, don't ma'am me. Well, can he say pardon me? You could say yes. pardon me. Okay. So damn. So um so sweetheart, gorgeous. How about shorty? Oh no! Back uh, in the day, but no. This Alex, hold on, Alex. Yeah, let's let we gonna bring the ratchet out this nigga. So shorty, so shorty works, huh? I may hear what you're trying to say back back then, but not now. How about your? <laughs> no, him, absolutely not. <laughs> That's how he was doing in New York. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so so you just want to be approached like. How you doing? Your name is X Y Z. Yeah, just be casual. What about the um order of which? So does he? Can he come over? What if he asks you for your name before he give you his? Does that matter at all? No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. But you're coming over to me, so I would anticipate that you would introduce yourself. Hey, how you doing? I'm so and so. What's your name? Yeah. Now, what about this? Hey, how you doing? I'm DJ Hamp. Okay. Uh, um, I might, um, I might, um, but, but let me say that. Let me back up though. You didn't need to give me your title. You didn't need to give me your title. So, so you saying you were looking him funny if he said I'm Doctor Watson? Yeah, like I'm stop. Like don't MD, do MD. Don't do it. Don't okay. do it. Just be casual. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, okay, okay. Because the, the surprise is, let's say, for example, we're out, right? And mm-hmm. you come up and you, you know, like you're the DJ, right? And you're like, oh, what's up? I'm Hamp. Yada, yada. Okay, hello. And then you leave and you go on about your business. And then I see you over there in the booth. Like, oh, that's the dude that's trying to talk to me. He's a DJ. It gives a different vibe. It's a different yeah, level I'll... of confidence. Because when you go ahead and you have to automatically go with your title, that tells me you're trying to sell that. I don't, I don't need that. Okay, so you think they're using the title of leverage getting the vagina? Mm-hmm. Yep. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right, all right. Nay, I know you know, I know it's a different game for you now, but from what you can remember, <laughs> it still happens though. <laughs> okay, okay. So, that first approach, what's your turn off? I'm not gonna lie, your walk. As you're walking over to me, I'm looking at the walk. I've had a guy approach me. His feet was like curved in. He was pigeon toe, And I was like, mm-mm. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, no. Um, mm. Even your voice. 
I, like your voice can't be like all high pitch. Like I had a guy. What if he? What if he walking like this, man? Oh, jeez. <laughs> 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 How about that one, <laughs> but what if he coming over dancing though? You feel me? Like he dancing towards you. What? Why are you putting on a show? Just walk. Just walk <laughs> over. Like, Skip to my Lou might be on though. Oh lord. Okay. Well, I, I do on, like to dance too. So yeah, I like to dance too. So I might join in and dance <laughs> with you if I think you're attracted. So I'm done. Yeah, done that. I mean, what, so you don't think that'd be turn off? Cause look, this, look at this shit. There's no way you can't yeah. be. <laughs> yeah, you're right. See, you you're gotta right. put it in perspective. Now, what if he? Yeah. <laughs> now, what is now, that? What... Huh? What was that's, that? That's Skip to my loo. Now, now, what if he doing this though when he come over, man? <laughs> we be crip walking when he go over. Oh, man, not the crip they walk. They both have a dance <laughs> battle out there. <laughs> not the crip walk. No. Knocking eyes with somebody. <laughs> not the crip walk. Mm-mm. Oh, man. You know, yeah, I guess you could say like that dancing part because I like to dance too. So mm, I might I might yeah. join in and dance with you. Yeah. Okay. All right. So that, that could be a cool approach. Yeah. That, that could be a cool okay. approach. Um, okay. Once he opens his mouth again, his voice like I had a guy talk to me with a high pitched voice and it irritated my whole soul and I couldn't do it. Then I, I had another guy that had a lisp and I was like, oh my god, I can't. It drew me crazy. It's like it's, I <laughs> <laughs> Did you ask him to say sucker, suffering, suffer, sucker tash? No. Anytime you meet somebody with a lisp, ask him to say that. Oh my god, it just drove me crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, man. <laughs> Ro, what's popping? What's up? Ro, what do you think about the pickup lines? Do pickup lines dry up vaginas? Yes, I was just talking to a male friend about this. Mm -hmm. It does. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, well, so like, which one? Like, what if I came over? Like, I noticed you noticing me. That's different. Is that a pickup line or is that just him saying, I noticed you noticed me? That's a pickup line for sure. Is it? Because I could very well be looking at him and he could see that I saw him. But it's a lot like, you know, um, like he could say, I saw you from across the room or he's like, I noticed you noticing me. And I just want you to let you know that I noticed you too. Okay. Well, you take it that far. Yeah. But if he says, hi, I noticed that, you. Hold on, hold on, bro. But, but that one work though, what you're saying. <laughs> you like that one. That would work. Yeah. Uh, slip and slide time. Right. No, nigga. Ain't no <laughs> wow. So what's the what's the vagina dryers, man? Tell us those. Dry humor. You think you're being funny? That's not gonna work. All right, let's do this. Let's role play. Use your dry humor approach on just Jay. Let me see how it go. You the guy. How you doing, Queen? Hi, how, how are, are you? you? good you know that rap on your head has me thinking about you rapping on me all day <laughs> put, put him in the fucking bedroom get that him out of here come on that dude right there is gonna think he hitting on something and she's like what? And you see the look on my face right like, exactly <laughs> that's funny people be saying shit like that Hell yeah, that'd be, be wild with it. It's, it's it's interesting. It's interesting for sure. And I was thinking yeah. that earlier when you were talking about the names, right? Because sometimes you know I, I I would get you know whenever I go to my city and stuff. Hey Empress, hey Queen, uh, Mother of the Nile, and I'd be like, dude, like come on, man, like what is it? Like come on, man, stop. You ever get with the hey brown skin? I ain't got that in a long time. It's, it's been almost 10 years since I got that, though, to be honest with you. But, yeah, it's always that 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 weird one. And don't get me wrong. I, I Like, it, it depends what I was saying earlier. It, for me, it's whether or not it's genuine. You know what I'm saying? If it's authentic to the person, like their personality. Because you, for me, I could kind of gauge whether or not it's a part of somebody's personality or if they just accustomed to saying stuff like that just because, you know, if that makes sense. 
Okay. Because some people are just complimentary, like just on GP. You know what I'm saying? So. Yeah. Um. So compliments are are those still okay? Or we can't tell you how to smile? I thought right. Y'all don't like that. Well, it'd be the energy behind people telling them. This. Why are you telling strangers to smile for what? Mm. So, do should men lead with compliments on the first approach? I just <clears throat> say, just introduce yourself and go from there. For me, yeah. like I, I'm not, honestly, I'm not complicated. <laughs> I'm not complicated I, at all. I just told one of my male friends. I said, just keep it simple and direct with your mm-hmm. intention. You don't have to do the dry humor. You don't have to do the hey queen. You just just hide. If it's I extra, would... it just hit different. It get weird yeah. when it's extra. Mm-hmm. Range with the two says, "Hey, he said, hey, how about hey, my weakness? Red flag, run. <laughs> how about this one? Homeboy with the five dollars says, "What's good, Hampton and ladies? Lauren, you got a beautiful smile. Does beautiful smile work? That's cute." <laughs> Alex, how about this with the two dollars? I'm approaching Alex because I can make her laugh. Is that is that that works? Humor is good. Humor is good. On first approach, humor works. You gotta be yeah. a good comedian. You can't you can't think you're funny, and no one's ever told you you're funny. Okay, 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 okay. Matt with the five dollars. It's all in how you say hi and what and what your smile make her feel like. Then be smooth or be funny. Feel the vibe. Yeah. Hmm. Read the room. Hmm. Okay. The best like ones your- to me, honestly, is when they start talking. They just start having a conversation with you like you already know them. Hmm. It's so- warm and inviting. It's not, that's what I mean, like the whole authenticity, like uh, like being authentic. Like you ain't got to try extra hard. It just kind of flows. It's not him second guessing himself, him trying to figure out what to say next so I could get the draws and whatever. Like he just being who he is. Like I can appreciate that with anybody, just presenting as who you are. Okay. Okay. So just Jay, what if I walked up? I'm like, uh, like, I'm like, I think your outfit's decent. Is that a compliment? Decent is a weird word. I just don't even understand what we're doing. <laughs> Like what's happening? Like, what's what if I was like, Judge, I, hey Ma, I kind of, I kind of like your outfit a little bit. Oh, okay. I wouldn't, I wouldn't have wore the black pants with it, but it's decent. Right. Okay. Well, you know what? I, I kind of like it too. And I'm walking while I'm saying it. Yes, you can be funny and being an asshole, hmm. but it would work. Hmm. Would it though? Yeah. You might engage in conversation because you'd be like, wait, what? No, I just said I was walking off while I said thank oh, you for I your am. input. What are you doing? <laughs> I was already walking off. <laughs> Appreciate it. <laughs> and then I'm like, whenever I'm walking off and he passed me, my eyes like, what the fuck is that? And I'm going to the car. Like, mm, 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 I guess, mm. again, it depends, right? Because you could tell when a dude trying to like be humorous and he just trying to crack a little joke. Like, you could pick up the vibe if he trying to crack a joke versus like, you know, the way you said it, I'm, the way my brain work and life experiences, <clears> I'm, I'm kind of on alert. Like my little hyper vigilance is kicking in because you just it's kind of weird. Like, what are we doing? Especially if I'm in a parking lot. Like, do I need to take evasive action? Like, what is we doing right now? Jesus Christ. No, so I'm we got to navigate. You, said it. you didn't say it like Wait. you were joking. So we got to navigate. Just up. Weird. But think about this though. And we you talking about drying up vagina. That's that's dick softener. That we gotta we gotta fuck it. We gotta navigate our PTSD. There is a level of inflection that I didn't get with what you said. With what you said, I'm trying to figure out if you possibly smoke Sherm or not. Like, I'm not sure what we're doing. <laughs> Sherm. <laughs> I love that word. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> Yo, like, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. That would be a term from the late oh. I love that word. I love that word. Sherm and John Tucky is two of my favorite old words. But anyway, let's go. So, so what, what I'm what I'm discerning is right. Should people be themselves overall? And if you like them, you like them. I um, agree to that. Yes. Would you say don't do too much? Be confident in what is it you're saying. Um, should you know what you want to ask or talk about, or or should you let it flow? Like, do you need to go with some type of game plan at least? I say flow. Hmm. I say now, just would be it, direct. 
Okay, but what if they're doing like what Alex was doing to Lauren, where she was being kind of short? I'm here with my friends for a birthday. It almost is assuming like she only there because she have to be. How do you overcome that? Do you need to just let her ride? You think? She doesn't seem like she wanted to engage, in my opinion. So yeah, I would have left her alone. Just be out of there. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Should he? Could he? Could should he resort to offering drinks? After the the engagement that they had, like after, yeah, yeah, you know, like he come over, and he noticed you, y'all noticing each other, X, Y, and Z. Um, he get the vibe, like okay, he didn't off put you. Should the drink be the next step? I'm not. I, I, I I'm I'm not the one to ask for that. To me, to me, if you offer a drink, you know what I'm saying. Like if you gonna you, you could use it as a closer. You know, like in Alex's case, right? When Lauren approached her and she really wasn't vibing. Oh, okay. Would you like something to drink or whatever? Okay, I have it sent over. All right, you take care of yourself. Da da da. And, and he going about his business. And sometimes that will intrigue a woman. You feel me? Or mm -hmm. if you're just using it to further open up communication, if she's already shown interest to me, that would you know, kind of make it a little bit more you could build on it is what i'm saying okay yeah okay let me see just me with the two dollars says they say it i realize i'm frowning it make me laugh <laughs> yeah people would be having that grizzly on their face from time for sure zo was popping with the father says showing up because i see just jay and lauren on the panel salute matt p with the father says just jay i like i like your hostility it matched good with mine what's your instagram <laughs> Shit like, that. Shit like that. Yo. Shit like that. Um, okay, okay. So <clears throat> there's a there's a fact out there statistically, people drink more when the club removes the seats. So up north, oftentimes you'll see them take the seats out so people can have more room to drink. You can also access the bar easier without people sitting in the way, right? Mm -hmm. But people generally feel uncomfortable standing without a drink in their hand mm. so if you reflect back to when you was outside think about it you just standing in the middle of a club you know what i'm saying without a drink in your hand people are like like conscious about this um so if you knowing that information does it make sense to um increase the level of comfortability by simply say hey let's go drink get a drink or something you know what i'm saying I think I know y'all. I'm, I'm I'm not a big drinker. Like the times I've gone out in the past, again, listen. See, you gonna see. I already see where this is going. But I don't like leaving drinks around. I don't like nursing drinks. You feel me? Like the times I've gone now, I'll I, I'll take about two shots and I'm leaving. Like because I ain't got time to be holding stuff. But I'm also the person. Whenever I used to go out, if they playing music, I'm the person tamp when you up there on the little turntables and stuff i'm the person that's leaving when the music stops because i'm dancing so but that's me yeah yeah no nah, facts okay okay <clears throat> yeah no nah, they they never thought through this right Devin? <laughs> okay okay all right so let's say he get past first base first base meaning you know he he approach you is that considered court or date like what what is it approach i guess right that's what it would be so he get the number, right? And let's say y'all kicking it. So now you dating. Is that is this dating according at this point? First date. Dating. <clears throat> it's dating. That's the before courting. Dating before courting. Okay. So courting is, a, is is initiating the marriage. marriage. <clears throat> okay. So dating. First date. What are the turnoffs there? So he he broke past the barrier. Now it's the first date. What if he asked to go? Well, y'all, let me know. What have you experienced? You were like, vagina done dried the fuck up. Talking about their ex or their baby mama. Constantly. Mm. Invite me to your house. That going like this. Yo, you got it? I had that. <laughs> Wearing dirty clothes. Oh, <laughs> clothes ain't oh. iron. Mm. I do funny. notice wrinkles now. I didn't used to notice that before. But I notice <clears> it now. Oh, wow. Don't care how you look. Just coming out to look any kind of way. Mm. 
What else? We need to know. <clears throat> Honestly, it's just getting too comfortable too early. Like, just wanting to hang. Like, you want to go somewhere and just at my house or your house. I think that's weird. You don't know if I'm crazy. And I don't know if you're crazy. So let's let's keep it right. casual. And we'll meet places. And I can see your car. You can see my car in a license place now. Like <laughs> I don't want nobody <laughs> seeing my car early. Just, I don't yeah, like people picking your, me up you, either. Yeah, Over-exaggerating what stay you your have. Yep. Over-exaggerating what you have. <laughs> yeah, just I'm inside. So no reggae cold. club. Hey, I'm just saying. <laughs> Don't pick me yeah. up. I'll meet you. Yeah, Judge, Judge Jay got to stay inside for a little bit. Yeah, Amen. Chill. I agree. Amen. You, Amen. You just, on, just be on Tinder. Oh, no. <laughs> so, Listen, I lasted less than 24 hours on Tinder. I was scared. Yeah. It looked like a whole channel ID channel episode. Mm-mm. It was scary. <laughs> nope. I'm good. I stay in the house. I take your advice. Amen. Indeed. <laughs> so... So what like what happens on these first dates? Give us more, man. We're trying to understand. There's obviously a disconnect, right? So help us understand when he broke past the barrier, got the number, was able to approach. He overcame his fears. Now, first date time. What dries up the vagina? Talking too much about sex, like your first date. Like, that's some crazy. Yeah. Very strange. Yeah. He's talking about sex it's on awkward. the first date. You said what? They yeah. make everything sexual, like just all the sexual innuendos and just, just <clears throat> it, it, like you can't even say cookie. You can't even say, oh, they have little sausages or something. Like everything just nasty. It's weird. It's weird. Yeah. Strange. I had a dude send me a pic and it was only maybe 48 hours since I met him. I was like, okay, no. Right. And you're trying to figure out what happened. Like, did I, I, I know I didn't ask. What did I like, say? What did I do? Did I, did I get a sick <laughs> list? Cause I had some weird stuff happen. You feel me? And I was questioning my own self. Like, okay, wait a minute. What did I do? Did I send some kind of signal? And then I was like, I was feeling away. Cause I'm like, okay, that wasn't my intention. So now I'm like replaying the whole interaction. Cause I'm trying to figure out what did I do that, that, that possibly gave this person the green light to like, cause we weren't even on that. We weren't flirting. We weren't like, and then stuff just be happening, and it's 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 scary. Yeah, yeah we was just talking about music. Just being direct and blunt about what they want. It's scary. Uh, Way they do what, Nay? I said they just being direct and blunt about what they want. So they coming out and saying like the most. They doing the absolute. If y'all talking about grits and eggs, and then that just fly <laughs> out. That that's scary. That is scary. Yeah. Let the beat right. build. I'm like Lil Wayne. What is going on? <laughs> <laughs> so. All right, give me more. Like, okay, so they be saying the wrong shit, talking about sex. Did somebody mention them talking about like what is it? Their accomplishments or what they do for work? Like, is that a turn? Is no, that yeah, not, they over exaggerate. Like, they, <laughs> you know, I got, you know, I do crypto and I made a million dollars. And you know, I, I don't like, like numbers. That's, that's tacky. Stuff. Yeah, that's. Stuff I don't right care there. less what they do. Like, I don't, especially on the first few days. Like, I don't care what you do. What's your schedule like? <laughs> what you mean? What are your hours? I just need to know what your hours are. So I know when we can chill, we can hang. Oh, and I don't care what females. you actually do. Bashing females. You're with me on a date and you're bashing females. Red pill talk. Now I haven't Red experienced pill. that yet. That's crazy. Mm. So what you saying? He like women should be in the house cooking and cleaning? Like he giving no, you what he No, 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 not that. It's y'all women always do A, B, C, D, F, and G. Oh, yeah. That type of conversation. Mm. It's a first date. You don't know me. We just right. met, obviously, you know, that type of conversation. So he be you like, you like, oh, I just want to He be talking to you like you the one called the police on him, bro. Like, I, like, like, exactly. you're not, like you the one put him on child support. Like, you like, I, okay, I, is you blacking I, out I, right I, now? I, like, what's I, happening? I, exactly. I didn't exactly. do it, baby. It wasn't that me. Conversation. How about phones? I didn't do it, baby. You said what? How about phones? Like being on their phones while they at the table with you? Maybe checking it, having the phone on the table. Is that a deterrent mm-hmm. at all? That that is, yeah. but you know what I noticed? <laughs> I've I've only had dudes do that if they might see me do it. I've never, but I try not, you know, I don't I try not to do that because that's rude. 
But if okay. they do that, I've never really had one do it unless they see me doing it and it's okay. What if he were to like like ask you, you let's say you look at the menus, right? And he asks you what you want, right? And you say it to him. And then the waiter comes and he ordered for both of y'all. I think that's sexy. I actually had a man do that. The lady asked me what I wanted. I never been there before. He's been there before. I, you know, he was like, "Don't worry about it. I'll, I'll order it for you." And he ordered the drink. Okay, y'all cool with that too? Yeah, absolutely. My dad used to do that. He told us that's how men supposed to do. So yeah, I like hmm. it. So he asked like you for your order, and then you, he says it yeah. to the person. Oh okay. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Now and now, if and I thought he was just was, ordering for you because I had a bad experience with that. I've I've had somebody yeah. do that before. Yeah, I'm now, not if, a person ordering for me, but I'm not a particular <clears throat> person when it. I mean, if you have anyway, go ahead. You got it. Well, just thinking in terms of roast, you're like, oh, I don't, I can't decide. I've never been here. You know, that might be because it's a drink. You know, in terms of yeah, food, I like I think that. Inside. What about? I had a dude order my food, and I was like, that's not what I want. So. Oh. First date, yeah, we was at a steakhouse and I said I wanted salmon. And they said, This is a steakhouse, you're supposed to eat steak. And I said, Oh, I uh, want salmon. That's a no, that's no, because you already said what you wanted. It'd be different if you didn't say, hmm. but you said so. Yeah, he out of order. Or, yeah. Lord, what, if First he, what, if he, what if he said, I recommend you get the steak? I know you want salmon. If he would have said that, I would have tried it. Okay. I like, right. I love steak. I just didn't what want steak because I just had steak. <laughs> so. What if, said, what if he said just trust me he could have worded it differently yeah well on the first date just trust me see that's that's mm -hmm. what get a lot of us in trouble that's why we be crying in the car that just sounds strange <laughs> what <laughs> okay never mind him you told me stay in the house yeah. i'm sorry <laughs> you got too many goddamn <laughs> 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 yeah it's a steakhouse so but i would have done said it, just trust me like, yeah, that's sexy. That. You don't think that's sexy, what? Jay? I think that that's you know, not on the first what? date. Trust Why not? I would, I would definitely do that. trust. Is, it's a lot. It's just a lot. I'm gonna stay in the house. I'm gonna stay in the house. I'm gonna get this work ham. I'm gonna stay in the house. <laughs> now you can't order my temperature though. You could pick the steak, but I'm gonna. I know my temperature. Your temperature, so. but there are Who's recommended that? temperatures based on the cut too. Whose idea was it to go to the steakhouse? He he picked the place. He told you to pick I didn't even want to go there because I know I didn't like the steak there. I don't like root Chris steak. I was like, give me a salmon. Oh, oh. Yeah, root Chris steak. Oh, yeah, this salmon is good. You ready? <laughs> yeah, to give me the salmon. That's why she was salty. Okay, because the salmon real good. See, I ain't never had it, so I don't know. Okay, so, yeah. okay, okay. That's why I'm she a was steak salty. eater. I, I'm a beef eater, so I try. I that sounds weird. Yeah, that sounds wild. Wow. Um, but, yeah. Texas, you were really you supposed to say Paul's. No, Lauren, you were supposed to say No, I'm not. That's a man. It is, you're what? but the way hold he on, just did on, that. Hold on, Judge Jay. You a what now? What'd you say? I, I like uh cows. <laughs> Shit uh, like that. She's a boat, she's a boat <laughs> buying eater. So what if he has uh religious dietary restrictions and he would know, put that on you on the first date? Mm -hmm. I'm okay with that because I have certain things I can't eat, so I'll be all right with that. <laughs> so, what if he put his 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 boundary with the like his religious views? He like, listen, I'm paying for this. Unfortunately, I can't order you this, but these are options. It's certainly open. Okay, cool. What's up? So what yeah. you eat? Kosher, halal? What 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 what's your dietary restrictions? And then for me, that's just a conversation because I like different cultures. So mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah, I wouldn't mind it. Oh. Okay. All right. So not 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 too difficult. Not too difficult. Nay, you you would you be okay with that? What him choosing the food for me? You gotta read what you said. You sitting right there. But I didn't hear what you said. You like he has some a religious belief that restricts, like let's say shrimp. But I still go. I mean, yeah, you can still go to a place. You just gotta be specific and let um and let the waiter know. No, no, he would. So you eat shrimp, right? In this hypothetical, however, his religion says he can't eat shrimp, and therefore you couldn't eat shrimp on this particular date. 
Mm. I like shrimp, so I gotta change my. <laughs> I gotta change my diet. Potentially. Uh-huh. Uh-uh. The assumption is that you guys are dating intentionally, right? I mean, yeah, but. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Well, you dating intentionally, you, know, you dating just to get some yes, cheap. Yes, you are dating intentionally, but I don't feel like I should have to change that like automatically for somebody that I just went out with. Like maybe give me well, time. He's, well, he's mm-hmm. saying that vegan? you know. Well, that wouldn't be see that the basis is different there. So that's why yeah. I specifically said like religious, right? Because it would be a little bit deeper, more important, you know. Um, so you would say, nah, I'm eating shrimp, my nigga. No, I mean, I'm not saying that like that. <laughs> no. I mean, I would, I'll be empathetic to the fact that you have that going on, but I shouldn't have to be forced to not eat something. I mean, if it's inhaled, obviously, if, I, if something, he's inhaling it, but if I'm like touching the food, is it going to affect him? Yeah. Yeah. Then if, if it's something that like he's allergic, like just by touch or something, yeah, I wouldn't eat that around. No, it's him. not allergic. It's not allergic. For religious beliefs. Yeah. Am I lost? Yes, but yeah, that, so that's like normal. He, that's, he does not believe it. Bro, 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 you know it's Nate. Don't want, about, like, it. I thought I said like allergic. Nate get confused anyway, so just everybody just oh slow down God. for a second. Everybody just breathe. Nay, over here. As a matter of fact, watch out, Judge Jay. So, <laughs> <laughs> so he can't touch it. You touching it, touching him, him ordering it for you. He'll get in trouble in his religion, right? I'll just put it like that. Okay, I'm thinking of um, allergy. Yeah, I mean, I guess. I guess. Yeah. No, 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 no. Hold on. Good God. I'm Lord, like, what are you asking? Are you being serious right now? Yes, what are you asking? It, it's, it, it's not allergies, okay? No, now it's not allergies. That's why I said I thought that you were referring to allergies. Now you're just talking Are you about trolling me? I'm are not. Trolling? Oh, my gosh. Go ahead. Jesus Christ, man. Put him in the fucking <laughs> bathroom. Get him out of here. Come on. All right. So so boasting and bragging, right? About what you do. Um, how do you guys? This is actually a great question. So staying on the first date, right? Obviously, you're trying to get to know him. Devin with the two dollars says, What does socially awkward look like to y'all? I'm interested in that. Was that your question? Yeah. So I'm still I'm, my mind is still on this first date, right? Because the first approach, it may be limited words, it may just be a physical attraction. So you, that may not be revealed, right? Unless he's walking over pigeon toe, like when they said, just on some wishes. But that first date, obviously, you'll get to know a little bit more of the personality, how they move, their cadence, etc. So what does that look like when so somebody is socially awkward? Because again, the boys today they play video games, right? women aren't aren't a high super high priority they trying to get their money up whatever the case is so i think and then because of social media i think socially awkward is probably at an all-time high you know without these keyboards and shit like that so what does that look like in real life what does a socially awkward person look like lack of eye contact hands in the pockets maybe stuttering over your words yeah. shaking yeah speaking at a low tone shaking. What are y'all talking about? Not not Michael J. Fox. What the, fuck? <laughs> what the hell? Shaking? What the fuck? Yes. Well, he, he's stuttering. Is he allowed to be nervous or niggas can't get nervous? No, because that means that you're not confident when you're approaching. Like, what are you stuttering for? Shiver me timbers, face ass. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So, so when I play, you know, I got, you know, football makes sense for every situation. It's a great analogy uh, concept. Every game I used to get butterflies, but I knew I could ball and other team knew I could ball too, but I would still get butterflies before the game and I was used to it. But you didn't show it him. Okay. Well, so well, she yeah, awkward, so she awkward would be in football terms. Your head is down. You don't want to go out there. And then when it's time to make the play, you're standing still like, what do I do? That's they something. ain't even got that far because they're scared to get hit. Right. So they didn't <laughs> ran they didn't ran to the sidelines. Everybody was blink. making the play. And he can't even blink. <laughs> <laughs> no blinking. He awkward no, if he blinks. Like, I thought I was going to be dry. What is going on? 
Man, I'm gonna stare I'm at you gonna... more if you're not making eye contact. Yeah, Make it awkward. I, Zoe made a good point, but we talking about socially awkward. Like, would you say that like stuttering is like an impediment? Um, he's shaking. That's just that's super duper nervous. But like, like socially awkward. Do you guys see it? You know it when you see it. Like for instance, okay, you guys watch the show, right? If you guys are not on it, <laughs> that gas. Yes. What the fuck just talking about? <laughs> Just be wild, but that's the whole bit. So nah, man, just it's a football game, god damn it. Um, so like uh okay, let's use people on the panel. Have you guys seen a scam likely on the panel? Yeah, yes. And I think he's like putting on kinda, but usually over here he has more serious conversation, but he delivers information in a little bit of different way, you know what Very I'm saying? Animated. <laughs> kind of but it's corny too you know how he be yeah. doing the voices and shit mm -hmm. would, would that be socially awkward for me it's not because it's it's authentic to who he is but I, 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 I've I known Scam for a couple years as well so maybe that adds a bit of context for me but he can still be I awkward even though we accept it awkward, but... right right yeah, so even if it's him, you could be socially awkward, and that's that is what I, would, I find him more quirky. Mm -hmm. That's that makes sense. That would be just Jay. I, I would venture to say that's slightly semantics. Awkward, okay, quirky. I feel you. you know what I'm saying? Those are like I can synonyms. see. I can see. I got you. Yeah. yeah. So would that be a good example? Like, do you guys see that? How I'm seeing it? And I, and, yeah. and I, I, I fuck with skin. Like I like. You know what I mean? He had, yeah. he was doing. He was spitting some shit today, right? But just using him as an example of somebody who I know ain't sensitive. You know what I'm saying? Um, I can't think of anything for men that's socially awkward. Besides just being quiet. Unnecessarily quiet. Socially <laughs> awkward, yes. Quiet or timid. Mm. Like timid where, you know, you're talking. You are talking more than they are. <clears throat> or if, you know, if the waiter, like I said, the difference between the man deciding on the drink and then he's just sitting there you don't know he don't know he's not answering anything that's all socially awkward because you don't know oh, okay. how in a social environment so he's not okay. engaging in this conversation not engaging. Well, yeah well well let's use tangible examples again it's good to use people who aren't sensitive right and you guys know them because it could be different right all is awkward automatically negative no, no, not for me. It sounds negative. But is it automatically negative? We just having a conversation. No, I think so. I think, I think the first thing we think is no. negative. Really? I, I think so. It's not negative, but it's some kind sometimes can be uncomfortable. Yeah. Okay. So let's take like like Fatty, very strong personality. Does is Fatty's personality a little different though? Like kind of how he delivers information. Now it could be just because of the, you know, this is his what third language, I think. So maybe that could be it. But you know how he delivers and things of that nature. Would you would consider that him more goofy? But, would he be more goofy? No, he's not. He's not really goofy though. Maybe. No, he's not goofy though. It could be a bad example because he he's foreign. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, you know, so yeah, he's, I wouldn't he's, use that word for him. I don't know what word I would yeah. use, but I I just can't think of which one. I'm just he's not awkward I'm to me. To okay. See, CC said, and y'all support, you know what I mean? So it's not like nobody talking no bullshit. But oh yeah. He's saying like maybe he he um developed better yeah. now. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm yeah, he, I was, term goofy, though. yeah. Maybe, yeah, maybe I'm 100. Maybe that he just opinionated and then he's foreign and then it's his third language, right? So yeah, um, but it would probably just fit into and he probably he almost too yeah this might he might be too aggressive to be awkward <laughs> <laughs> like he ain't scared okay, so. yeah <laughs> there's this guy that comes on panels but i don't think he's ever been on this one that i would say is a little awkward mm. Ooh. but his he has dreads and i don't know if he's in here who who devin but the way he talks no no no, <laughs> no. i know who she's no, talking no. about never mind <laughs> he has dreads not, not he's never been on this panel. 
Oh, oh okay. you say he never? Okay. okay. Not on this channel. He'll be in the <laughs> chat. Same. He's never been. <laughs> he never been on the panel though. But okay. yeah, he's the way he speaks, it's like he'll say something that's really good, but he'll it's like he'll get really close to the camera and then he'll be doing this while he's talking. And I can't it's it's distracting because mm -hmm. I mm -mm. he's just mm -hmm. real nervous. Really? Tell us in the back chat. Come on now. What is it? I want to know. Well, I'm not sure if that's the right person. That's tough. <laughs> Damn, man. Okay. And it, it, we're just trying to get, because it's good. Oh, Dark Lake would be a great oh. example. So is yes. Dark Lake? Yes. Okay. okay. Absolutely. Okay. Yes. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. I could, I could, so we, okay. I could see that. Now, Dark Lake is, he's smart. You know what I'm saying? He's intelligent. He yeah. definitely know what he want to say. He not shy. He not like he opinionated. Dark Lake can be aggressive, but it's just he doesn't like read the that's... room. Hmm. Sorry. Some okay. people don't care about the room. Yes, people that can't read the room and say the wrong thing. They that is socially awkward. Is but it that they don't he... care or they can't yeah, read? Yeah. Well, even if they can't, even if they can't, you know, like let's just say they got, you know, they're on the spectrum or something. That is still an awkward that is still socially awkward right because it's not the norm it's not appropriate so, for the the setting I hate right. so, I and i question. need the and you know i don't usually read like non super chat but i have to make sure we get the ladies like opinions while they in the chat so is this true <laughs> is this more true than like <laughs> yeah it can be as opposed yeah to but i can like, just picture if he was on a oh, date i picture him being similar to it like he's still the same guy and it's like can you imagine yeah, if you yeah. had no idea <laughs> mm -hmm. I had a question, Lauren. You said that um, when a man is quiet, mm -hmm. that can be considered socially awkward too. Yes, in certain scenarios, yeah. Okay, I was asking that because I'm like, well, what about those men that they're not necessarily quiet; they're just observing it and to that point, reading the room. But they kind of, you know, they're just watching. They're a man of yeah, but they're not room. responding appropriately. That's when I would say it's awkward. Okay. Like if a waitress comes to the table and she's asking for her, okay what do you like to order and he says nothing i'm confused because i'm or like am i supposed to order for this or right or yeah did. like or are you talking real low like she's got to be like excuse me what you say that's weird yeah i was thinking the same thing um miss nate and then she clarified when she was talking about the ordering and you know not responding yeah. and so that added context for me because some men yeah are they they're not as talkative or they fewer mm -hmm. words but if we're talking about dating in the first second date on some level you you have to engage that doesn't mean fill every space because i'm a very talkative person you feel me yeah. so like ro was saying oh you talking more than they talking and and that's i guess where it come to read in the room and people personality because i know i'm talkative so i might out talk a dude you know what i'm saying so i would have to you know what i'm saying be mindful and make adjustments would you would y'all be turned off if like let's say you were talkative like miss j just j and i'd be like yeah you, you talking too much i i get that often so for me i like on I, the first date no honestly i laugh it off because i get it i get it so <laughs> but what if i didn't laugh i'm just like yeah, you talking too much yeah no i'm gonna check out because then you're gonna start scaring me it's cool jesus christ <laughs> jeremiah was popping with the file says y'all already know where i'm going <laughs> <laughs> Ms. Rowe, I noticed me noticing you watching your response to my super chats. Just gorgeous. Smile if you agree. <laughs> Perfect. Get a smile on your heels. He always he always pop up a rogue head. Devin with the two dollars. Oh, we read this one. Okay, that was interesting. Joe with the five dollars says, "Just Jay ellipsis." So if you don't want him to see your car, you're not gonna judge him for not walking you to it after the date, right? I was being facetious, but by that logic, no, I wouldn't judge him because that wouldn't make sense. That would just be weird. OG with the five dollars says, I'm coming to your house with my shirt off on the first date. <laughs> dancing the way he was dancing. Wow. That's the old school, old school move. AP with the two dollars says, Y'all have really run into some weirdos. It's a lot of them out here. Mike Brown with the two dollars says, So what do y'all talk about on the first date? Hmm, we can answer that. Matt P with the five dollars says, "Do y'all think a cooking class date is a good first date? Also, do you do y'all talk on the way to the date or just listen to music if he picks you up?" 
I think you all, definitely. All, all of those are good things. Yeah. Interactive. Mm-hmm. Caesar's Palace with the final says, ladies should should black women as a collective have all these lists of things that that dry up that thing when it will hurt you in getting a good man to marry you hmm. no i don't know what that means just with the two dollars he paid he paid he order i pick up popeyes on the way home okay marcus with the five dollars says hemp you know they ain't going to keep it a beam bro no, they they doing. Uh, they, uh, they, they doing I don't know right. what a beam is. It's weird. Yeah, they ain't even keeping a hundred. Joe, Joe with the five dollars says, I mean. "Y'all didn't pick up any of that awkwardness when y'all agreed to go on the first date." Man, you'd be surprised. We following questions in the middle of the club. You'd be surprised. Like it, it's it's when it's the lights usually, come on. It's usually an acute um interaction for the most part. You know what I'm saying? What up, buzzin', buzzin', bird, flippin', dozen, dozen Holla at your boy, boy, you thought your cousin wasn't Underground, appreciate you becoming a member, bro Welcome to the family They into marriage support I think this lady died, I think, it, yeah Lady Dot, no, I know it's her, but sometimes it be James It just depends who on the damn <laughs> thing So, y'all lying If the man is, quote-unquote, shaking, quiet, unaware You wouldn't talk to him doesn't that make being awkward negative? In that situation, yes, contextual, and all everybody didn't agree to that, so I want to know who y'all is. It's yeah, contextual. I actually said I think awkward is negative, and yeah. I disagree. I didn't because say it's levels. Yeah, it, I didn't say being awkward is not negative. It just means that it is different. That's it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I I think I would lean towards Nay and having a negative connotation. But when I ask the question, I think I would have to uh, really assess it. When I call people awkward, what does that mean? Because right. am I awkward? I don't no. find you to be awkward. Okay. Lauren, Lauren said something. I'm telling. I'm sorry. What did she say? I didn't say said? anything. I was on mute. On <laughs> purpose. <laughs> What would, you, what would you think? How about that? What, what, what was your thought in your head? Uh, whether you're awkward? Yeah. Yes. Wow. Because you're too honest. <laughs> That's <laughs> <all> awkward. <laughs> That's <laughs> awkward. Read the room. Like some things are best left unsaid. <laughs> like, wow. Wow. Use your That's eyebrows or something. Look away. <laughs> Walk off. <laughs> I think that is that is yeah that could make sense that could make sense <laughs> shit like that shit like damn that. <laughs> okay so did I read this one? Oh, so Joe with the five says, what if a guy hasn't dated much and he's out here trying to get some positive experiences aka getting his reps up gotta start somewhere you need to yeah. go watch Hitch or something because you're not gonna get you don't have a chance to get that far on dates doing the same thing over and over again. See, that's my problem. I'm a little too, fr I don't know. I'm a little too understanding. If somebody presents themselves in an authentic way and they seem like they slightly nervous, I in the past, I've made room. You know what I'm saying? It can't be like Just no me. nervousness to the point where it's like very strange. But I mean, I, I've, I've had guys be a little nervous approaching me Can and they turned say... out to be cool. Can he say that? Like, ladies, can he say, listen, you know what I'm saying? I, I was in a long term or whatever the case. I haven't been outside. I've been focused on X, Y, and Z. Mm, you um, can't tell me all well, that. You know. no. Well, no. He, I mean, he's giving you context of why he may be a little bit, you yes, know what I'm saying, trying to get his bearings. Okay. Well, I guess in that case, okay. It depends. It's levels. I've tried See, it. Yeah. Caesar's pals with the final says, I don't think black women date a bunch of socially awkward men because they only go out with men who they are attracted to. Men might mess up the date, but that's all. Zagu was popping my boy with the two dollars says, Y'all results will tell you if you're awkward. True. Dating pool with the two dollars. What's up, HQ? Salute to the beautiful queens on the panel. Alex, your camera not on. Like, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. Hit that like button right now if you can. That helps the channel the most. Okay. Damn, this is hard. Hell yeah, Isaiah. Isaiah, you married, right? Damn. So, mm. 
It's hard dating y'all, man. It's hard, boy. Y'all make I've this been, shit. I've been pretty understanding. What is going on? Shit. Come on, I'm broke, baby. I ain't got no money. Bullshit. I see you shining, nigga. I can smell a motherfucker with money. <laughs> Even Ray Charles can see you got money. <laughs> John with a 20 ball. What's up? John says, sorry, ladies. Ellipsis. Let me find out us men are weird and awkward out here. No excuses, men. Ellipsis, just get it. Perfect. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. Damn. Are we gonna get well, we ain't getting on y'all tonight, but mm. so all right, let's say he passed the dating phase, right? Y'all on some huggy bear shit. Y'all in a relationship. Mm -hmm. What dries out the vagina while in a relationship? <clears throat> this is important. Are you having? Are, are they having sex already? Yes, they in a relationship. I was gonna say how long they've been in a relationship. Is <laughs> how did we get there? I'm confused. Yeah, like... <laughs> Well, y'all date. So, um, did I go too quick? So, what about the? So, y'all, y'all. Well, y'all dating. Like y'all, y'all, y'all go together. And I mean, how would it drop? Um, I don't know. Yeah, like, what can he do in a relationship? And, um, Six months. Don't it don't take long though. It don't. It Six don't take months. long. Six months. Don't ask me for money too early. Let's say. Um, okay. Damn. Ooh. I was I was gonna say something different. <laughs> what was you gonna say? I was gonna say maybe just not oh, learn. All right, hold on, hold on. Let me take a step okay. back. Let me take a step back. Isaiah, I think you're right. Ak. So you in a relate you 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 dating, right? You got a few dates under your belt. It's time to do the do. So I'm not wifing it if I I if the cheeks is trash. Oh. So it's time to do the do. What happens when he could dry up the vagina? Definitely not getting it again. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Damn, come on, y'all. Put him in the fucking gotta be. Okay. Now y'all want to be shy. No, I mean, he ain't getting it. I mean, if y'all did it once, it's time to do the do, and he dry, you know, he doesn't do anything for you. It's pretty much a done deal. Yeah, no, like but I'm saying women. we talking about a physical drying. Yeah, basically you're not aroused, like because like he doing something. Y'all about to get it popping. Like for instance, like if I was kissing, which I would only be kissing if I was trying to like be on some huggy bear shit. But like them bad kisses and like smooches and you know what I'm saying your teeth clanking because she don't know what she doing. Like oh yeah, that's a lie. That's oh, life bro. in your mouth. Yeah. That's a dick limping her. But if people gonna be honest, if if they already there, a lot of times people don't just went for the ride, even if it was that one time and then checked out after that. Like if they yeah. already to the point where I'm just saying no, teeth clanking no, and they is already right. is get weird. You right, but what I'm saying is what are the vagina dryers that men do? Even in relationships, I would say lack of communication. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah, if, if, if there's that complacency. No, no, no. See, he, like look at C. Look at C. Look at C. So C said, Y'all about to get it popping. And he like he licked my ear. Yeah. Vagina <laughs> dry. <laughs> this is what I'm saying. Is if we talking about physical stuff, we're talking about interactions, uh, <laughs> like physical. physical. I'm confused. I would say not kissing know? me on the lips. I would take that personally. Okay, well, if, if you're trying to have, then, yeah. trying to have sex, like, I'm and you not kiss me on my lips, like, you kissing around everything, like, mm -mm. you don't like me then. Why are you, why are you, why, why are you here? So you're saying if he didn't kiss you on the lips, that'd be like, hold on. I'm okay. weird. I don't kiss everybody like that. But if we at that point... <laughs> well, this is what I'm, that's why I'm asking for context because that's why I start talking about communication because I'm like, are we in the in, are we getting ready to we're actually do phase. it? We're All in the right. physical phase, Jay. We're about to start. Oh, okay. See, that's what I was saying. That was kind of wrong. Yes. Come on, come on. May, I don't know. Maybe he's gassy. He's gassy. I was, I was about to add one of those, like when they like the sweat and like it drip on you on you, like. <laughs> he already pumping. He already like him like that. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm trying to. I'm trying to let y'all organize it, but y'all not doing a good job. Let me organize. We need your help. 
Yes, because nay, he already lead us, pumping. sir. Lead. Nay, Are you not me? He already pumping like a motherfucker. Nay, if he's sweating, so that's already <laughs> <laughs> that ain't. Come on, nay. But like, what about God, the, the ones that be really sweaty? Because I had a big something man. So. <laughs> Yo, convergence, man. This shit like pulling teeth, boy. Um. All right. So, so for instance, right? Let me see. So with Lauren, like she's saying, he don't kiss on the lips initially. Okay. Um, what if he's just a bad kisser, awkward kissing, or he, he keep his he keep his mouth closed? Is that something you'd be like, come on, you're not into it? You know what I'm saying? If his mouth closed, yeah, I'm a, I'm a, yeah, it's, it's going to seem like he probably ain't into it. Like he just, like mm-hmm. that's, that's kind of weird. That's strange. Okay. What, what if he does this? Y'all know it's about to pop. He jump and lay on his back on the bed. But, I'm sorry. The first time? What's your way? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So he crawl up on the bed, lay down on his back. The crawl. <laughs> well, you know, he tried to scoot up on the bed. Is that a, is that a, is that a, is that a, Wait a minute. This is, this is awful. What is happening? These no, words I'm, we're using just not working. That's not I don't know. Right he words. jump on the bed, lay on his back. God damn it. Is that a vagina dryer? Yes. Yes. All of those yes, words. I, I think if we're if we're chilling at his house or something and we're kissing, then all of a sudden he runs to the bedroom. Yes. No, run down. The y'all go in the room. Wild. Y'all listen. Y'all going, y'all, y'all, y'all been inside. This what this, this that's what is how y'all say it. That's what I told giving. you I'm staying in the south. I'm this staying in giving. the house. Yeah, you, you're not allowed to say it though. Like, <laughs> no, I'm trying to understand how y'all say it so y'all can understand me. Y'all is giving inside or y'all going inside. So I said I'm staying. No, that's wrong. What if he does this? He get butt ass and then jump on the bed. Yes, he still saying. got on his socks. What? I'm yeah. sorry. Oh my god. John <laughs> 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 said right next to the socks. Okay, all right, hold on, hold on, hold on. So C said, I like when he lays on the bed. All right, okay. okay. That's why I'm trying to get context, but he was scooting. That's strange. But what it is is what I'm what I'm getting at when I'm when I'm putting that in there, it pause is like if he lays down on the bed first, it's expected that you are in for all intents and purposes, the dominant position. You see what I'm saying? So it would be a lack right. of him taking control. Would that be a slight turn off? In that regard, yes. Yeah, that's what I was saying. But it's more fun to say, like, <laughs> jump on he the was, bed. He was scooting, so that was just kind of wild. I didn't know what was happening. Mm-hmm. What is you doing? No. Yeah, no. Yeah. Now, what if he, this is the first time, what if he do things that are not normally expected? What's like toe so, these days? So yeah, there's erogenous zones, armpits, toes, inner thigh, stuff that you know, things that you may not expect on the first time, but he could be pulling out all the stops. Would that make you feel some type of way or that 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 would like work? It. Yeah, I don't mm-hmm. like that either. So if he like lick it, your armpit, you'd be like, hell no. Nah. That's weird. It's like it's like <laughs> First of all, you're gonna be upset. We lick my arm. <laughs> it's deodorant up there. <laughs> oh, yeah, niggas don't care about the deodorant. Long yeah, some people have an arm. armpit fetish. I actually read about that the other day. Some people have an armpit fetish. I've seen fetish. that. And There's I was some confused. long name for it. But yeah. is this the response, though, for like some of the things that you don't usually do, like first time type shit? No, yeah, the question is, sure. would you let it still happen after it happens? Like, once they do that weird thing. AP, AP coaching oh, the fight. Are you going to keep going? <laughs> well, okay, so I'm not... I, 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 I don't even know what to say. I, I'm going to say this. I, I, I enjoy pheromones. I'll say that, but I, I ain't saying I, I, I'm... I don't know about licking people's armpits, but I do enjoy pheromones. Mm-hmm. So you sniff it. I wouldn't say I sniff it, but I, I like man smell if that makes sense. Yo, no. Jonathan with the final says chill. I keep my socks on. <laughs> It'd be cold. <laughs> no, somebody said to go to armpits. 
No, Damn. I ain't sniffing no the armpits knee, like the that. The kneecaps got a lot of like uh Wait, what? Yeah. Like knee there's 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 zones is what I'm saying. I don't like, know why Mike worried about that. He should back of the knee. Like, I heard that. Back in the knee, yeah. Mike Brown with the final says the only one that may have had cheeks in the last six months is Lauren. Ro forgot how Nay forgot, just Jay forgot. <laughs> you forgot to unbutton that button on your blazer. Okay. I hate it. It's cute. It's cute. I like it. It's cute. <laughs> <laughs> Don't grow, baby. Try it. Oh, shit. Oh, got time. Time. He said, "What in the? Hey, <laughs> listen, what That's in me. the haberdashery and hemoglobin is going on here? Not hemoglobin. What's that dude's name? Yo, Tony. Tony. Hey, man, they ain't hey, wild, man. Haberdashery no, is another cool word too, though. It like, is. Yeah. Now, I have no idea what it is, but yeah. Jay. Yeah, yeah. Don't don't worry about it. Y'all, y'all, y'all took the SAT. He like focus Max. He can't spell it. <laughs> I know how angry man spelled the wrong too, but I'm a hush. Button, though. God damn it. <laughs> so what about um what if he pick you up? She just yeah, I feel like you I'm little, so that's sexy. What you mean? Oh, you wow. Listen, I listen, I ain't even thing. gonna lie, y'all. I used to I <laughs> I'm gonna get it. No, I ain't gonna say that. It's sexy. I'm gonna leave it there. Okay. What if he? All right, I gotta, I gotta ask. That's what if he I'll tosses? What if he tosses salad first time? Good. Huh? God damn, man! No, no, you're doing too much the first time. That's doing too the much. The first time. You gotta save some of your tricks for later. Yeah, you're doing too much because that also lets me know that are you doing this with everyone? There's a lot going on. Extra comfy. Are you doing that with everybody? A lot of, I'm lot of, a lot of <gasps> Jesus salad bar. Is this risky I after dark? Because I didn't think we were going this route. <laughs> right. I'm just asking because y'all, so y'all, y'all, y'all members there. only. <laughs> right. I come back and this is we. This is what we on. This definitely. This is definitely going on members only. So, all right. All right, like, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend, hit that like button. <laughs> no, no, it's it's right before the Thank relationship. It's right before yeah, the relationship. <laughs> well, that might get that's him have we had this conversation before? Like, have we nah. talked about that? You think, wait a minute, that gotta be a turn off if he trying to say, like, he should be asking what you like? No. Nah. By the See, that's what I'm saying. Oh. If we're getting to that stage, I think we've had a conversation about what we like. I would think uh, that's cool. Now, I'm gonna sound very hippie ish right now because you know, a lot of people in the space don't like words like energy, vibe, whatever, whatever. That it's a, it's a certain vibe that a woman could have with a man, you know what I'm saying? Especially a dude that that takes the lead. Some some stuff ain't got to be asked, some stuff ain't got to be talking yeah, about. You feel me? I'm just saying, listen, it's, uh, it's levels to this. You feel me? Yeah. And well, what you imagine, I mean, you don't have to discuss I'm it. just saying, I'm just saying. I'm a big uh, phone person, so it's been discussed before that happens. No, I think that's important, too. I don't want to discount that, but I'm just saying. It, no, it's a certain no. type of man that's able to do that. Every man can't move yeah. like that. Yeah, he, yeah. Mm. niggas, and don't, don't, over, don't overdo yourself. Don't be talking about, I'm going to do X, Y, and Z. Just say, you're going to see. Them the worst. Them the most disappointing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't trust you. So far, because they raise a level expectation. Like, just let it be what it's gonna be, man. You know, yeah. right? Joe with the fight out says, "Stop playing ellipsis. We as men know not to say or do anything on our dates that convey us as having less value. Talking about our struggles is exactly that." Zo, how about, <clears throat> how about that be something that you do talk about to show that you are humble? You've overcome some things. And stop being so like that to me if you can't talk about your struggles that just it just makes you unattractive to be honest with you because if you can't be honest about who you are i don't really see the point nobody's so, saying you got oh, you done you was oh. already late you done interrupting the super chat mm-hmm. 
So, so what the five dollars says? Hey, yo, don't Lauren eyes look like the filter of all, all these girls used on social media? You got secret streamyard filter package at Lauren. Ah, <laughs> uh, you can't use that. I talk. To, I talk about people with it. Black thoughts with the two dollars. What's popping? It says responsible men dry up the queen, dry the queens up. Check the stats. God damn! Wow! wow, wow, wow. I don't mm-hmm. even know what that means. He said, he said, niggas that got their shit together are unattractive to black women. Marcus Evans with the two dollars. I told you, brother Hemp, shaking my head. CD was popping with the five dollars. When women are hella picky like this, it comes off like they don't even like men. Why don't y'all just go full lead? Damn. This is picky. Mm-mm. I I thought I've been very understanding, but I don't I don't know. Even that when we say that to them. And these with the you, real hey. niggas wear socks. God I damn. see you. I see you. Angry man with the ten ounces. That was on purpose. The proper plural term is haberdashers, but that's not how Tony Baker says it. Yeah, I, I can hear Tony Baker. Okay, saying. that would take away from the comedic effect. Parentheses. And yes, I'm being sassy and light skinned. <laughs> damn, I hear you. That's what's mm. up. They in a marriage, uh, Lady Di was popping with the five dollars. If he do too little, he's gay. If he do too much, he's a hoe. Come on, <laughs> Lady Di. Who said all that? Like, I don't See, know. Somebody just like the five says, Come on, y'all killing the super chats. See, the pals with the five dollars. Ladies, y'all lying. If he don't make you scream first night, you're not calling him back. Mm-mm, that's green. My own at least. <laughs> Damn, man. Which, I, mm. which one? Which part? Which one? they just said a lot? Because <laughs> I, I didn't think know. we should have set this one out. I don't. I don't know. I probably should have set this one out. I probably should have waited for the next email. Ham. This. This. This a lot. I don't know. It's <laughs> lovers to yeah, it. For me, I just. I just go by vibes. Like I don't have a specific type of guy I like. I've dated dudes six six. The the the, the five six. Like I like but I've dated yes. big dudes, small dudes. It's it just all depends. But we not we not, yeah we understand that people you know the preferences can 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 change. But what we trying to mine out is what they've done that was undesirable. So y'all have um experience with that, regardless big, tall, short, small, whatever. Right. Because the cats is saying man. This shit ain't working. It ain't going how it used to go. They tell me that that was back in the day. It's not like that anymore. You know what I'm saying? Well, maybe I aged out in that regard. You probably should have had somebody younger today. Well, them niggas is my age. Who? Saying the shit. Dudes oh. talking like that to me ain't really out. Like, I don't know. I ain't trying to generalize, but to me, a, a guy who's who's talking like that already sounds like they might not be as confident, in my opinion. Like, dude, okay. like dudes I know that that's really about that, they just gonna go get it. Okay, but no, but that's the thing, though. There's a there's a there's a huge disconnect. So okay, if we tell them what doesn't work. And they about you know they a lot of them are around my age. I'm 38. Then at least at the very least they know what didn't work for the other cats, what doesn't work. You know we got Judge Jay. You from the Midwest? No, I'm from Miami. 305 all day. She from Dade County. I'm oh, sorry, I had to put on for my city. <laughs> Lord, girl. <laughs> no. So we just trying to understand is, you know, you guys opinions are, are your opinions, but you know, there's, you ever watch family feud? Yeah. It'd be a hundred motherfuckers on the survey. Right. But guess what? Them hundred motherfuckers be having the right answers. Like a motherfucker, right or wrong. You right. You're so right. a small sample size can, can speak to more people than you give it credit for. That's all. Congo with the files. What's popping, Congo? He said the sex starts with intellectual conversation and compatibility. If sincere, it's a transition to physical sex. Hell no, nah, Congo. Uh uh-uh. uh, that nah, <laughs> nah. I don't know, bro. That's what I'm saying. That's aged out. Damn, Jeremiah was popping with the files. Says Miss Rowe, what chance do I have with an alpha female or a president? 
I must be the same. I didn't see you smile to agree. What number must I drop? <laughs> Contact my manager, him. Oh, yeah. Contact him, my manager. Email me, man. This might be risky at Gmail. You know what I mean? Okay, him. Right. Can I ask a question? Sure. Okay, so in regards to what you just said, right, about the sample size and offering information, for the guys that's saying, hey, this is not working, it's different out here now, you know, women moving different, X, Y, Z, right? If mm -hmm. they are willing to take notes, right, from women that's talking up here, if they're willing to take those notes and say, okay, I'm going to apply it to the next date, would that not still be indicative of somebody who don't necessarily have confidence? You understand what I'm saying? Because regardless <clears> to how a guy moves per se, if he have confidence, it still hits different, in my opinion. You're right. You're right. You're right. I, um, yeah. bro, I'll be quick. I'll be quick, bro. So you're right. However, confidence comes with information too. Okay. Right. So when people Building learn a, a craft or a trade, yeah. And when they okay. go in to that skill set of trade with the information, they'll be more confident. So maybe that's what it is. You know what I mean? What did you about to say, bro? Mm -hmm. I was going to say the same thing again. I just told my male friend this. Um, if nobody ever tells you you did something wrong, you'll be thinking you're doing it right the whole time. Um, if you have someone that can hold you accountable, I say accountable because, again, he approached the female. He tried to tell a joke. And it didn't go over well with her. So I explained to him why the joke didn't go over well. If you don't have anybody like that in your life, then you're going to continue to make the same mistake. And you're still your confidence does not go up until you know what works for you. Positive reinforcement. Joke? Huh? Yeah. What was the joke? They were in the gym and she was on her phone on a machine and he said... <laughs> How's that workout working for you on your phone? That was corny. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. And she's a she's you know a bigger woman and she, <laughs> I'm was, sorry. Yeah. She was she was she was and 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 don't he likes her and he wanted to talk to her but it didn't go over with her because he came with that joke that just didn't. Make yeah. what sense. what joke what improvement joke did you give him i didn't give an approval i said the same thing i just said you should have just went up to her and said hi how you doing i see you in the gym all the time no <laughs> if she said no then she said no but at least he no was just i'm saying that's not it's the gym it's not like a bar where you like hey uh, i know I'm but, it is the machine, but when you're in the gym if you're working out i told him he should have offered his assistance because he's always in the gym and if mm -hmm. she's always in there working out, he could have given her assistance and said, I see you working on this machine. I always work on it. Do you need help? Would you like me to assist you? That would have opened up conversation, not telling a dry joke that you think was funny. But she said she was a bigger woman, bro. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So why would you? So now you go up to the bigger woman, right? Who looked like she knew to the gym. Why? Because she's bigger. No, so but no, no, like, no. She's, hey, not new, she's not new to the gym. He always sees her in there. Does she see him? He can't verify that, right? So think about it. A bigger woman, you go, hey, uh, <laughs> you need help on it, Mr. Sheen. Obviously, you're on your phone. It's not working. You know what I'm saying? So that 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 both is trash. You might need to just stick with the joke. He's not a funny guy, obviously, right? So we know that. But you give him an improvement joke. If you need a spot, just say that. She like, excuse me. Well, I noticed you sitting here. You doing some good weight? Maybe I could spot you, cause that obviously got a reason why you taking up the machine while I need it. Well, that's what she said. After mm. the joke didn't go over, she said, "Do you want the machine?" Like with the attitude, cause at that mm. point, you know, she was already turned off. And she probably yeah. already might be having some insecurity anyway. There's no I way to quantify that. that. You feel me? But it's just I a safe that. assumption. I said, that. I said you got to take. You have to read the room. Right. She bigger woman in the gym she's only catch her on her way out or right. something like when she's leaving the gym or something you know y'all yeah, don't y'all don't y'all don't court women obviously um <laughs> obviously jesus christ. <laughs> <laughs> jesus christ man all right hold on let me read this real quick omar was popping like that. Like that. Like that. i'm broke baby salute 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 
Omar Smith with the 20 ball says, nice, chill conversation, ladies. Way to bring up that good energy back into this little space of ours. Hamp, another great show, bro. Yeah, man, they, they doing good, man. They doing good. Um, This is not easy. It sounds like it's not easy for you guys either, isn't it? Um, Like, L- Lauren, are you awkward when you get an approach? Yep, absolutely. I can see Stevie Wonder can see that. What makes you so awkward? <laughs> yeah. What like what do you do you get nervous when men are approaching you? Like if he's attractive. No, not nervous, but it's obvious and I make it obvious. What you be doing? Like looking down, awkward. looking up, shit like that. Like what, what do you do? <laughs> <laughs> or if I like I see, see that too. you looking at me from across the room, I'll be like. <laughs> and they don't so, know what to do with that so if i seen lauren because you could see she awkward right um so what if i came up like what's your mm-hmm. weird ass doing over here <laughs> i was waiting on you <laughs> <laughs> and that's what's awesome because lauren has an amazing sense of humor you feel yeah. me so it's like yeah. she shows up in an authentic way and that's and i can imagine that's attractive for some guys you know what i'm saying well you can see it like you can see like she i think she's serious don't get me wrong but i don't think she take herself right. too serious that makes sense so yeah, you could kind of get that, that energy you know but bro that same joke wouldn't work absolutely you know what i'm saying like i don't think that would come through and nay you ask her a math problem you get a little confused get her a shot mm-hmm. six times six times seven always always stump people <laughs> if somebody gave me a math question i'd be like uh today you mean like today you want me to do that right now Yo. I'm so damn what about just just yeah just jay <laughs> you gotta let some of that shit go, mommy. God damn, man. We can't be I'm dealing with that. Shit. What you mean? <laughs> uh uh-uh, uh, man. We ain't dealing with what Johnny did, bro. Uh uh-uh. uh. I, no. I know that's the thing, though. I'm, I'm gonna keep it real. I, whenever I meet somebody, I don't, I don't, I don't approach them and, and put the same thing on them. I have insecurities like anybody else. You feel me? But it ain't like, oh, you know, I'm having flashbacks, you know, like, oh, it's the hot iron. No, Penny. No, you know, it ain't, you know, no, no, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I, I won't say I'm, oh my I'm not God. as trusting though. I ain't even gonna lie, but, but no, I have a regular conversation with people all the time. Listen, Ham, I got a video of this dude. I was coming out of Ace Hardware one day, right? Minding my business because I love the hardware store. Ace ain't my favorite, but I had to go there because they had what I needed. Anyway, I'm coming out of Ace Hardware. I'm making a beeline for my car. I see this dude making a beeline across the parking lot. Anyway, long story short, he asked if he could take me out to lunch and stuff. It was kind of freaky, though, because we're in a parking lot. Where you come from? I don't see your car. He was on his knees. He snatched his gloves off. Like, he had on work clothes. It was very strange. So do you not understand? Like, I live out in the boonies. I live in the desert. It's levels to this. These ain't regular dudes that I'm used to that I grew up with that's approaching me out here. So I said all that to say that was strange. Ham, ham, checking out on me. I'm just saying, whatever, (laughs) ham. I'm going to stay in the house. Listen, I said it. I'm gonna stay in the house. The other day in the chat, I said I was gonna buy me a dog and die alone. So I'm good. It is freaky though. Like <laughs> it was. It was scary. Yo. What are you going to for? I don't know where you come from. Prince Ty Israel was popping, my brother. Congo with the father says to each his own hand. All men don't operate the same when dealing with women, my brother. That's a fact. But we looking at the best way to skin a cat, not all the ways. Not skin it, Lord Jesus. And yeah, fact. Shit like that. Shit like that. Shit that young. intellectual conversation. Uh, well, let's clarify. Was it about sex, or are you just having an intellectual conversation? Are you saying you stimulate her mind, which then leads you to her body? If you're saying that, I can see that. Now, I know you ain't talking about yeah, because when I do cunnilingus, that's not it. That I don't want you to be talking like that. You know what I'm saying? You have to use big words and shit like that. So say if it's it the again. former, I understand. Yeah. Can you if say I'm it like, again? 
you said I'm 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 proficient in cunnilingus. That's not I don't know if that's gonna make I don't know if that's gonna make the vagina wake up <laughs> like that. That may not be it. But if he's saying he's you have an intellectual conversation and you get intrigued by that, and then that makes you more comfortable to give me your body, that that might I understand that point. So that's fair. You know what I mean? Yo, Lionel, it is impossible in these streets, B. That's what I'm getting. Ro, uh oh. Brother, brother, brother. Are you awkward out here? No. Stop the cap. Ro, are you awkward out here? No, I'm straight shooter, no chaser. I mean, Stop if you like me, you approach me, I'm gonna speak. I'm gonna, you know, say what it is. I don't are you are you gonna run a background check on him? Fuck yeah. You seen that story that that lady put out there, that 51 story. Hell yeah, I'm doing a background check. Do you think that um, detective nature you have uh, kind of comes out of your pores? No. You think you because, hide? Because yes, because I'm not gonna tell you until we get to a point where I feel like we're gonna be in in each other's spaces, like with my kids and stuff like that. So, but initially, no, I'm not like that. I'm pretty much what you give is what I'm taking in. And then when we get to a certain point, wow, then I'm, I'm, and I feel like I'm about to put you in my space. Yeah. I'm doing a background check. Too many crazies out here. Mm. It's more crazies than normals. Let me just say it like mm. that. Agreed. Yeah. See, it's, it's hard. It's impossible out here. It's it's impossible when we assume that the most niggas is crazy. That's cr that damn. Mm. Well, I get called crazy all the time, so it for me is whatever. I I you know. And, and I mean and I mean by crazies, I mean just I, I'm saying false lives, um, being married, and you know, um, you know, just just not being who they say they are. I'm not talking about I'm not talking about the awkward guy i'm talking about the guys that have these whole different lives they got these secret wives they got all types of sh shit going on that only comes out when you can actually see them past the point of their representative wait ro you don't see that you have a quirk though what's my quirk camp you just a little quirk just j2 I think everybody is. I think everybody. No, 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 no. What's my quirk? Well, hold on. What happened? It's not. See, that's the thing. People have like quirks a little bit. I see. know, has one. What is it exactly? I'm not so sure. I don't know if I can like grab it and say what it is. But I bet if we ask whatever it is, is why you tell me to stay in the house. No, that's that PTSD. But quirks can be cool. Quirks can be cool though. Quirks can Agreed. be cool, like that's not, you know what I'm saying. But it there is like a a quirk, like who doesn't really have a quirk as much? It would be like like Alex. Alex kind of just like you know just just regular for all intents and purposes. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shout out to Alex, regular ass, striking it rich with the five pounds. Says the better looking you are, the less likely she is to call you awkward. The men she finds attractive might be called eccentric or loud or reserved if quiet. Okay. okay. I would agree with that. My friend is very attractive. He just, he's awkward. He's socially awkward. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I wanted to ask you how, how he looked because I, I ain't gonna lie. If a dude is very aesthetically pleasing to me, I might let something ride. I'm being honest. That, no, but that was my rich. thought. Not, yeah. not if he, he approached, it's his, like I told him, he already has the looks down muscle attractive all he doesn't, that you need to he got all that and still turned that lady off yeah, yes because right. of what he says and how you leave i don't know no. you leave it i don't something know now. i'm not but, even that no. now but this is i think i think striking it rich is on to something though yep rubber roses says it lauren mack what's your ig Caesar's pals for the two dollars says never had an intellectual conversation to get the box yeah no nah. But Congo said, "With the five dollars, I misunderstood the conversation. Sorry about that, Ham. Now nah, you good? I figured you you was you was talking about something else. That's why I kind of try to bring some context to it." Matt people to tell us. For me, the hug tells it all. Better smell good. That's true, man. Son, kids, shalom. 
<laughs> she's apologizing to the hemp crazy for being too honest. Right, Lauren? Shaking my head. <laughs> Striking a rich with the five pounds. Says, asking women how to turn them on is like going to the slave master and asking them, what's the best way to end slavery? It's a conflict of interest. God damn. So I Oof. guess he's willing to take the lead. See, that, that's what I was kind of trying to, you know, I, I'm trying to be mindful of how I say it. But yeah, for, for dudes that take the lead, if they built a certain way, they like it ain't it ain't a lot of asking. It's a lot mm. of doing. So let's let's pinpoint a few things. You approach you guys just give me a um uh yes or no, all right. He approaches confidence is key. Oh my fucking god. Oh, I thought Y'all you were gonna ask that. We thought you were gonna ask us go around the room. Yes, confidence is key. Absolutely. <laughs> I thought oh, I was going deeper than that. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking you're gonna like say. <laughs> I thought that was a comma. Lord, that's what I thought too. Most high, don't do this to me. <laughs> I'm embracing my 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 airheadness today. All right, don't worry. I ain't gonna I tell mean, nobody else. It's only it's only 320 people here. I ain't gonna tell nobody fact. else. <laughs> hit the like. Hit the like while y'all up in here because I know the y'all likes, being stingy with the likes. His confidence is key. Yes. Yes. Okay. There's a fine line between confidence and arrogance. Mm. And that line needs to be treaded lightly. Amen. Mm-hmm. Okay, Absolutely. fellas, that's... Um, Sorry. That, 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 that's... What'd you say? Go ahead, say it again. Nothing. I said ab- absolutely. And so, fellas, that that way is key. That that I think that point is key. Like, there's a line, but you kind of got to be walking it, you know, because they want to feel the bravado, but they, but I don't think anybody wants too much of it. You know what I'm saying? Right. So I think that that's understandable when you approach <clears throat> and these, these questions to D Savage point might sound like comments. This is almost like true or false, but I'm just saying yes or no. Um, Just say, int- just properly, pro- I would say properly introduce yourself. Or I'm saying properly introduce yourself over like Shorty or Ma or something like that. Yes, agree. That's better. Like if even when you did yours and you said DJ Hamp, I was like, I wouldn't like that. What's your name? Okay. That part. Hampshire. Hampshire. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. Hampshire Um, Wilson. Oh my God. <laughs> so if we when you approach only use jokes if you know you funny. Yes. I appreciate yeah. dry yeah. humor. Yeah. I guess it's still it's- humor. Yes. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You gotta work through it a little bit. Yes. Um, I mean, if he also does it, he might think that he's funny, but nobody ever told me he really isn't. So maybe he wants to try it out on you. So that's true. He could probably try it out on you. If you laugh, then he's like, okay, this could work. And then he, he might just continue to. I don't think he should do it when he first meets you, though, because you don't know. Take a chance. That's what I'm that, that would be the chance when he first approaches you. He might come to you and crack a joke. If he sees, okay, that didn't work, that didn't go over well. No. He has to try. I don't think he should do it. Yeah, well, if you got to take a risk to do it, Miss Nate, does it make sense to do so off the first approach? But if, I think if he thinks he's funny, what, how would you know? Niggas know they ain't funny. <laughs> you know, you know who ain't funny. Watch yeah. this. Is B funny? Yeah, mm-hmm. like an awkward way. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, who let me is. try. A, let me try a little bit harder one that y'all may. Not, let me see if y'all can recognize this. Is Mr. Fantastic funny? Hell no. See, Mr. Ta- Fantastic actually is fun. Yeah, like I think he, he has is a, funny though. Yeah, see <laughs> that see, bro, see you, you <laughs> missed it. You missed it. See, Mr. Fantastic actually kind of funny, like yeah. on the low, but you gotta you gotta understand, like if he not being serious spitting stats, you know yeah, what I mean? Watch this. From the South. I don't trust him. It'd be the <laughs> accent and then how how he'll say something, it makes Makes me laugh. Like this right here, Nate. Brother, brother, brother. Yeah. <laughs> like, Mr. Fantastic is funny. So, 
Now watch this. Is Joel funny? Hell no. No, when? Joel's not funny. No. Who? Joel, he been oh. on the channel before. Um, oh. so Joel's not funny, and it's not a dig. It's just who funny, who ain't. You know what I'm saying? That's but all. It the is. funny part is he's gonna think that's a dig, okay? Because he in the comments right now. No, he's Come funny. On. Now watch this. Is scam likely funny? No. No. I'm biased. Sometimes. Okay. No, I like him. He, but he, but overall, bro, he's not funny, right? You would he's say not he, overall, he, but sometimes he, he has that. Dry yeah, he'll hit a few, right? Yeah. So what I recommend, look, look, scam right here, look. <laughs> so not would scam, I recommend scam approach with a joke? No, because niggas don't get the jokes he makes. You see what I'm saying? You gotta like, know him. You gotta know him. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> so, but it, but like with scam, like you said, you know him, then it, it gets funny, right? But his a first, you like, like the first time he hit, he came to the pen. I'm like, fuck. But yeah. now that I understand him, <laughs> no, I like scam a lot. I like scam a lot. But I, I like to use people who ain't fucking sensitive. You know what I'm saying? Right. Um. <laughs> yeah, that's the relief say. <laughs> Maybe mm. that's what it is, right? But when you get to know him, then you're like, oh, the all right, irony, man, cool. the irony of it all. You know. Um. Damn, that that's interesting. It's good using like tangible people, like. Like, like for instance, I could talk shit, but people don't get as offended as like easily per se, because that because Asia always tell me it's like a comedic delivery to it, so I might could get away with like you know doing like like with Lauren like what your weird ass doing over here, you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> damn, that is interesting. Yeah, but mm -hmm. I can see you trying to insult somebody, and it be dry. I can see you trying to hit on somebody. You'd be like, but your, the back of your ankle is ashy. And it's no yeah. facial expression or nothing. And it's like, what? <laughs> nothing to work with. That's what I was saying when he said, when he said to me earlier. Like, his, I, I didn't know what to take from it. Like, it was flat. Yeah, that's true. And that's he true. flirting, I'm, though. That's the flirt. Yeah, that's the, right. <laughs> but I got told to stay in the house. So I'm going to stay no, in the house. Fatty. Hey, yeah, I'll be like, Yo, you wilding, my nigga. He'd be like, what? Your ankle is fucked up out here and then you look down like here it is oh. i would laugh you wouldn't laugh at that <laughs> i would yeah, once i noticed laugh. it <laughs> miss nate when i was outside this shit worked bro they <laughs> i don't i don't with a guy they used to do that and i just laughed that was funny yeah but now i gotta look you up and now i gotta find something wrong i gotta i'm not gonna let you win though yeah no nah, definitely definitely mm -mm. yo well, you know what it. i do what y'all think about oh, this Lord. If I were to buy a woman a shot, I never like whatever they drinking doesn't matter to me. Like they'd be like, I'm drinking tequila. I don't drink no fucking tequila. I'm a grown up. And then I get two shots of like whatever it is I'm drinking. Um, yeah, that comes off like he's joking, but yeah. And then it's 1738. That's it. <laughs> Joseph was popping. Like that. Video game. Oh shit, I'm up. Oh shit, my bad. <laughs> What's oh, good, man? What's changed you... their name. How about that? You changed okay. a while ago. What you got for us? Nothing. Just... I didn't even know you was gonna bring me up, man. Ooh, I, don't, man. I don't have nobody. Man, they look good, especially the one to my, the one to my, uh, to my left. Yeah, she looking right tonight, man, with that silk press. Yeah, Joseph, like what do you got about for the conversation, Negro? <laughs> Nothing, bro. I'm like, yo, let me get back to... I'm playing Resident Evil uh, Resident Evil 2, man. Let me get back to killing zombies. That is socially awkward, everyone. That wants to know what you're talking about. That is socially awkward. I am a grown-ass man. Let me get mm. on this dang on PlayStation. That's tough. <laughs> let, me, let me hit this link and then, and then, and then tell you that Tragic. I'm busy. Wow. That's brother, brother, brother. Oh Lord. <laughs> Speak of the Mr. devil. Make it. We gotta laugh now because Mr. Fantastic on, right? <laughs> oh, Mr. Fantastic. I tried to stick up for you, man. Ro wasn't having it. Man, Ro, Ro, Ro looking like uh uh great value Oprah Winfrey out here. Don't play with me, Ro. You know I'm a motherfucking funny guy. And you look like 
a miniature small. Not, actually, you, see, let, you need some lessons. Your mic, your mic small, not in, Mr. Fantastic. He did. Yeah, your mic not me. in. Nothing. Oh, my bad. Looks Nothing like about me, a small role. You uh, come on now, Bernie Mac. Go sit down somewhere, Bernie Mac. They, hey, Bernie Mac was a funny guy. Thank you. I'll take that as a compliment. I said you look like a broke one. No, nah, well, I'm not broke, so that's not okay. possible. But you know, so this is an interesting question. Joe with the fellas is almost no offense taken, bro. But how should non funny guys be approaching then without coming off as boring? This just say, I think, just the, the proper introduction, right? That's all they what you what else you gonna use. Proper introduction, and if she think you attractive, you continue to have a conversation, right? I mean, that would it, it should be. But Hamp, here's the thing, and this is an example. <laughs> Again, Hamp already told y'all men he was giving running down what y'all should do. He comes back around to say something to ask a question that was already answered. That's a turnoff. Like you not paying attention because Hamp had was already giving you what to say and how to say it. Hmm. Well, Joe, hit the link, man. We need to. We need to uh, mine this out. Lord have mercy. Don't call him Lord. He ain't coming. Well, the thing is, Amen. I mean, <laughs> what works for him may not work for Joel. So, I mean, that's that's what that's that's why the whole dating coach shit fell apart because you had these guys telling dudes pretty much, if you do this, 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 and this, you are gonna get the chick cheeks. You are gonna get the chick. No, that's bro. Every every man has to figure out what works for him. If you're a funny guy, but, use humor. If you if you yeah. are an attractive guy, use you know what I'm saying your attractiveness. If you're uh you know, whatever it is. I mean, everybody can't do everything. No, everybody can't do everything. That's what we, that's why I was asking him. Like, if you know you're not the funny guy, just a normal approach. You know what I mean? Introduce yourself. Let her know that you're interested, and carry on a conversation. I mean that that seemed like because the because Mr. Fantastic they already said if they think you're attractive you halfway in the door as it is so you don't got to do no shucking and jiving for all intents and purposes. Oh, yeah, it's, more, it's more than halfway. It's more like three quarter. <clears throat> they said, "Go ahead." They lying. They lying. How they lying? So they think you look <laughs> they're good. They lying. And they say you look. They think they think you're attractive. Hamp. Not just okay. All right. They think you are attractive, meaning that. They find you. You look good to them. You are already in there. You just you just gotta not fuck it up. You pretty much you know what I'm saying you got one foot in the bed and one out. You just get you know what I mean. Don't fuck it up. Hmm. See, look at Lauren. Lauren telling the truth. Lauren. Lauren always. See, yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. 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 Damn. But it's harder out here though, Miss Fantastic. I ain't gonna lie. Like with just some of the shit that they said dries up vaginas, I'm like, damn. That's cap too though. Um it, that's on but <laughs> him. That's 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 on, that's the cap. That's only but, for the dudes they're not attracted to. That's like the 80 20, right? So the dudes yeah. they find ugly, everything dry up the vagina. The nigga <laughs> that they look good. Listen, we're, trying, we're trying, we're trying to give people chances that we probably wouldn't normally notice. So those things come up, and then it's like I I don't know how to look past it because I already don't like you, but you seem nice. Okay, so mm -hmm. so okay, so what's the lowest guy like that you guys would entertain, like attractiveness wise? Like, what's the scale to two. like a two? Damn. So what's what's the you know we all ugly, fantastic. Ain't <laughs> we all like already them. ugly, so. It makes sense. THC, brother. I'm motherfucking tall, handsome, and chocolate, goddamn. All right. I, I don't know about. Know Dude, about wait, wait, wait. Time I'm just saying what they out. saying. Who? Lauren. THC, I dated a two before. Seal is a two. Seal dated models, though. Yeah, Seal is still attractive. Me. Seal still attractive, in my opinion. Yeah, Seal is a wait, two. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Two. Hold on, whoa, 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 hold on. Yeah, come whoa, 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 whoa. <clears throat> hold on. So let's, what, what let, about... let's let Lauren hold on, Mr. Tap before you tear seal ass up. Pause. <laughs> Lauren, seal is a two, bro. Seal Here's is a person two now. Man. Huh? I've dated somebody worse than that, so yeah. Wow. Yeah, but so 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 you so describe this guy so describe a describe what a two is for a man, right? All right. So so let me. You want me to go first and let me tell you what the two for a woman would be? Yeah. Okay. All right. 
a tube or a woman would be would be a woman that's horrible in the face. Her body, she has all her body is horrible. Like, you know what I mean? She's sloppy, she um lumpy, bumpy, um, and like, you know, she got like hygiene issues and shit. You know what I'm saying? Tubes and zero. Like really you gotta man. give a number. You gotta Harriet Tubman was a two, bro. <laughs> Yeah, and Harriet Tubman looked like damn. Um, what's the short dude used to be in the NBA? Like you. No, that's not. What? Harriet Tubman ain't never looked this good, nigga. <laughs> Harriet Tubman ain't never looked this good. <laughs> looked like looked like a great value, of Nate Robinson. That's what she looked like. Harriet Tubman looked like motherfucking great Robinson. Nate Robinson. Like <laughs> he said Harriet Tubman ain't never looked this good. She never looked this good. So, all right. So, just Jay, if you said not, not, not seal, who would be a two then? Ray Midnight was popping. <laughs> I, I, I can't say offhand. I just, I mean, I don't know. It's a combination. I, 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 I've, I've, I've dated guys who wasn't conventionally a, 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 a attractive, who were quote unquote ugly. So, yeah, but we're not saying you didn't date them. But who would be a two though? I don't like know. Name celebrity. some people and I'll tell you. I don't know. I can't think of nobody offhand. I don't know. Leslie Jones. Uh, but that's 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 a woman, no? So Shabba Rank. Oh, well. Shabba Rank. Oh, Shabba, Shabba is definitely a two. Yes. Kodak Black. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, Flavor Flay. Flavor Flay. What about Flavor Flay? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And, and I'm I'm not saying these people are ugly. Listen, anytime I'm talking about dudes, I go by what the women say. Okay? So this yeah. is oh, we understand thing. it. This is what women say oh, about you. Oh, women. this is a great one. <laughs> Yo, Craig Mack. I'm going to call Craig Mack a two, though. What'd you call him, a three? Maybe a four. He's cuter than Flavor 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 in your ear. He was like, I don't know. I don't remember the song. I don't remember what he looked like, though. Yeah, God, God bless him. Yeah. Fro, like, uh, Mr. Yep, yep, yep. He did. Yep, yep. He passed away. Four or five years ago. Yeah, so... Yeah, them niggas is tools for sure, B. But but you saying you would you would date them, huh? No, I said I tried. Forrest Whitaker's crazy. No, you no no you said no no you said you dated. Yeah. I dated. I tried. Yeah. Oh, but you did. So you them. did date them. So <laughs> I was, tried. So was he short? It didn't last, but you. you she didn't probably young. It so was, was not short? young. Was it was, he, was probably short, like. Dude? Nah, he was taller. He was probably like five nine. So he's a short dude. Hey, oh, hey. but I'm I'm five two. I'm so five that's ten. Not yeah, but that's, a, that's a short five nine. Is a short that's man. That's a six five. Right. Okay, we know you six five. Uh, man. Uh, oh, man. And the man, the average man standard is five nine. Come on, Hamp. That's all it. right, Mister Fantastic. What you rate yourself? Shiesty bum want to know. <laughs> that nigga there. Hey, I'm a motherfucker. Sell them all day, baby. Sell them. Average at best. You know, you know, you know, Mister Samuel said you can't use seven. I ain't, I ain't Mr. Samuels, goddamn. I'm a grown ass man. Man, do they want? Boys, do they can? I'm a seven, motherfucker. Seven. <laughs> that's not like a safe way. number, bro. Jogging, seven is a man. very safe number. Nah, seven. And no, no, but you know what is crazy? People I don't think I'm a five point five. They don't understand why you used um. He you didn't use seven, right? Because seven is like the perfect thing because you you usually go up or down one, right? So yeah. whatever you are on the scale, if you go up or down, that means you're still six and above. It means you're attractive. Right, so if you're seven, you're either a, a six on your bad day and an eight, possible eight on your your best day. So that's why I said not seven, but no, women, nigga. women, have, hey, I'm just saying, women have told me some other shit. You know what I'm saying? Okay, thank you for your <laughs> input. That's when that's hey, you know what I'm saying? That's 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 when these when when the you know what I'm saying? The stuff nah, started coming nigga. off. Y'all niggas, y'all yeah. y'all numbers be crazy, bro. I give yeah, myself five point five. I give myself like a four, you know, because it's it's mad niggas out here, me. Pause. Now, I mean, pause, yeah. But I'm just saying, like, yo, now I can adjust now. You know what I'm saying? Once I shave this extra 15 pounds, you know, who knows? You know what I'm saying? But right now, as it stands, come on, man. That nigga be up here lying like a motherfucker. No, I, I like oh. what Mr. Fantastic said with the seven. That's the average thing. <clears throat> Seven is not average. I think that's that falls right in the middle. No. I think it does. Everybody on the panel right now is between a three and a six. Oh, okay. Shit. 
Facts. Shit. We appreciate your opinion. Mm. What y'all think Greatly about that? It. I agree. Think? So, we, you hear agree? You. we hear you. <laughs> you think we you hear just you. We hear you. You just acknowledging <laughs> what I said? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, man. This is crazy. It's hard out here, man. It is hard out here. Aaron, you been listening? Yes. <laughs> the ladies, man, they, this shit is impossible. Because you know, Aaron, you know I be hard on the fellas sometimes. Pause about like, hey, you got to do your thing. We said workout, etc. But yo, you can't have Parkinson's fucking with them. You can't. <laughs> The <laughs> that. See, this it, is a lot. No oh my no. bad. I gotta get Devin in. My fault. Anemic, like, no. you, anemic, you can't like everything is an issue. You, you know, you know what fucked me up when we, when y'all were talking about sex and it was like you can't be too good. You can't pull out all of what was it was said. But I'm like, damn. All the tricks at the beginning. All, all the tricks. I mean, I'm not suggesting that's a good idea, but it, it, it almost alluded to like this. You can't be too good, but you, you can't be bad. You, you dare not suck. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? There's a gray area, and yeah. I'm sure that motherfucker moves to every woman. <laughs> Wait, so y'all don't do the same thing? Wow. Yeah, I'm about to say, I'll just do what I do. Fuck it. No, y'all don't no, think but... the same thing? Like, if you have sex with a woman and it's I you like it's nothing to look forward to. Yeah, no, it's all right. Yeah, but yeah, I mean, she. she I mean, I give her another shot. I yeah, mean, she can stay around. She can stay, but most mo most women are just all right. You know what I mean? Because y'all lazy. Women don't do yeah. that. Lauren, you know what you never hear? You know what you never hear man say to a woman? What? The shot was whack. Even if it is. Yeah. Nice. You never hear him say it. Not to the woman. Unless it's just bad. Unless it's just whatever they're missing. And then he don't even uh -huh. say it. He just leave you alone. He just he just yeah. he just goes. Right. You don't men don't but say it. The same? That's they, what Aaron is saying. That's what we saying. That's what we saying. Y'all y'all would tell a dude allegedly that you know, you know what I mean. Hey y'all 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 swear every man dick little right. You dick little. He can't do this. He can't do that. Two pump chump. All this stuff. Y'all talk everything about nigga when it comes to motherfucking what's his name. But again, this is why you get out in that pussy the first goddamn time. Goddamn. You get the first starfish is always fish. better than no fish until you find some new fish. First impression. Oh, is I'm gonna say it again. Starfish is know. better than no fish until you find. I don't some have new little dick problems, so I don't like that really. shit. Like that shit. No, but Aaron, no yeah, even, <laughs> even bitch was mad at me. Couldn't even say that shit. Aaron said starfish is better than no fish until you get new fish. Shit like that. <laughs> 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 Yeah, Granville but he said, can't starfish though. <laughs> Granville said he had two. Striking it rich with the five uh your uh no no pounds said if she looks at you as an alpha, a one night stand material, oh, i.e. one night stand material, you have to be confident. If she's looking for an LT long time long term relationship, then you can be a bit awkward or shy. Hmm, interesting. Jay yeah, Smooth with the smile says. If you got it, you got it. Confidence is just quote unquote being yourself. If she don't like who you are, then she's not for you. Find your lane. Be love. Salute. Like said, Hello to the beautiful Lauren. Uh CD with the final says, Does Fantastic have an Idris Elba mirror at home? What the yeah, no. looking like? <laughs> Strike it rich with the five dollars says. And they got enemies, man. Oh, let me kick. He ain't even coming up here. Striking it rich with the five. Seal might might be might be a, I think be yeah. a, he didn't he didn't mean to put the yeah. B in there. He said should be Yo, so I'm you out because you ain't coming up anyway. Let somebody else get in. The the, the back is full. Um Seal might be a two in the face, but in real life, Seal is six four and muscular. Chicks who seen him in real life were feeling him just like Dennis Rodman. Joseph, you're not coming up. The back is full. You just said you was back there. That's why I'm kicking you out out the back so somebody else can come up because it just said the studio was full. <clears throat> that's all. No, I mean, that's fair, right? We're just using, like, face, I guess. Pause. CD with the fellas. What is it with black women in numbers? If it's a scale one to ten, how can they say seven is middle? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I still they think it's crazy. average. They crazy, though. That 
AP with a five dollars. Damn, Uncle Phil, when you start cursing, <laughs> oh, your motherfucking life. God damn. <laughs> damn, I got you. I'm gonna bring you up in a second. Damn, man, Devin, what you think, man? I, I, I might have to apologize to y'all, man. This shit sound impossible, man. Uh, I mean. A lot of times they won't tell you is that it'll it'll just be something, but they'll just let you down easy. See, me me personally, uh, after the initial uh, greeting or whatever, <clears throat> I always ask if she's single or not, and then after that, I can kind of proceed from there. So I don't never really come with that too crazy or then like on the initial shit. And, uh, after that shit, we can uh I can crack my little jokes and shit as we chop you know if we chop it up for a little minute but I really don't try to kick it with one chick especially if I you know kind of just got in there so I really don't try to uh be seen just chopping it up with one chick so I might just got there talk to one chick cause they nearby and then after that keep it moving a little you know kind of move around so uh, they... yo so... yeah so they don't never just tell you oh no nah, nigga you awkward they they gonna you know just tell you like no nah, I'm fine with it question though when you talking to the lady do you say goddamn every every four words yeah when i'm comfortable but i can get i work a corporate job so i can't uh-huh. get very yeah right, but let me, when i get comfortable let me, I hear this. let me hear this shit. all right approach nay hey how you doing hey how are you i'm doing good uh what you out here doing tonight where are we? Depending on where we are. So uh, I, I don't know. He's just doing this. Damn. All right, yo. She. I guess we at the club. Oh, oh, I'm hanging out with my girls. Oh, okay. Got uh, you. Got a man? No. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, you want to drink or something? Chop it up for a little bit. No, I'm alright, but thank you though. What, what you don't drink or that? No, I do, but I'm okay. I'm good. I'm all good okay. for now. I ain't gonna, ain't gonna, uh, I ain't gonna put nothing in shit in that. I just want to, uh, you know, just chop it up a little bit. But, uh, who you with? I'm with, um, with Keisha, Sharonda, Tasha. Damn. <laughs> shit, it's on, I only got two homeboys, but shit. Got them. Um, y'all got a section? <laughs> yeah, we got a section, but it's full. Get it with oh, the god now. Put him in the middle of the god now. Alright, you have a good one. It was nice speaking to you. <laughs> yo, yo, yo stop, hit him with the god man. now. Stop, 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 man. And man. Nate, man, you fucked. You know what, Devin? I can't even give you a super duper L because she fucked it up. Talking about where we at? You, I don't even know where we were. <laughs> I was just trying to. I don't even go, go to clubs. So I'm like, where are we? Okay, it's a oh, fantastic, man. Mister Fantastic, show these niggas how it's done, Mister Fantastic. <laughs> Brother, brother, brother. Come on, hear it. Hey, what's up? How you doing? Hola. Como esta? Hola. Oh, you, oh, you Spanish. Oh, you got you, you speaking the Spanish? No, 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 no. Oh, Paquito. you just oh, okay. Paquito, okay, okay. Well, you know, we, we grande over here, baby. So, you know what I'm saying? You got you to gotta step it up a little bit. You feel me? But anyway, how you doing? What you doing? What you doing tonight? Where we at? What's, what's going on? Uh, I'm just out drinking with my friends. What you here for? Hey, I'm just, you know, just chilling, man. You know, I'm out here dolo as usual. Um, you know, trying to see what I can see, you know what I'm saying? And you caught my eye. What's going on with you? Looking real good out here tonight. What's up? Just trying to find a man. Trying to find a man. Well, hey, man. Mm-hmm. Hey, man with a plan right here, right in front of you. What's your name, love? What's what's up? What's your name? Jessica. Jessica. Jess Jesse for short? Not just Je- Jessica, it's a full name. Oh, Jessica. Okay, okay, not short. No, oh, okay. All right. I feel you. Um, so um you from here? You from around here? No. You're not, I'm from you're New York. Business? Oh, New York. Oh, New York. Wow. Oh, word word life B. I feel you, B. All right, son. You got the Tim's on. Oh, you got no Tim's on today, huh? <laughs> on God, on God. Word. You know oh what I'm saying? God. I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. Stop. Yeah. Man, tell me yeah, stop. Nigga. Yeah. yeah. Oh my God. She said, yeah. oh God. He was gonna be a new- what kind of New York guy was that? <laughs> that was hey, that awkward shit on a woman is sexy yeah. though. Hey, no, I so like if I don't like somebody, I make it horrible. I I make I up everything. It. The whole story but, is fake. <laughs> but yo, that yo, yo that, damn man. 
My name gonna be fake. Right. Everything. Oh no, man! Right now we 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 struggle loving, man. All right, John Queen, you ready? Ride. Yeah, let's get it. <laughs> let's get it. John Queen said, "Fuck it." Hey, Ro, how you doing today? I'm you know a name? Oh, Ro, he know your name already. You gotta Google this thing. You got you got you got to <laughs> Yo, you don't know her name yet, bro. <laughs> hey, beautiful. How are you? I'm good, handsome. How are you? I'm doing amazing today. Just got to class. What you been up to? I'm just chilling. I'm out here relaxing. Class. Are you in school? Yes, yes. I'm in college. It's my third semester. Okay. Not third semester. My third uh what's the, what's the word? Uh third year. It's my third year. Third year. Okay, what are you majoring in? Paralegal studies. Oh, you're trying to be a lawyer. Mm. Yes, a lawyer first, and I have some other plans too. Okay, good, good, good. Not you. I'm guessing you've been to college. I have. Oh, you have. Maybe we can study sometime. Maybe. Ooh. Whatever you need. You need help with anything? Just let me know. I I can use some help tutoring. Okay. Help. What you need help in? Um, I'm in federal government. I'm doing some political projects. If you can help me with that. Put him in the fucking bed. Get him out of here. Come on. Put him in the fucking bed. They got mad intellectual with this. Did this nigga say ooh? This nigga say ooh. He said ooh. Yo, yo. Oh, Them niggas. Oh, he got a tutor. Oh, he got a tutor out the deal. That nigga got a tutor. <laughs> a tutor and a job. Because I'm a tutor ooh. So you would have right. both. Aaron, Aaron, can you show us how it's done or what? Or you you've been married too long? What do you think? I've been married too long, but fuck it, I, I would do better than this. <laughs> All right, let's go. <laughs> hey, crazy. good evening. What what's your name? Jay. How are you? Jay, Aaron, I'm doing well. Aaron, pleasure to meet you. Listen, I, you see this guy next to me. I've been arguing with him all night about something. And you clearly are a woman of fashionable taste. So can I lean on your expertise for a second? Sure, why not? All right, great. So we were talking about suits, right? Back in the day, shark skin, all this other shit. And okay. he was trying to tell me that they used to make silk suits that were the shit. I'm like, bro, you can't even spell silk. And he goes and spells it like sockets and shit. Now, you know how to spell silk, right? Of course. Surely. How do you spell it? S-I-L-K. Well, you can't spell silk either. All right. Well, listen, oh, try man. it one more time. Try one more time, one more time. You said silk, correct? I did. Yeah. Okay. S I L K. Well, if that's the case, what do cows drink? <laughs> Think quick. You laughing already. <laughs> what do cows drink? They drink milk? Did you say milk? No, I didn't. Oh, what did you say? Well, I went back to spelling silk, but since you asked, yes, cows do drink milk. No, they drink they water. Make actually. Cows. No, they drink water. They make milk. They drink water. Speaking of, I'm about to get me another water to go with this scotch. How are you doing over there? You want one? Yes, I would like one. Thank you. Excellent. Bartender, do me a favor. Whatever she's doing, plus the water, double scotch here. Water. So, where, where are you from, Jeff? <laughs> I'm from Miami. Miami, no shit. What's a dating market like down there? I heard it's brutal. It's I horrible. Heard like, it's horrible. It? It's horrible. Yes. Mm -hmm. Horrible. Mm -hmm. I'm from Philly. It's it's dog shit up here. I hear you. I hear so what brings you out here to LA all the way from Miami? Just hanging out, little razzle dazzle, you know, just enjoying the sights. Razzle it, yeah. I, shit. Until now, I thought I came to enjoy the sights, but this brother's fucking up the game. Thanks to you, I can enjoy the sights again. When you, well, when you I'm go, glad when I was back, able to help you out with that. Appreciate it. When, when you go back to MIA? Uh, I'll be here for a few weeks. I Actually, I'll be here for about three weeks. Really? Yeah, I'll, I'll go back home in a couple of weeks myself. Maybe I have to uh, take a layover in uh, MIA. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> no, wait. Flag on the play. Flag on the play. Flag on the play. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, Uncle Phil. <laughs> But I thought what? I thought y'all ain't like when we play off uh oh, talking down on somebody. Nah, nah. Dirty Mac. <laughs> that ain't even dry dirty Mac and that's just full on. <laughs> Straight up and down, dirty Mac. <laughs> full Damn, on. man. Shout out to Aaron. Good job. I enjoy talking to him. That, that's what I'm saying. Like it's engaging, Yo, you know, like and he made me like genuinely think. laugh. 
Hey, but why you was blushing and all that though? I'm weird like that. <laughs> that's your quirkiness. No, yeah, no, it is. No. That's part of my quirkiness. Well, I enjoyed sure that. That was that's what's up. I like that. That was yo, fun. but you know, just Jay on some real shit though. Your responses to him, even though we role playing, was like genuine though. You feel me? Like that. that... <laughs> that's what's up. I like yo. See, the thousand two dollars says, Nah, Hamp, Devin did a great job. Salute. I don't know. Me, Devin was talking about he ain't gonna put nothing in somebody's drink. See, that put up my spidey yeah, sense. That was I, went back in the house. Yeah. <laughs> I went back in the house. I, that's all I'm saying. But you did good, Devin. Yo, so let's just I, say, I was this, Devin, when Lauren said, Shout out to Zoe with the five dollars, he said, Lauren Mac had me weeks. He said, Looking for a man. Do you feel like the prince of the manosphere capitalized on that line? When she said what? Looking for a man. Of course I did. Lauren oh, said that. Uh, uh, yeah. Come on. Damn. Dude. I don't even remember all that. <sighs> Joe, do you oh. remember that part? Do you feel like Mr. Fantastic capitalized on that line? Brother, brother, brother. Um, I, th- I think he did all right with it. I think, I think you, you did think okay. He capitalized though. Capitalized though. She must have said that fast. Well, I mean, I, I can I can only say I can only say he I can only say he didn't capitalize because I don't think he got the results he wanted. But I mean the effort was there. Sound like he didn't remember anyway. No, I know Sav- exactly what I said. I know exactly Savage, what I said. Well, we'll mind it out in a second. Hold yeah, on. Man. We only got a few D seven the two was with the three Canadians says fantastic need to change his name to <laughs> Mr. Mediocre. <laughs> Hey, hey, people, the two I is Jock Quinn. Take a second, sir. Yikes, son. Yeah, he got a tutor out the fucking deal. CD with the two dollars says he got light skin privilege. All row C is good hair. Uh, uh <laughs> AP said, okay, Uncle Phil. See, this pals with the two says, Aaron, I was taking note this whole time. Salute. Uh, Mike Brown said, well done, Aaron. <laughs> Marcus Evans said, two dollars. Aaron, great job. You made Philly proud. <laughs> Omar Smith with the ten ounces, make Philly proud, Aaron. <laughs> we not, can always not, swim not in them, turn. flexed on them. Shit like that. Shit like that. Oh man, it's a fantastic man. The OG done. <laughs> he done flexed on them. I love it. Oh, I gotta get scammed. Ooh, oh, yeah, yeah, not man. the bathhouse. What? Definitely, oh. definitely scam. You ready? Do I? Do you need? You need to wait before you go up, or you ready? What's good, y'all? Can hear me loud and clear. Oh my god, all right, just wait for a second. Randy, you know, he might got damn state of the art. Right. Right. Joe, you ready? Mike in the building. Hold on, yeah. Yo, you ready? Ready, ready for what? Troll competition. <laughs> Troll competition. <laughs> hey, all right. how y'all want me to follow up? How y'all want me to follow up, Aaron? That's unfair. Don't worry. Hey, just do your <laughs> best. Right. Hey, how you doing? How you doing tonight? Can I talk to you for a second? Sure. Hey, I just saw okay, you. I'm how are you? Here. I just pulled up. I just pulled up. You know, I just got here. I'm from out of town. I'm in town for the weekend. A couple of my homeboys. Oh, are you from? from here. I'm from Detroit. So you know, I'm out here in DC for the oh. weekend. You know, visiting some friends for school. So you know, they you know they said, hey, you should check out this bar. So you know, I just got here. I saw you was here. You know, look, you look nice tonight. Thank you. You look nice as well. Appreciate it. Thank you. By the way, my name is Joel. What's your name? Jessica. Jessica, nice to meet you. So, uh, you nice know, to meet you, you, you from out here in DC? No, you from out? You from here? No, I'm from Texas. Okay, Texas. I'm just visiting. Okay, uh, what brings you up here? I have a friend that lives out here, so I'm just visiting for her birthday. Okay, that's what's up. Hey, uh, so you know, I don't know if you, you know, I see, I see, you know, got a couple, got a couple seats at the bar. You like to head to the bar? You like something to drink? What you drinking? Uh, I, I prefer dark. You know, I like I like my whiskeys. I like my bourbons. You know, what about you? Uh, water. Okay. So, uh, well, I'm, I'm going to run to the bar real quick. I'm going to bring your water back. Yeah. Bottle of water, please. Thank you. <laughs> bottle of water. I got you. Okay. Not 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 the worst. Not not terrible. I like how you started off. <laughs> you talk fast yeah, anyways. I'm used to that. Maybe talk really fast. fast. Really he nice. always talk fast. So that's his cadence, yeah. though. Yeah, my my bad. I, I talk fast. <laughs> you had y'all it. I ain't like how she... y'all, y'all say it straightforward, right? Yeah, yeah. That was sarcasm. Nah, you yeah. did good though with the straightforward though. 
know what I'm saying? Yeah, this, this shit ain't easy, bro. That shit ain't hard. You did better than um. I ain't saying no name. Fuck, I'm not can't say it. <laughs> Lauren was already dripping. Goddamn, don't play with me. <laughs> that nigga never. Be... Shit like that. Shit like that. <laughs> All right. Oh man, yeah, I got a perfect one for a scam. <laughs> Yeah, what it is, man. What it is, shouty. <laughs> like the ice up on my mind. I represent the South, represent the H Town. What's good? That thing is, shouty. Check it out. My name is Ice Dusty. I represent the South. I got the goals up on my mind. You know what I'm talking about? I'm looking for a real deal, shouty. I'm talking about we can meet up at the gym. What it is? I'm trying to get it in. What it is, shouty? <laughs> What's your name is? You on mute, talking about? I'm here with you talking about. Your real teeth? Yeah, <laughs> I got fake gums and I got real teeth. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, okay. Lame game. I'm talking about. What's your name is? That's your real hair. Put him in the fucking bed. Get him out of here. Come on. <laughs> Damn, man. So, Aaron, what gave you? How did you obtain this level of comfort? Now, here's what they say, Aaron. They say us that play these college sports and you a military man on top of that, they try to call us outliers because we always had an advantage because of the sports we played, what what type of the level of um respect that brings, notoriety, etc. What you think? No, I actually I was I, listen, I was bullied when I was young. I'm be I'm be hundred percent candid. Up until about the eighth grade, I was a pariah. I was a nerd. I like race cars and all this other bullshit. Like, I didn't care about, I never had a pair of J's in my life. Like, it was wild. You wouldn't believe it. Mm -hmm. No, I'm laughing because they dropped scam after his performance. (laughs) (laughs) So, okay, so that's interesting, though. So, yeah, I had to create that. Yeah. Well, so happens, I went to a military academy. Okay. And played football there in high school, right? And kind of reinvented myself, and then went to college, and then the and then it just was it's a night and day thing. But mm-hmm. it's like a Jekyll and Hyde, man. Who I was is not, you know. That shit was I made a weapon on purpose. Hmm. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Probably the only man you know that would shoot pussy down just to shoot it down. Like I'm freezing <laughs> women out the bed. No, nah, not tonight, shorty. Oh yeah, like yeah, it was brutal. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. <clears throat> Mr. Fantastic. Where did you develop your game from? Uh, hey, question, question before you answer. Aaron, the fellas. Based on Mr. Fantastic game, could you tell that he's six five? No. No. It, 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 you can't really tell by how somebody talked though. See, that's the thing, though. There's a different development when you're that tall, though. You don't think so? He yeah, probably so was just nervous. It's not. Oh, he, he was, was nervous? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. No, Hold no, on, Devin. No, what no, you no, say? No, <laughs> Devin. I don't remember what the hell no, I said. Devin. Devin, chill. Devin. I don't remember what the hell I said. Hey, Mr. Fantastic, man, take his take him off the flyer for next Tuesday. Yeah, hey, what are we doing, man? Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> So if you I heard mean, what I said, Hemp know what I'm talking about, bro. Yeah, Hemp. Uh, she said, uh, "What? She said what? She's looking for a man." And what I said, look, uh, you know, big man right here, uh, man with the plan, some shit like that or whatever. Play on words, right? So, okay, yeah, so that's what you I, said there too. You gonna give attention to your size or whatever, right? You gotta heighten that shit. It's like subconscious and like it's it's psychology to it. So mm-hmm. if you know, yeah, you come with the shit or whatever, bro. You make little jokes about your size. You make height with a different sort of different shit. Hmm. Yeah, he said the, the grande shit and all that, pun intended. Um, Can y'all imagine me talking to somebody who's 6'5"? Well, how tall are you? Yeah, you, uh, you know. Hey, how tall are you? you look, hold on, hold on. Hold on. How you look talking to him? Right? <laughs> what, 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 what you do? Don't do it, Lauren. Lauren Wait, how would you, know you, you do it, Lauren? What the yeah, fuck Yeah, yeah, do it, do it again, Lauren. Show him. <laughs> how you look talking to him? You know that's aphrodisiac, right? 
You know a woman looking up at that tall man that's an aphrodisiac. The, the, the no, more angst, no, it's not. Up, you have a fucking no. crook in your neck looking at yeah. that man. <laughs> you gotta sit down talking to me. Joseph, Joseph you ready? No, huh? no, bro. I don't want to embarrass myself, man. <laughs> nah. nah, man. Nah, I'm nah. good, bro. I, nah, nah. I'm, I'm not even warm. Nah, up, Mr. Man. Red Pill. You have to go in the back. You got a lady. Uh, nah. You got a lady. Who? No. Well, man. just say what you told her. I got a girlfriend. Oh, man. man, Aaron had I got wife a girlfriend, man. Years. Aaron got a wife for 40 years. Come on, man. Yeah, she's in the living room. <laughs> She in the living room. <laughs> that nigga in the man cave ducked off. Nah, man. Nah, yeah. Joseph. Nah, nah, nah. See, see, see. Nah, uh-uh, uh-uh. Oh, my Ain't God. Ain't no way Joseph come up here and talk all that shit, and then he can't do a role play. That's not how life works. Uh-uh. He banned. <laughs> he banned, man. Damn, man. That shit is funny, man. Devin, how did you develop your game? Uh... I watched a lot of movies and I kind of put my own little spin on it in you know, trial and error. Like I watched a lot of black movies and shit. Like, uh, I, and then like my parents had, they had split up when I was 10. So I was in the house with two women. I got an older sister and my mom. So got down, you know, in combination, all the movies, all the R and B music in the background and shit. Got down, you know, it, I just had a trial and error. Got down. I just, I still get nervous sometimes, goddamn, like with, with like with chicken a big group and shit like that. I can't stand those situations like that. But so sometimes I do it depend on like how bad I want it or how much liquid courage I had. But uh once I get going, I'm pretty straight for real. It's really just the initial the initial going up that I really be like kind of wrestling with if I do kind of have any nervousness. Yeah. But after that shit, once I do it, I'm good. Like I just got them just I don't know. I, at this point, I just feel like I just be myself, but I did used to have to strategize to it, like with certain right, with certain right, situations. Right, right, right. Okay, never mind. God damn. I was trying to get there and lay out the point. Man, see, this is why I'm I'm pissed off at the Prince of the Manosphere, man. Angry man, what's popping? It wasn't that bad, huh? What's up? It's good. You know what time it is. What is this dude? I, I don't know what's going on. What's what's going on? You know how you know we always do uh role plays. So remember last time they was talking to us. Now we 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 practicing on we we showing the young boys how to do it. Oh um, hey, how are you doing today? I'm great. How are you? I'm chilling. I'm you know doing what I do. So Ooh, I like your smile. Appreciate it. So what's good with you? Nothing, just hanging out. What you doing here for? Hanging out with the fellas, chilling. You know how we always do. You feel what I'm saying? Just trying to find What's something good into. Shit, we got a little bit of, we got some great goose. We got some, depending on what you like, what you like. <laughs> I actually don't drink much. I normally drink wine. Word. Well, we get we get a little wine over here. We can get some Bel Air, you know what I'm saying? Who you with? You got your peoples over there? Yeah, That's me and my girl? best friend. Yeah. Where would y'all drink it? So y'all want some Bel Air? Get all y'all some Bel Air? Um, yeah, we'll try. I've never had that. Oh, you never had that? Yeah, I normally drink Sutter Homes. Okay. You feel me? I know a lot of a lot of a lot of women like that. You know, we gonna we gonna upgrade you though. We gonna we gonna hit you with the Bel Air. You know what I'm saying? What you getting into later? Oh, it's girls' night, so who knows? Word, word, word. Y'all, we gonna chill with this before the before the missus come in here and <laughs> punch me in my throat. <laughs> Hold on, I got her. I got her. Oh, oh punch shit! See, my throat, you feel me? <laughs> my assumption is that uh, they hitting the leg. They must want to. I got triple black. So that see that the 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 OGs kind of just you just having that conversation, but you you feel the OGs feel. I'm saying feel on purpose. Pause. Like they in charge of the conversation, you know what I'm saying? Even if like Lauren just asking, oh, "Oh, I like it." All right, cool, relax, sweetheart. You know <laughs> what I mean? Like you can hear him saying that without saying it. You feel me? Hold on, I gotta bring. Um, hold on, Joe. I gotta bring Triple Black. What's good? What's oh, happening? What's happening? In my ass, man. Let's see what type of game you got from one of the OGs. Uh oh. Damn. 
I mean, I've been looking at her. I mean, no, damn, she she definitely got uh, some cute. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, it's, it's a role play, I mean, Dribble Black. It's a role play. Yeah. <laughs> Not in the club. <laughs> Not I mean, the club. I mean, <laughs> you, know, you, got, you can talk to so her talk for real. To her like you black. just walking up to her. <laughs> nah, I mean, look, look at her demeanor, man. I mean, you don't like me? Come on. <laughs> Give me three reasons, man. You don't like me. Really? <laughs> She can't hear mm. you. Hi, how are you? <laughs> I'm, 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 hey, I'm all great, baby. How about you? How's I'm good. Going? I mean, how's Chilling. your night going? It's going. Yeah, it's going. Yep. Hopefully, I can make it better. Dang. <laughs> I mean, y'all niggas laughing and shit. Like, I mean. I'm really trying to put him in the bathroom. <laughs> put, 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 put him in the fucking bathroom. Get him out of here. Yo, why are you saying really... to him like that, Triple? Come on, man. No, you I mean, why are you ball blocking, man? I mean My bad. That was saying? that was angry, man. That wasn't me. That why was you angry man blocking? laughing. That was hey. angry man laughing. Nah, nah, man. Man. That was hey, you, you that's painful. Hey, triple black, you from Texas, right? No, nah, I'm from Florida, man. Florida. Mm. Florida, mm. hey, you uh, supposed to break out some of that Florida, and she from Florida too. You supposed to break out some of that. Don't do that. Don't yeah, do that. Y'all yeah, ain't give me. Y'all ain't give me a chance, man. God all right, damn. All right, all right, all right. Everybody mute. Everybody oh. mute. Everybody mute. Especially angry man and me. I'm <laughs> yeah. Go ahead, yeah. go ahead, triple black. Do your thing. Right, man, how, I mean, how how's your night going, man? It's going. It's going. I mean, how can I make yep. it better? Just tell me. I, I heard Florida. you from Florida. What part of Florida are you from? I'm from South Florida. South Florida as in? Yeah, down, I mean, we're at the bottom. You from Day to Broward. Damn. Is that going to make a difference? Like, you already know it niggas. is. You already, okay, was, okay, so you ain't from Broward because you know I don't fuck with Broward niggas. Yeah, I'm I'm from Dade. Dade. Okay, okay, that's what's up. What's that, man? What's going on? You tell me. I don't know, man. I'm I'm trying to check your temperature. What's your temperature, babe? Maybe you want me to something. tell you or you gonna take it? I'm gonna take it. Soon you tell me, man. Hey. You supposed to, you supposed to knock that out the park, bro. When she you said, you, bro. bro. <laughs> You won't take it. All right, all right. I, now you'd be like, you'd be like, well, shoot, I, hey, I now. got a thermometer. Now we can now. Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> nah, I mean, uh, no, I'm just saying I hey, fuck with her, man. You supposed to tell us the good, I, you, hey, you the timing. See, that's what timing is. It's critical. Yeah, baby, say ah. You just you <laughs> that shit. Now, bro, you call yourself an alpha woman or some shit like that. What? Let's see what type of juice you got if you had to initiate. If I had to initiate? You goddamn right. Okay. Hi, handsome. Hey, good evening. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Doing well, thanks. You over here by yourself? I saw you across the room. I am. Okay. What you drinking on? Uh, balcony 12 here, so a single malt scotch. Okay, it looks like it's getting empty. Would you like me to get you a new one? Uh, no thanks. I actually, uh, that was going to be my last one. Okay. Are you single? I am. Okay. Well, I was interested, so if you're interested, I wouldn't mind exchanging numbers. Interested in interested in getting to know each other oh sure yeah um i have no problem with that uh to what end you what cops because you asked me a lot of questions <laughs> <laughs> yo yo yeah it didn't look that easy now bro it ain't look easy. With the yeah that's your hell ain't it like, like, that's you know, your hell, you know, ain't with it. all camera 
Omar Smith for this and I said the smile from Lauren making shit rough for the fellas. LOL. We too stay in there, Joel. I love black love, even in make believe. Real shit. See, Joel, Joel ain't rough from it. Jalen with the final says, not scam trying to be like Paul Wall. H <laughs> town down. Jonathan with the two dollars says, being six five does give you a little more confidence. See, the pals with the two dollars says, six feet and up need less game. Trust me, I know. Striking the rich with the two pounds says, AM got Lauren about to climb through the screen. <laughs> Stop AP it. with the two dollars says, have a seat, uh, black. Brutal, bro. Damn. So tri Triple Black will be back in seven minutes, man. Marcus with the two dollars. Both Aaron and Am did great. Shout out to y'all. Yeah, yeah. Lauren, see, Lauren been trolling, niggas. Uh oh. You are fantastic. The music blast. Hold on. The music blasting. Hold on, bro. <laughs> It's Jessica, right? <laughs> Jessica from earlier? No, my name is Tiffany. No, it's Which a different girl. It's a different girl. That's fantastic. Okay. Wait, how many girls are trying to talk? You trying to talk to somebody else already? No, you hey, you got a twin cousin around here. Somebody, I swear, a girl that was just like you was hollering at me earlier today. She was fine. I hear that all the time. I hear that all the time, especially in Dallas. In Dallas? Somebody, somebody daddy is out here making a lot of babies. Oh, word. Like, oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, my baby making them? Oh, okay. All right. Be I'm careful, just saying. Be careful, it's a lot of doppelgangers. Be careful talking about making them babies. What's up with you, though, Lord? What, 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 what's up? You, you, you pulling up on me? What's, what's going on with nah, you? I'm just, I'm just waiting at the bar trying to get a drink. The bartender just keeps skipping over me every time. Oh, you need me to get his attention for you? You know what I'm saying? Let me go and reach over there and tap him on his shoulder. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey. She... Hey man, she's trying to get your attention. She's trying to get a drink, bro. What's up? Yeah, I just want to go ahead and order my wine. And what did you want to have? Oh, you get me a drink? Sure. Oh, man, a little, you got uh, his attention uh, for me? Oh, no problem. Um, tequila, I'm cool. Some tequila be great. Okay, go ahead and get him a tequila and my wine, and we'll be great. What is your name again? Fantastic. <clears throat> oh, well, my name is Tiffany. It's nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you too. Is Jeez. there more after the go? <laughs> Put him in the fucking bedroom. Get him out of here. Put him hey, in the fucking bedroom. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Boy had you stuttering in some more shit, boy. God damn. I'm not used not to easy. having to initiate. This shit is kind of hard, though. Not right, easy. Nate. Nate, you ready, Nate? <laughs> Nate says he's ready. Let me Nate see. Nate ready to shoot see. somebody down. She really. Oh, <laughs> nah, we, we don't want to get Angry Man in trouble, so let's do it. <laughs> I was ready for Angry Man too. Oh, you oh, want you Angry ready? Man? <laughs> I'm gonna try. I'm gonna give it a try. All right, come on. <laughs> All right. Okay. Hey, how you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Hold on, Angry Man. She initiated. She initiated. Oh, you? Oh, okay. All right, go ahead. Yeah, okay. she initiated. You know what I'm saying? So we in the club. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> oh, what's up? What's good with you? I see over there you smoking a, a cigar. What you got a cohiba? You know, a little uh, Camacho. A little Camacho, okay. You know, a little something about cigars. You sipping something with that? Yeah, you know, a little bit of uh, brandy. A little brandy, all right. I'm a bourbon girl myself. Okay, that's what's up. All right, all right. Can I offer you a drink? I mean, if you buying, I'm drinking. All right, let's go. Let's do this. Bartender, can you send uh, this lovely man over here something about what he was drinking? And I'll take a bourbon myself with her reserve. And be done? Yeah. Well, I gotta keep going. I don't know, it depends. <laughs> when, I mean, <laughs> they ain't scared, boy. <laughs> they ain't stealing no help. They gotta uh, seal help. They gotta seal hey. it, help. No, no, no. Nah, 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 nah. Yo, she, 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 she sealed that shit. You feel me? Nay, that way to represent, baby boy. <laughs> they did that. She did that. Did uh -oh, that. Just day, you gotta follow that up. Hold on, I got. Hold on, Aaron, I got you, Aaron. Don't don't go nowhere. I got a special one for you, just Jay. But you back in the uh passenger seat? No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Let's do this. Let's do this one. Let's do this one. Yeah. Jay, you up? 
<laughs> so I'm in the driver's seat? Yeah. Okay. Hi, how are you? I'm doing wonderful. How are you? I'm well. My name is Jay. What's your name? My name is Joel. Nice to meet you. That's what's up. Nice to meet you, Joel. I see you got these headphones on. They kind of remind me of the old school Walkman headphones. Are you an 80s baby? Oh, uh, yeah. Actually, I am. I was born in the 80s. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. The 80s was, it was it, that was a good decade. That was definitely a good decade. Oh, absolutely. So what brings you around these parts? I mean, I just got off work not too long ago, just uh, looking to wind down a little bit, have myself a drink, and you know, kick back and chill. Nice, nice. What you drinking? I'm having some, having some bullet straight. Okay, okay. That's what's up. Well, I wouldn't mind having a glass of wine with you. Is that okay? Oh, sure. Absolutely. Okay, all right. And you on your second glass or your first? Oh, uh, it's the first one. Just got here. Okay, bartender, can I get a double... And then I will take a nice Merlot. Like wine, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, I'm not a big drinker, but I do enjoy, you know, wine tasting. I'm somewhat of a novice sommelier, you know? Okay. It's the That's tannins, cool. you know, antioxidants are good for your skin. I see your melanin popping. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. It was nice, too. Thank you. That's right. This is not my job. I know my job. See, they think I'm masculine, ham, but I know my place. This is not my job. <laughs> hey, all right, hold on. All right, let me get. Let me get. Uh, fatty. Fatty, yeah, what's up? Good. We don't need no small talk. Don't say hi to us. Get the get the word. Hey, shout out to my boy Ann, by the way. Shout out to my boy Ann. Yeah, yeah. Appreciate it, man. So what is the game? I have to. I have to. Yeah, you have to I lay wrote. the Mac down. Baby girl, what's your name? <laughs> Let me buy you a drink. Ooh, -wee. hey, Ro. What the fuck, Ro? Can I put it in? <laughs> hmm? What's that smart? Can I put it in, bro? Put what in where? Just the thing. What? Wait, hey, oh, oh, now that that was weird. Brother, brother, brother. Put him in the fucking bedroom. Get him out of here. Come on. Oh, look, 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 look at their smiling and giggling. I know, you know, Ro knows what's yeah, up. Bro. Just hey, bro. tip. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I'm sweating, man. God mm -hmm. damn. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Yo, all right, man. Stop trolling, man. Lay the Mac down this time. God damn it. I, I don't have a game, man. Try it. Hey, bro. bro. You don't know her name, Fatty. It's in the club. Oh, uh, uh, lady, can I sit on your lap? All the seats are Fat taken. Fatty. What? <laughs> all the seats are taken. <laughs> Yo, man, what? play the fucking game, bro. All the seats are taken, bro. Look at me. <laughs> you don't know her name. Look, 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 no, okay, name? I apologize. Her name is not Ro. Hey, lady, look at me. Look at me. Can I pull your hair? <laughs> Put him in the fucking bed. Come on, man. Come on, Why man. You guys are being haters and jealous. <laughs> this is dirty Mac. <laughs> Did you say we Why jealous? You jealous? Yeah, you are dirty Mac. What the fuck is going on? She's giggling. She's smiling. She's killing me. <laughs> you guys are the ones saying it doesn't work. All right, all right. No, I got one for you because Nay ain't going to laugh. All right, let's do it. <laughs> oh, later. Nay, uh -oh. don't want to laugh. Nay. Nay. Mm, I would lick the book. Uh, no. All right, I know. How you doing? That is so disrespectful. Yes. <laughs> I, I would say that to a guy. I'd be like, I will do a ton of the respectful things to you, man. If you see what I'm saying. Okay, you have a good day, sir. Nah, man. Damn. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Hey, did y'all notice this though? Um, I'm gonna bring I'm gonna bring Aaron. That was a good line though, Fatty. When you I said I'll do a ton of disrespectful things. That that was Angry a good man, line, though, bro. Man, don't encourage that. That that that, that was that a good line, bro. The best line you is like, just the tip. Just the tip is the best line. You close it every single time. Yeah, especially when you say tip. 
Yo. <laughs> but did y'all notice this though, right? Remember they talking about drinks or not drinks, etc. The ladies of me almost immediately defaulted to what you drinking. Did y'all notice that? Mm. Yep, tricking, tricking. See, Big see, trick. see, see, you Super said tricky. don't use this, don't use that, but y'all immediately went to Lauren talking about she don't drink, but what you drinking? Yep. You know what you should do, Pimp? Yep. The next time you do it, you should say you can't use the drink line. Damn, what people gonna say? Damn, yeah, man. see. Hey, you you already used the point that drinks leave people comfortable when you gave us the analogy, like you gave us the stats earlier about yeah. people in the club. So yeah. I was thinking that was an icebreaker to make people more no, comfy. It's hey, solid, it's solid, but too. it's just it's just ironic that the ladies also defaulted defaulted to right. drink. You know what right. I mean? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, we gotta get they something. probably going off what they get. Oh, fantastic <laughs> didn't offer no damn drink. I'm the only nigga that I ain't offer shit, but me also ain't clothes neither, nigga. <laughs> I, you, it, hey, I told you, Lauren was motherfucking dripping with them Tim's on. Okay, she was doing the Let It Burn Usher shit. All right, don't play with me. Devin was trying to come to Now you got a now you got a real New York nigga on deck. Now you got a real New York nigga on deck. Now oh, yeah, let's, see, let's see this country oh, ass game work this work. time. It's easy work, huh? Go ahead. Work, right? Hold on. Hey, what's up? Hey, love, how you doing? What's your name? Nay, how are you? What's your I'm name? Good. Um, um, I'm, I'm fantastic. What's going on with you? Your name is fantastic. Yeah, fantastic. Mm, you don't have a regular name. I'm not a regular guy. Why would I have a regular Woo. name? Because your mama didn't name me fantastic. How you know that? That's not your name. What's your real name? If I tell you my real name, you gonna fall in love with me. Mm, we'll see. Oh, we gonna see. All right, well, good. You can find out later on tonight. I'm saying we leave. What's, what's up with you? Yeah. <laughs> What's up with you? I'm trying to find out what's up with you. Who, who you here? You here by yourself? You dolo? I'm here with my girls. Your girls? Oh man. Well, hey, um, tell your tell your girls you need a hall pass because you know what I mean. You trying to get up out of here? You know what I mean? Go see what's going other than this club, right? I came with them. I leave with them. You leave with them for sure? It's guaranteed. Yeah. yeah. If I came with them, I leave with them. Y'all need a bodyguard? You need some security? <laughs> no, I'm good. You sure? But I'll take your number. I'll call you. You gonna call me? Mm -hmm, I call you. <laughs> Yo, she turned up the difficulty. She put yeah, it on she, hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, look, she already. Yeah, she know. always. She, she's yeah, a tough you, one. Yo, Nate, you made it too <laughs> difficult, Nate. God, oh, yeah. See, see? Hey, she turned the sliders all the way to ninety nine. She had to. <laughs> Cause even even when he said his name, he did it like perfectly. Cause that was dope, though. It's like he said he was fantastic and he was fantastic, like at the same time. Yo, like right. man, mama see, man, man, you fucked that up, Nacy. You was you was you was too wrong, man. Be, see, and that's him. See, they, they, they try. They see this is why you can't trust women because when they when you got them, oh they gonna still act like you don't got them. How yeah, they be trying to me? maintain that control. Really yeah. Like a chick from her, hanging out with her friends, and she's supposed to leave with you. She don't even know you. Well, no, I didn't. No, Yo, so this is what Golden, I was saying, right? So, hold on you, a second. So, Golden what, Child, you got to get on. You got to get on camera, my G. I'm, I'm going to drop you at the back so somebody else can get in. So, um, nah, so normally how I go, Nate, is like, you know, back and forth or whatever. But you just immediately went down to like, nigga trying on. to kidnap me type shit. I wasn't trying to kidnap you. I'm just trying to, you know what I'm saying, find a way to get up in there. So, you know. Get up in there. Yeah, of course. That's you know, you know what I came here for. Come on, Nate. Wow. Yeah, yeah, motherfucker. Oh yeah, motherfucker. Did Ro did, did Ro offer anybody a drink? Yeah, hell, hell, hell. Yeah. hell yeah. She was trying to get yeah. Aaron drunk as a skunk. She tricked out the gate. I was just playing. <laughs> she was tricked out the gate. Before she got his name, she, she asked him. Aaron Loki curved her. He said, oh, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> all right hold on hold on i got oh man hold on man right, he need an intro man i'm gonna give him my spot hold on hold on hold on a second man he need his own intro goddamn that's for sure that's how you say it right Devin. goddamn right like that mm -hmm. he need his own intro goddamn did i do it right yeah i got down yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Damn. This nigga. The original brother darkness. OG's P in the building. Man, he don't count. He an actor. Uh oh. 
Uh oh. OG, you up? No, we ain't OG. at nowhere. We ain't at nowhere. All right. What? The lady, me and the lady. Yeah, I'm up. We, we, we at the bar, but I thought you were trying to get a date or something. But nah. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, beautiful? I'm fine. How are you? I'm doing fine. I, you know what? Um, I was over there on the other side, and I'm going to just tell you something. I'm fine. Can you hear me loud and clear? Yes, I actually can. Sounds kind of Okay, cool, well, though. thank you. Uh, so here's the way. Uh, I seen you on the other side. and Okay, hold on. We got something going on in the background. Okay, <laughs> now, DJ, could you turn the music down? All right. I know the DJ, okay? You told the DJ to turn the music down. Uh, it's just that important. Beautiful. I seen you smiling from across the room. And you just lit up my life. I'm telling you, and it's not a line. I just had, that's what attracts me to beautiful women like that. Let me ask you a question. My name is Askia, and uh, what is yours? Jay. Your name is Jay? Yes. That sounds good. That sounds good. How long you been locking? I've been locking, actually, a combination of over 20 years. Oh, that's good. Uh, I'm finna get me a drink, and uh, and when I'm in the presence of a lady, I always ask her, would you like to have a drink, too? Sure, I wouldn't mind. Oh, uh, what are you drinking? I will take a Chardonnay. Okay. Um, bartender, that's one Chardonnay. Let me have one coffee. No sugar. Make it look just like me. Um, and uh, I need a tall glass of legs on some ice. And if it don't look as good as her legs, don't break it. And uh, that'll be all for now. Anything else you want, young lady? No, I think I'm actually good. I, th I think good? I'm actually good. Yes. See, that's that smile I seen across the room. I knew I was going to make it happen. I knew I was going to make it happen. But anyway. I <laughs> wait, 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 my, bad. That? my bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. Old school bad. players from the Himalayas. <laughs> <laughs> That's just be a commercial. Pop the molly. I'm sweating. Woo! Okay. Uh, are we back to part two of the day? Of the day? Yeah, go ahead, OG. You know, uh, believe it or not, I just came in here tonight because they said they was having an open mic night. And I got a joke. And I want to ask you, you think it's appropriate for me? I mean, I know everybody here is 21, but, you know, some people are a little sensitive, okay? Right, so, right, right. But I'm going to put you in my joke, though. Would, would you mind? It depends on what the joke is. Can I hear it first, or okay, would you like to surprise what, that, me? That, no, no. I'm going to get on stage. This is what I'm going to do. And I, okay. I seen the, I seen this lady over there with a beautiful smile, and I didn't know what to say to her, and I didn't want to get rejected. But I know if I made her laugh and not made her mad, it, it was open. The door was open. So this is where this thing go. I went over to this lady, and I didn't know what to say, and I said, look here, my name is Askia, and I usually don't do this. And I'm probably not the kind of guy that you're attracted to, but I know when you go to the bathroom, some of the ladies go tell you this. Did you know that I was seven-time world champion pussy eater? <laughs> Yo! Shit like that. I wasn't ready. <laughs> I bet you weren't ready for that. I, I wasn't ready. Don't do it. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I Damn, yo. Hey, oh, Fatty. But Jay, Please. you was leaning in. You was leaning in like he was telling you a secret. Stop about the joke. Yeah, I don't want anybody to hear it. Hey, M, 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 you know what's funny? OG, what's didn't you say that you don't eat pussy? I don't, but see, that opens the door. <laughs> no, see, that's what, yeah. see, that's that is, part of what the game. you don't understand. I use the pussy eating content. <laughs> like the the gynecologist. I, I mean, I used to actually sit down with a woman and tell her, she said, what do you do? And I said, well, I'm a gynecologist. Oh, hold on, hold on. That's one of my patients right there. She's been stalking me. <laughs> I, go, I do shit like that. You know what I mean? I That's a good one. Like that. That's actually a good one. That's yeah. a good Yo, so, all right, now, hold on now. I got, all right, wait a minute now. The the, the OGs is, is wiping the floor. Don't do it, then. Don't do it. Fatty, man. Hold on. I'm just saying, bro. Do it. 
We like. I'm Don't hurt. Y'all gave y'all gave motherfucker OG no, two, what's two, real two, like? two quarters. OG took 15 minutes to do that damn. To, to, here's a whole routine. Yeah. Wait, wait, it wait, was wait, entertaining. Wait, wait. On, it was on, entertaining on, the whole fantastic. time. Hey, hey, wait a minute, fantastic. Hold I on, OG, OG, let me stick up for you. Let me stick up for you. OG, let me stick up for you. Okay, let me stick up for you. Hey, uh, and it's fantastic. Uh, this is your future, Playboy. Damn. You better hope you look like OG look at in 30 years. I just woke up and I got my bags on. All right, all right, OG. He's a man. So, so, Mr. Fantastic, what's up? Why is why are they so much more crisp? I don't see more crisp. Okay, I see again with OG. He took motherfucking you know the 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 okay, whole damn Aaron. Record. Okay, Aaron. Okay, no, Aaron. Man. No, Aaron. So, so no, Aaron's thing is like their setup is more of a, um I guess like they they do more of a role play in the actual game. So like think about it, right? So OG had the thing to where he like got stuff involved with the the thing in the comedy show. Aaron used the thing as to where, hey, I got a friend of mine and we're trying to decide about something, so on and so forth. So like, it seems like they bring more people into it. AM shit was just straight up. AM was more modern, the way he has a combo, off of the drinks, yeah, so on yeah, and so yeah. forth. Yeah, yeah. And I hear you breaking. I hear you breaking down that day game. I'm saying, but I that the OGs represented though. You are lying, yeah, but, but they they were also more laid back and they weren't really trying to get to the point. Comfortable, comfortable. Well, well no, no, I'm, I, I don't were, know. I was comfortable. I'm not gonna say. Hold on, I'm not gonna say comfortable. They were safe. They were safe. The ladies, ask the ladies. They were safe. The ladies are gonna say that. But I'm telling you, they were safe. They weren't. They weren't hey, making it. They, OG they said he's the pussy in champ of the world. Yeah, but that was obvious. Seven so times. That was man. Man, like I said, after his thirty minute routine, <laughs> he finally he he brought he closed that out with that. But what I'm saying is they were safe. I'm this a is fantastic. Out now. So, so oh, wait, fantastic. so wait, fantastic. Wait a minute, fantastic. Are you saying that the women was going easy on us? Is that what you're saying? No, 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 no. No, I'm saying you you y'all had better responses though. No, no, I'm talking. I'm talking about y'all's approach. I'm not saying the women were what's that? Even though they didn't motherfucking. Deliberately try to curve y'all. That that yeah. That. She ain't have a homegirl with a full section. Oh, yeah. you're saying that we was being moderate. Yeah, I'm saying y'all weren't going for the kill. Y'all just like trying to chill, so on and so forth, and then you mingle from there. You feel well, what I'm saying? That's I'm be, coming that's in. That's I'm coming in. Right let you know. You know what I want. God damn it. But you know what I'm though. What's effective? You gotta, what's you gotta, effective? You, you got a that's season. Effective. You got a season, bro. You got a nah, you got nah, a nah, finesse. You got a I don't know about that. No, no, no. Mm -mm. no. I, you know, you know it's funny. Yes. I, I don't need know. To know. I don't... Hold on, Fatty, just real quick. She needs to know that I'm approaching you for you know what I want. Right, and no, and no, I said, I never see, brought, no, no, see, I never here's, brought sex up. I don't have to bring sex mic, up. Mr. But I don't give her the energy. No, here's, her the thing, here's the thing, bro. Here's the thing, bro. Here's the thing. Okay, I, I don't know how the young dudes do it, but it's the moment you approach a chick, it's like a dance. You're 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 vibing with each other. You you got to feel it out first. You can't just you can't just hit them in the head quick with the yes you, you can. know so what you, what, you, what you trying to do tonight you know what i'm saying like what, what you trying to like you know niggas can do that but it's yes, like you can nah, I, have, man. I have i have yeah, I'll, I'll, tell you what it is. I'll tell you what it is i'm gonna tell you what uh. it is see i know what it is i know <laughs> what it is see y'all don't enjoy the game y'all y'all don't enjoy the, the, the interaction y'all don't, don't like enjoy doing it. The work tell the truth they don't like hey, doing the work angry man like, hey, hey, like, you know i hate it i hate it you know why i know that these people are out of the game for a while and what's i have that? no game why is it why is it into woman work so like and be on nightclubs all the time you being mean to woman is literally like it works all the time Pulling her hair like Rose smiling, <laughs> like like I I come from the day that the mean motherfuckers on the club that actually were mean to woman were the one that always get woman to, to like they will always get the woman to woman. So why are you talking about the drinks but and all even that? Though, even though that, even though that even though that works though even though that works on occasions, fatty, that doesn't mean that that 
is the only method that works. That that yeah, doesn't mean I'm, that there I'm aren't kidding. still dudes out here that's smooth and, and suave and, and vibe with the chick. There's still they dudes out here it. like that. And that's why y'all be getting the women that y'all get. Just know that. Bro, you were smiling. I was laughing. laughing at you. Yeah, I, wasn't laughing. Smiling. I got you. <laughs> Hey, uh, yeah. I put a poll up. I put a poll up. I put a poll up to vet it out, man. We're gonna see what the poll says. Man, that's your situation. Ninety percent yes. I said, did the OGs have better game? Ninety percent yes so far. Uh Ms. That's a lie. Yeah. Now what did <laughs> that's a lie? Damn, y'all can't hear me. I need cover. Yeah, we can hear you. Uh, OG question. How tall are you? I'm six and one and a half. Okay. Cat nigga you, stay in there. In there. I had a, well, OG, OG, I want you to say what you I want. I'm going I'm to ask you a question that you can go in and say what you want to say. I'm going to bring yes, up uh, either Devin or Devin. Do you think Fatty's approach and Mr. Fantastic approach or lack thereof has to do with them being between 6'3 six, and 6 six foot, 5 foot tall? Six well, and I, I think... Uh, fantastic uh does it the way he is and i think it's more of the mo one approach um and i think fatty used the benefit of who he is and 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 it might be due to his sight and his his height and his weight and everything else because if a woman's looking at your weight and your height and you willing to laugh at yourself and laugh with something you about to say to her it takes all that negativity away because yeah. the person who and I'm a good singer, right, right, and a person right? who yeah, you you say you sound like one Not of the temptations cow. didn't Damn. make it. Uh, <laughs> but anyway, uh, <laughs> but what I want to say is, one of the things y'all didn't hear in that approach, I acknowledge that the young lady had a unique hairstyle, and see, ladies like to for that you was a good special, one. That was ladies good. like when you when you uh, dress them. And you you have something that they consider unique. And when you find women who do locks, that's very unique. And she's wrapped, you know what I mean? So you acknowledge that, but you don't hone in it, but you just acknowledge it. And then when you go from acknowledging who she is, so that takes away that you coming over here with this super chest and thank you to world, you put yourself in not a what I would call a vulnerable position, but what you do do, you show you have character. Like when I ordered the coffee and I said, make it look just like me. So that let the bartender know and the lady know that I'm comfortable in my skin and my color. See, this th this reason why I do certain things when I'm talking to that was That was, uh the hair thing was too close to a compliment though, OG. But yes, but you know what? But believe it or not, <laughs> it's something I like and I enjoy because I don't have to tell her down the line, I don't, I, I, I like natural hair. I have already identified with her that I have a connection with her hair. You understand even it. Know to say, <laughs> even though just to say locking and not dreadlocks. See, when Fact. you say dreadlocks, you go get into some other shit that you don't yeah. know what you're talking about. But when you say how long you've been locking, see, there's a certain way you apply these things when you're talking you about it. You I know. have 11 sisters, so I got a PhD when it comes to talking to women. But but you, you lost her with the, oh, give me a two long legs, just like her. No, 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 I didn't lose her. Oh, I didn't you, lose you, her. You, you, I, wait, 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 wait. That's an easy way to let her know I'm sexual. But I'm not in our roles. No, 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 no. See, so y'all keep thinking the things that I'm working, it's going to work for y'all for males. Y'all got to understand how a woman's mind thinks. Mm. It shouldn't be turning you on, Fatty. <laughs> it was for her. You understand? What? <laughs> it was for her. But it's a subtle <laughs> way <laughs> when I say a tall glass of legs on ice. So it's a subtle way to let her know that I'm sexual, but I'm not overtoning it. Mm. But, you, but you noticed I've been doing this one shit for her. a long time, bro. Hey, OG, yeah. I think you should. I think you should show her how fe flexible you are, like you did yesterday. All right, see, now, nah, uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let, Ham, I want to. I want to discuss that. All right. All right. Well, let me read the super chat. I want to discuss that. All right. Let's think through it first. Let me just read the super chats first before you okay, think about if you want to discuss that or not. I already Jesus got Powell. it in my head. It's locked in. All right, so you done with you? You you thought you thought about it. Jesus Powell yeah. for the two dollars. Say, bro, I think you did good though. Yeah, Ro Ro did good. I think she she got caught up in trying to close at at the end, but I think initially you was straight. Unk with the two dollars. Put me up to back, Coach Ham. I'm ready to play. Hit the link. I don't know. If no Damn, in the back. Do I need to pause? Pause, Unk, just in case. 
CD with the five dollars says, Lauren, as an icebreaker, you could have complimented Fantastic on his George Jefferson hairdo. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Congo with the five dollars says, hit, hit the like button. Hemp, love it, brother. Yeah, this shit is funny as hell, man. Real Pookie with the five dollars says, this is embarrassing. Shout out to Hemp. Salute. Y'all mans is are uh, trash. Dumps the juice. The struggle is real. So with the always, says, always on that shit. <laughs> Aaron from Philly taking the W for the fellas, and, ju and just Jay and Lauren took the W for the ladies. This was obvious, 100. Congo with the fight out says, OG style, how you start is how you finish. Deliver with a big tip. Pause. YKS with the fight out says, great show, Hamp. Lauren, he got wild hearts and all that. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Trigger Mike with the fight out says, damn, Hamp got Lauren and designer on the panel. Major moves. <laughs> What's design? <laughs> oh no! That nigga stupid, man. <laughs> oh, he's <talking> about Devin. <laughs> Marcus, everyone tells to take Fatty to school. OG, <laughs> all right. OG, um, now uh, hold on, OG, before you go. And it's a fantastic. I understand what you were saying in terms of angry man. You know, uh, but he was definitely inviting, listening to what she had to say. Made sure he included her friends. Said he was gonna upgrade her at the same time. You know what I mean? And it was real easy for him to have a conversation. It wasn't awkward. He wasn't trying too hard. We didn't yeah, see that with the young boys as much. Yeah, but that's, that's what, and that's what I'm saying. And that's what I'm saying, right? So they like I said, I'm, the only, I'm the only one. Yeah, because I'm the only one that didn't offer no drink. I'm not offering no drink. I'm not giving her. You got money. Don't matter. Damn, I got money for me. So <laughs> I'm not. Offering, <laughs> I'm not offering her anything to 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 talk to me. Me talking to her is the fucking privilege. And if we gonna do something, we gonna do something. But I'm not going to offer you something in order to right. talk to you, Mr. Fantastic. Sure, let me paint a picture. Do it without the drink. Yeah, you can do it. <laughs> that ain't hard. That's <laughs> not hard at all. You want to show him? You want to show him? <laughs> 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 Yo, AM, let's do it, man. All right, that ain't hard. <laughs> Yo, the ladies, yo, the ladies ain't shit. Y'all will never hit the link, man. Go ahead, Angry Man. Damn. I swear, hey, man. Hey, how you hey. doing? I seen you across the room. What, what's your name? Lauren. Lauren, where you from, Lauren? I'm from Texas. You from Texas? Word. Mm -hmm. I heard they do it big in Texas. You feel me? So what you All what you way. doing? What you doing tonight? Just hanging out with my friends. Word. Yo, I got my homies over here. We might be getting into some, going to this other spot, you know. We're gonna kick it over there. It's real live. You wanna come through? You and your you and your people. I'll ask them and see if they're interested. Uh what's your what's your name and number? Yo, my name is Valdez. Let me matter of fact, here's my phone. Put your number in my phone. I'll hit you okay. up later. Okay, thank you. Shit like that. Shit like that. Shit like that. No drink. Mr. Fantastic. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Look, still tricking. You ready? What? All right, we good? All right. He said still tricking. Listen, <laughs> Listen I wanted to come Hello. over and introduce myself. I, I only have a minute. My flight is getting ready to leave. Um, on, Anthony, what's your name? Monica. <laughs> Monica. I'm Aaron. Pleasure to meet you. Listen, my flight departs in about four minutes, but I'm going to be back in town next week for a charity fundraiser, and you look like a perfect guest. Um, I would like to offer to take you on my arm as a guest, and the President of the United States will be there, a couple of governors, but I need to know that you're interesting. If you can just tell me one interesting fact about you. Anything. I'm from South Dakota. So, whoa. Very interesting. I'm going to ask you about that in a minute. Um, I have an interesting fact. Don't take this the wrong way, but I'm in the Guinness Book of World Records as the only man on the planet that can lick his eyebrows. Now, South Dakota. Where in South Dakota are you from? <laughs> South Dakota. <laughs> Sioux Falls. Sioux Falls, South Dakota. Oh, boy. <laughs> Sioux Falls. All right, listen, can we exchange numbers? I'm going to be back in town next week. Can we continue this conversation next week? Sure, we have to wait till next week, though. No, I can call you as soon as my flight touches down if you'd like. Sure, give me a call. Excellent. Here's my phone. So I put my number in. Give me a call as soon as you touch down, okay? 
That's me. Will do, Monica. Thank you so much. Good meeting you. That's what about me, Monica? Monica! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> these, niggas, these niggas went from tricking with drinks to tricking to eating that pussy. God damn. How can you compete with this shit? Come on, man. You said anything about eating pussy? <laughs> hey, your eyebrows, that brother, that's definitely a motherfucking sexual in the window, brother. Come on, meeting the president and shit. But, like, but come I didn't on. do the OG. OG's the seven-time yeah, award-winning world champion. Yeah. Sioux Falls Damn. next week. I'll see you there. But actually, there's a there's a good like the first the opening. I'm I'm going to be in town, or I have to take a flight, and da 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 da. That's actually pretty good. Cause it sounds like you're about to leave. They're actually pretty good. There's a pretty good one. I'm in town. Da, da, da. Like, cause the tourists usually get the benefit of the doubt. Oh, you're leaving? Let me make sure I give it to you real quick. So that's actually a pretty good line. But I didn't know it could lie. So next time, I... you fatty. You said there was no uh, open seats. She knows though. Is she? You know Obama? What the fuck? How <laughs> you can compete with that shit? There was no open seats. That was a lie. <laughs> And I lost money <laughs> for Aaron because he knows the president. What the fuck? That's she. The president. <laughs> mm, 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 Damn, mm. man. Callie, what's popping? What you doing here? Callie. Hey, Callie. Hi, Callie. Your mic is, is, is off, Callie. And Monica, you are a traitor. I hate you. Yo, fatty, they say you got to go again, B. Oh, you want me to go in? Can I lie? <laughs> okay. I got you. I don't really want you to go to crowd. I have three though. lines. Who, who is? I have three lines. Let's go. Let's go, Monica. Me and you. What's <laughs> <laughs> up, Monica? I have a mansion with the pool. Who is Monica? You. <laughs> I saw you talking with the other dude. I'm sorry. You're playing me, Monica? I have that's, a Ferrari, Monica. That's not my name. What's your name? <laughs> Angelique. What? Angelique. Angelique. So, Angelique. You know why they call me Fatty? Because my girth is like... <clears throat> like... Oh, my God. Fatty. Fatty. Hush. Yo, yo, yo. Put me up there, so, bro. Put me up there, bro. Aaron can lie. Why can't I lie, too? <laughs> okay, so, so, fatty stupid. So, yeah. I just have to Why can't I lie? <laughs> So I, I just happened to be ear hustling. I heard the guy talking about the Ferrari. I don't have a Ferrari. Okay. But I did want to know what your name was. Okay. You need to know my name? Yeah. What's your name? It's Monica. Monica. Oh, I did hear that. Yeah, I don't got no Ferrari. I actually Ferrari. drive uh, I actually drive the Oscar Mayer Wiener Mobile. And I only got two payments left. Mm. Oh. So you own the business. You're an independent contractor? Yeah. Well, actually, that's not what I do for a living. So, what, Okay. What do you do for a living? I'm a professional underwear model. Really? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think he said it's a glizzy wagon. Brother, brother, brother. The glizzy wagon. The glizzy wagon. <laughs> The glizzy wolf. The glizzy wolf. I just want to mess with, yeah. with Roe real quick. Uh, <laughs> put, 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 put him in the fuck up, man. Get him out of here. Come on. Don't forget about it. Man. Huh? <laughs> Go ahead. OG, you was about to say something? Yeah. I, I, oh yeah. So what's I, up with you? I, 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 what's up with your with your flexibility or mobility, whatever you were showing off? Can, can we get back to that? But I want to try his flexibility. What? That's wild, bro. Yeah. Yesterday he did. Um, he did <laughs> Who you want to talk to, OG? Lauren. Like, that's just anything. You want to talk to Lauren? Yeah. Lauren <laughs> oh, is so funny. Let's go. <laughs> One of Hit the like button. One of notches. Come on, sir. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, sir. Come on, Tia Yamas. I don't remember. I, did, I failed Spanish, too. Well, don't worry about it. I heard you speaking it earlier, and uh, I speak conscious Spanish, so don't even worry about it, all right? You wouldn't understand okay. if you spoke Spanish, so okay? <laughs> but anyway, um, if you hear me mess up some words, it's not because I don't 
I'm hooked on phonics. Uh, I get tight tongue sometimes because I have a four and eight half inch tongue and it rolls <laughs> on my back and rolls back to the front. So uh, wow. if you hear me make some words and then it don't sound right, just please ask me. But you know what? You are beautiful, young lady. I don't know how many times a man have told you that, but I'm sincere when I'm telling you that. Uh, are you from here? No. You're not? Where are you from? I am from Alaska. You from Alaska? Now, you know what? I have always said that I hate cold, but you will make a man go and, and, and dig some snow. <laughs> I'm telling you, you have never had a man to dig some snow. And I hate cold. I don't go to Chicago, New York, nowhere. But I will come to Alaska and see you. So uh, what are you doing here? I was just visiting for a wedding. Oh, a wedding? Mm -hmm. oh, don't catch that. Don't you catch the roses. Don't catch that Why flower. Why because if you catch that flower, I'm going to be out of the country for about two years, and I know it ain't me. So uh, don't catch that flower. Don't catch that little thing come off the leg, okay? So anyway, um, can I get you? <laughs> By the way, uh, but I am in town for a comedy special. Put him in a fucking bed. Put him out. No, no, don't put him in a fucking bed. Y'all make pussy too difficult. Yeah, oh, gee, you went back to you went back to vagina squabble. Yeah, no, I did not. No, I did this, not. This is this is M no. for actually guessing. No, ham, 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 ham. ham. There's there for you. Hear my accent, right? So I'm making a joke about my accent. That I have a super large tongue, wow. and that's why you. Yeah. You said I'm hating. <laughs> oh, yeah. I have a four and a half inch tongue, and, and sometimes my words don't come out right. I have a peach. Uh, still saying I have a speech impediment. You understand what I'm saying? Uh, so no. I'm making fun you, of you myself no. so because on, I already. Well, no, no, I already know. Wait, 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 wait. wait. No, no, no. So wait, wait, fast chat. Hey, ham, 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 ham. Can you show my? Can you show this? This is fantastic right here. Lauren, this is the hairstyle he got. <laughs> no, Those stars would be fantastic. All right. <laughs> Those stars would be. But anyway. And, and my hairline. No, 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 no. One of the things. No, one of the things. Wait, wait. One of the things I do here, uh, uh, J Speed, you got a lazy tongue and you don't pronounce some of your words because you're from the South. That, that, that's just serious. I'm from the so South. I'm going to make funny. I'm, I'm going to make fun of myself before she hear it. Okay, so I now I'm going to ask out. Lauren the question. Now, Miss Ma Miss Lauren Mack, what do you, what, when a man tells you he has a four and a half inch it, it, pulse tongue, okay, what do you think the reasoning in him telling you the length of his tongue is for? Because it worked. Uh -oh. Exactly. Work for what? Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah. Work how? Eating ice cream. Uh-oh. <laughs> nice cream from hell. That's right. And then he said, it lick, it, lick it, catch up off your hamburger. She said, because it works. That's what it around. She said, because it works. <laughs> that nigga said, it rolled back and forth, forth and back. That's only for one thing, bro. I ain't never seen a nigga eat a hamburger like that. No, Jay Smooth I mean, says, send that link. Uh, I dropped it, but uh, it might be full. All right. Trigger, Trigger Mike with the fellow says, AM sounding real light skin right now. Old smooth talking ass. I ain't even turn Quentin on with my the light skin. Say. Yeah, I'm trying to holler at Lauren. Quentin, you hit you hit the link? Yeah, if niggas ain't trying to holler still, I could drop them out with somebody trying to holler. I think they trying to holler for, for real? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Hey, Trigger, everybody, everybody love Lauren, man. Lauren, Lauren got down. You know, Lauren got all the fans in the chat now. Yeah, Change the location. Got... Change the location, uh, Ham. Oh yeah! Oh, okay. let's get let's get this bit. Right, hold on, let me let me finish these. Let's do the, can yeah, we yeah. Do the flex? Yeah. Yes, sir. Let me just read these real quick. Trigger Mike with the five says, Aaron, you had her at lick your eyebrows. <laughs> Quit with yourselves. Y'all need to learn how us white brothers do it. Hit the link. <laughs> Lamar with the, with the two hundred yen says, OG wins again, striking it rich with the two pounds. Says, didn't Rose say earlier that Fatty wasn't funny? Damn. <laughs> Yeah. Ali was popping with the ten houses. Hey, Lauren, your daddy must be a terrorist because you the bomb. Call me. That was <laughs> terrible. That <laughs> was terrible. <laughs> Real Ooh. love was wah, the houses. Wah. Lauren Mac getting Mac on. This definitely might be risky. Your hair on fleek, though. <laughs> hey, Ali, you got to turn the light skin powers on first, bro. Damn. <laughs> turn them on first. <laughs> let, me, let me know if it's safe. It's full in the back. 
pause. <laughs> Hey, hey, Ashton, I'll down him. Yeah, I'll drop down him so people can, can hey, come if up. If Ashton can come up, I'll drop. Ashton is the, as the right. Ashton is the truth. Ashton is the all the average on pickup. I know he got it. Ashton, pull up, bro. I'll drop. So I want to uh, get Cali yeah. and OJ. OG, explain uh, the flexibility gate. Okay, so this is why I did a show this morning just to show how the younger generation always so sensitive to this pause 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 still to him looking at what i did he was looking at my ass so i took my head and i touched my knee just to show you just to show you that an old man keeps himself in shape now when i wrestle that was a technique we used when people get us into a certain position that we can spin out all right so i'm still at 65 and i was doing moves like that when i was 16 and 17 yeah you can shake your head all you want to fatty but what i'm saying is it just shows you that the new generation is so sensitive with this lbg thing that so everything you do you got to watch what you do because it reminds them of what they're not the problem was not that og no 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 no. let me finish fatty the problem was the dance move no 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 i ain't talking about the dance move i was dancing without music bro so uh i would dance without music bro so and and, 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 and wait a minute wait a minute fatty and the dance move was not a dance move it was really a cartoon move it was it's, it was made to be funny okay just like my backwards thing it was made to be funny okay oh. og i love og you know what no og i'm your number one oh, fan. Here we go. Here we can go. you do a serious dance for us then if most there sir, was a cartoon um, no, can wait, 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 wait. we get the serious dance move uh, like a uh, 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 yeah you can get a serious you can get the moonwalk you can get all that you can get the slide the electric slide you can get all that and some more oh. i would dance your ass off the flow any day can we get the sample no we can't get no sample because i'm right down in the dungeon no, now, I, yesterday, I, 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 yesterday i was upstairs today i'm down in the dungeon oh gee do you so you got served what? i will sing for you boom 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 it up yeah, I heard that singing. I'm telling you, I would have to have two left feet to dance off that music. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Fatty, you can't win. I did this shit for a living. OG, somebody has to tell the OG. You are very good at a lot of things. I believe that you can whoop everybody else because you are a boxer. You are not a good dancer. I'm a perfect dancer. You said he was Chris Brown of the Sixties. What's up, Chris? No, no, no. I'm telling you again. He laughed because he can't move like that. <laughs> Tab seen that in the club, and that's just the top part. All right, I gave you another clip, Tab. Hey, yo, G, you the goat, man. Yeah, OG. I gave you another. You clip. know what that reminds me, G? When I'm sitting on the toilet, they're like. No, that's not that's nothing like your constipation. <laughs> that's nothing like your constipation. That's probably your best move you got on the dance floor. Ah, right, come on, come on, back, come on now. You gotta have a little rhythm when you do something, bro. You gotta learn how to move. You gotta have a little something. You know what I mean? You gotta have a little something. God dang. You know what though? That's one thing about the the, the generation that didn't have the phones. They they don't have as many reservations. They had to be outside, so OG ain't yeah, scared to do I, shit. Yeah, I'm just not. <laughs> he don't give I'm a fuck. I'm just not. <laughs> shit. Damn. I kick some towels off the floor. <laughs> you just go through the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Oh, I ain't OG scared. Look. Is a Put yourself out there. See, one of these things I found about, I found about the younger generation, they scared to put themselves out there. 
they scared everything they do is going to be rejected. <laughs> and so they play it safe. So they just start off real stupid. Well, well, they, they, well not, OG, all, in, not all. In all, in all fairness, in all oh, fairness, <laughs> back in the day, if you jumped out there and you did something goofy, it, it, it wasn't reported and, and redistributed everywhere. Nowadays, if they do something stupid, it's going to be on the internet forever. Forever. <laughs> and me, and me, like me, I'm, I'm, you know what? This is why I say when you have peace within yourself, you're willing to do things that other people just think about. I wish I could have been that bold. And see, that's the problem. It's putting yourself out there because let me tell you something. I listen to music all over the world. And some of that music, I'm like, why did they waste up the studio time? But that music is selling 300,000 copies in another land. And so what I'm saying is, even though you might not be popular in your culture, but there's somebody looking and saying, you know what? I don't see that as funny. I see that as being a genius. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yo, Jay Smooth was popping. What you? What's you up? Wanted, what's you, up? You, you wanted to get in the box. Hey man, it's whatever man. I'm just on here. What's up? I want to say what's up to you first, man. I love what you're doing. Appreciate you, I 100. percent Uh, hold on. Let me, let me check. Let me check. <laughs> so, Cali, what what you came up here for? You want to get in the box? You think you got juice? You on <laughs> mute? Are you on a bad microphone? You know your your, your technology is terrible. And she in red. We can't what hear you. Say, you. Kelly? We can't hear you. Hey. She says she got a man. <laughs> what she say? No, we know. I'm saying she wanna We can't hear no you. No audio, Kelly. We can't hear you, Kelly. We can't hear you. Oh God, Kelly, what? We can't hear somebody you. send her a DM or something. <laughs> or, oh, put it in the chat. Do it in sign we can't, language. We can't hear you. <laughs> no sign language. No sound. No sound. <laughs> She's just talking at put, 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 put him in the fucking bedroom. Get him out of here. Bro, 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 she probably got to uh, drop out and come back in. All right, let Jay Smooth. Jay Smooth, what generation are you from? Man, I'll be 42 next month. Pisces, baby. Pisces. Oh, so I'm, on, I'm on the old school side. Hey, that's Mark okay. Clay. What's up, Mark Clay? Long time no see, bro. You What's doing? up? Bro? You got a good ass memory, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah Fight Club, one year ago or some two years ago. Yeah. Right? Hey, man. Who's... What's up, man? All yeah. right. All right. Lauren, the only, only, only. <laughs> oh, All right, let me see. Callie, you hear me? Oh, that's a good choice. Can you hear good me? choice. Can you hear me? We can yeah, hear we can you hear now. You. What were you saying? You said you can't. You said you can't participate. What you say? Who said that? Oh. No, that's what I was saying. All right, you on? Yeah, when I'm you good. get in. You get in the box. Yeah. All right, let's go, Jay Smooth. Okay. All right, what's up? How you doing, young lady? I'm good. How are you? All right. What's your name? Beverly. Beverly, where you from? Cali, LA to be specific. LA, okay. All right. I'm from Dallas. Not too far. On the plane ride. What's up? How old are you? I'm 43. Oh, yeah. Okay. You don't look it. I oh, appreciate it. You know, uh, get it from my mom. All right. You're very pretty. Okay. Um, I see we're in this club right now. Um, what do you drink? Patron, cranberry, and pineapple. Oh, okay. That sounds good. But I tell you right now, it's kind of loud in this club. My message may not be conveyed correctly, but I'm going to send you on your home a drink, okay? So after the club, when I can hear you and you can hear me clearly, I'm going to come get you, okay? Let me no, get that me, number. Yeah. Well, um, me and my homegirl, we got a section over there or whatever. You want to just come and check, kick, kick it with us or whatever. Um, You got your boys with you or something? I sure do. We'll be over there just... Well, we like okay. we right over there, whatever you know. We, you know, we don't be in there like that, but you know, we be on the dance floor and stuff like that. So you know, you want to come dance floor, whatever. That's cool. You want to come hit us up in the um in the section. That's cool too. 
Okay, I love the dance, so we'll definitely make that happen. Okay. Oh yeah, that's what's up. But you know, I don't be freaking or nothing like that. You know, I just got I got a mean two step though. You got a what? I got a mean two step. We can two step on the dance floor. Oh, we two step. <laughs> You know, I know I live in, in Dallas, but I don't do too much two stepping. But I'm uh, uh yeah, I, yeah, I'm smooth, baby. I like to slow dance, okay. <laughs> so, so I can talk to your ear while we're dancing, okay. Man, well, we can talk over there in the section, then. I mean, you know, slow dancing and all that. But For sure, you know, we, over there if you want to. For sure, we're gonna we're gonna handle that. All right, that's what's up. What's your name? What's your name again? Jay Smooth. No, what, what's, your, what's your real name? My real name is Marvell. Marvell, like like MCU. <laughs> there you go. Marvel, like Marvel Comics, but with two L's instead of one. Man, that's what's up. All right, then. I love it. All later. right, baby. All right. <laughs> Shit, Cali, Cali did all the goddamn work. Yo, see, that's what they should have told me when I asked about the session. She should have said, yeah, we got a session. She was no. like, nah, we fool. <laughs> nah, <Jason>. fool. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> What's up? What's up, Ham? What's popping? So that scenario here is a wine tasting event. Oh, easy. Oh, shit. You say a wine tasting event? That's where we are with it? Yeah, so easy. it's a singles. I, no, I wouldn't even say it's a singles mixer, but people there. You know what I'm saying? They doing wine tasting, et cetera. Okay, we could definitely do that. How you doing, ma'am? I'm good. How are you? All right. You're very pretty. I just wanted you to know that. Thank you. Not too bad yourself. Well, thank you. Thank you. Where are you from? I'm from Dallas. Oh, shit. Me too. Okay. Newport. I live in Rockwall. You from Rockwall? No, nah, I, I live in Rockwall. Where are you from? Originally Louisiana. I'm a country boy. Oh, okay. Not from, okay. <laughs> Not New Orleans, Louisiana. I know what you're what thinking. Part? Freeport? Uh, I'm closer to Monroe. I was born in Monroe. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, I named my dog after that. Oh, you did? What kind of dog you got? It's a mutt. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Well, okay. I see you. Uh, I see you not shallow. Then that's what's up. Not at all. She got a mutt. Got a mutt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not shallow. How old are you? Got a mutt. <laughs> I think you mean shy. Ask her these kids up. People you that don't volunteer that type of information, so they did show that she, you know, she's open to a lot of different things. That's right. <laughs> you don't discriminate. <laughs> hey, all right, question. Let's get let's do this real quick. Let's get a yes and no from everybody starting with Lauren and going around to with Cali Bev. Joel with the five dollars says, Real question. Do we ask about the relationship status while approaching? I'll admit that's something I need to know ASAP. Um Hell I'm, no. so no. I say no. Uh what'd you say, Lauren? No. No. Devin. Uh, yeah, I knew it. Aaron. Hell no. Fatty, no. Hey, Angry Man, hell no. OG, <laughs> I do it, but I do it in a smooth way. No, so should yeah, he ask? Basically, no. yeah, he should. I do it in a smooth way. I do it all the time. Well, okay. So you saying yes for for yes, regular yes, man? Sir. Okay. Yes. Uh, scam. Yes, but indirect. Smooth. Yes. Indirect. Yeah. So I know how to move. Cali? Exactly. No. Of course. No. You want to, what if he, she's a cheater? Come on, man. Yeah. I mean, she it gotta protect still, like I think uh uh scam said she gotta protect her relationship. Yeah, I no, she say, doesn't. You, know, you go to her No, I'm saying it's say, her responsibility to let that be yeah. known. And they love plausible deniability. Don't ask. You never asked before, so I didn't tell you. Just go ahead, you got this. So ham. It don't even be worth it, God. Uh, hey, ham. So you saying I know about him. Walk, it's fine. Uh, if, if you saying that a guy walk up on a woman, and just depending where we're at too, you walk up to a woman and say, excuse me, are you motivated, uh situated, <laughs> or are you just trying to make some chocolate milk? You know what I mean? 
<laughs> so you just gave her uh, two things to think about, and then the last thing is you. <laughs> okay. Okay. I mean, I understand. I just, I mean, that's just a question I just mm-hmm. wouldn't ask. You know, you I'm know not. As- I'm not asking that because number one, what's understood don't got to be spoken. So if I roll up on a chick and she don't got no wedding ring on, she she ain't she ain't with nobody really. Well, I do it for uh, I do it for security reason too, bro. There's a there you go. In there, I do it for security reason too, because if her man been watching her and see what she's doing or something like that, and she's out there and she's doing that kind of stuff, then it gives me some kind of insight. Do I want to pursue that? What about the trail? But if he watching her, that ain't it ain't gonna manifest like that anyway. Yeah, what about the fun? <laughs> oh yeah, fun. We no, yeah. I actually had something like that happen last month. Yes, this might nah. be fun to get you hurt. Yeah, bit was in the club with her nigga. I was talking to her at the bar, and goddamn, when I finally got around to the question, and goddamn, you single? She was like, no, he's over there. And, and, and I was and like, you, oh, all right, well, you have a good one. And I took right. I got my drink. Got right. it was a shootout. Yeah, but look at you guys exchanging drinks, like waking up in a fucking bathtub, eyes all up to your neck. Like, you shouldn't be drinking with people like that. Damn, I don't know why people in the club. club. Did somebody come in there and shoot, her, uh, uh, and shoot her up the club? Yeah. Because of a lady? Okay. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I seen right. it too many times. Yeah, me too. Uh, I'm just Man. saying, though. I'm just saying I'm not I'm not asking she going she going to give the right information based on what she what she doing in that moment. She may be on the verge of breaking up that with that nigga. Yes. And that's, 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 that's her fault. That's I, I, don't know, I don't know. I don't know how y'all use. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you that's when it's real danger. Do you saw what that how... there, that that's that nigga fault. That's not your fault. I don't know how y'all used the club, but we went to the club like 20 fucking deep. So if he up in there and, and she kicking it like she ain't got no man and he up in there and that nigga roll up wanting some smoke, he going he going to get slid in that motherfucker like but it, I'm it, not it, I'm assuming I'm assuming that if you in the club kicking it like that you single. Let let me ask you something, right? Cuz you guys are older and shit. I on my country, we don't even talk with the woman. Oh, starts reggaeton and shit, we start to dance in behind her. She likes, she stays. If she doesn't like you, she goes. Where the fuck is these questions about you? Well, do you have a boyfriend? I mean, no. That's, but, but like you go to the dance club, shit, you see? clubs ain't like that no more down that, here. That, but that right. depends. So you guys that, don't go like around that. and you don't dance like if it's that like, reggaeton yeah, like, so if, like, like you don't go and dance. When I was not, going like, to teen like, clubs, that was the last time it was like that. I nah, say that. See, now, but like yeah, here, that was a long here, time ago. Here in American culture, fatty, like it used to be like that where. People would go to the club and dance and all of that stuff, but it, it's kind of changed a little bit. It's, 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 it's fizzled a bit for sure. Yeah. Um, yeah. Reggaeton it's, it's is music. Music. As soon as if reggaeton you to, starts, you are on the middle of the dance floor. Because, hey, it, so, so to be to be to liken it to what he's saying, if you go to a reggae club, people are dancing. Yeah, what what about like if you just make like, hey, Miss Putty Putty, you're the mud. Like nobody's asking for this shit. You Gary. <laughs> Yeah, like a reggae soca, a reggae tone, people are dancing. Uh, but yeah. you know, the clubs a lot now is just like a bunch of trap music and shit, so they less inclined. But that atmosphere, people likely to dance for sure. I was gonna say, like, I find like the older spots, you'll see people dancing as opposed to the younger spots. I mean, and, and the, just, just like he's like Ham said, the music pretty much just calls for it. You ain't too, ain't really too much boogie into no damn drill music, you right. know what I'm saying. Yeah, that shit is terrible, man. But how early dancing. in a conversation are you supposed to bring up that you're in a relationship? ASAP. Yeah, ASAP. Well, oh. like I'm making like my third question if they don't say nothing. No, she said they usually just respond. Hold on, hold on. Did y'all listen? She said bring it up. So that means yeah. she would be After revealing. You. So yeah. you come on her back, you get the towel, and then you tell her. <laughs> I'll I bring it up if it's going there. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. But if, yeah, you're like, chip, so like, like, but if he's bad, going to like, try to, try to get to know me and get like my number and all that kind of stuff like that, I'd be like, well, no, nah, I can't go there. You know what I'm saying? We, we can right. have a good time while we're here. You know what I'm saying? But no, nah, you can't get my number. We ain't finna go on no date. You know what I'm saying? None of that shit. So that's when I pretty much bring it up. But if we just chilling, having a good time, Nope. That's Here, crazy. Here's the thing. Here's but the if thing. a man, but if a man approaching you, that's not not as I tell what he's trying to do. He's trying to holler at you. 
No, that's, no, no, no. Get rid that's, of that. That's not. That's, 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 that's not out the window. Not I, I, I don't. I don't. I don't approach nobody just for uh, conversation. That's just me. Me neither. Hold on. Go ahead, Aaron. Go ahead. That's what you got out the window. Here's why. I'm not interested in when I first meet a woman, if she's in a, if I'm attracted to her or not, a relationship status doesn't mean much. I want to continue the conversation. I can gauge her interest and if she's in a relationship by the conversation. But even if she's not, that doesn't mean she's still not an asset to me. One thing I understand and respect is the woman's place in the world today in the business arena. Is there a network? I know people still look at and listen to women. People that women influence, look, 80% of fucking shit that's sold is because of women. Why do you think all these vehicles on the street are crossovers? Because that's what women want. Niggas don't like crossovers. We like sports cars and big ass trucks. But everything sold is because women are buying. I want to know if there's a business opportunity here. Did you notice I met a young lady at an airport and all these other places? You know what I mean? There's more to a woman than what's in between her legs. And I want in on all of it. But yeah, also, yeah. My bad. But, also, but but also you gotta think about this too. If you at the club or you at a lounge bar or whatever, and you and your boys is talking to some chicks, and the one you talking to just happened to be married, you still gonna have a conversation with her because your boy might be trying to talk to her girl who ain't married. And you I don't, don't get ground be, beef from you that store. Be, you don't want to be the asshole. That's being rude and shit just because you ain't gonna be able to holler at nothing. You feel what I'm saying? No. I man. don't shop for ground beef at pet stores. I don't go to the club looking for women. Man, I think our initial approach is because you thought she's attractive and you want to talk to her. Now yeah, because yeah. she turned because she turned you down, now all of a sudden she a business move. You get what I'm saying? And the she thing about it is hold on, hold on, bro. Turn me down. Hold on. We all we all men, so we understand that we, in that, especially in that club environment, that we're going to try to, you know, put our bid in, try to holler. You know, what I'm saying I'm very intentional. So once she tells me she have a man conversation up with, because if I have a lady and she tells a man she got a man, she don't even need to talk about business. We, I mean, we've been straight up. You know, it's 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 the end of it for me. I respect I that. I respect the fact that she have a man. That's why that's my second question. First question is her name. Second question, do you have a man? Because I'm very intentional. I'm not trying to fake you with no business move. You get what I'm saying? Right. No, I don't. Um, so <laughs> okay. since, since, since we keep going to the club. And, it can and be encroaching. This is, this is proven. When I'm in a club environment, when I was in the club environment, I never approached women. Ever. You know why? Because they were approaching me. Damn, I'm up my in the booth. I'm oh, sorry. No, 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 listen, 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 hear me out. I'm up in the DJ booth. I'm with the promoter. I either own the joint or I'm chief of security or I'm a member of the ba- one of the bouncers or I'm a Damn. guest bartender. I don't go to clubs and stand in line. I don't go get sections. I don't do that. I might be in with an athlete who has a section. So you mean- I might know the owner. I might, you know what I mean? I might know the, the musician, the band, the DJ. Like if it, it's a DJ, I might come down and check him out one day. I'm there to see. I'm going to travel in the pack of people that everybody wants to know who the, the people who are in the know want to know who they are. Yeah. I'm not approaching no women. Yeah. Women are approaching yeah. me. Yeah. Hey, 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 just why, me. Why, why did you why did why did you approach her in the first place? I didn't. Not in the club is what I'm telling you. I've owned a nightclub here in Philadelphia called Strong. Listen, I used I to live know. in Philly, man. I, I get it. Yeah. Rittenhouse Square, Denim, Strong Box. Okay. Back, like, like, check me out. I'm telling yeah. you. Like, right. Back in like 08, 09, 10, like it licks. I, man, don't yeah. tell me to drop it. I'm telling hey. you, I did not chase them up. I was kicking them out of the bed. Somebody said he's a baddie. Aaron, hey, Aaron, Aaron you, you was Aaron. You was, you've been head of security <laughs> before. Yes. You would have you hated my club. You, you would have hated me and my boys. Damn. So, so, <laughs> yeah. Hey, Aaron. So, I was listening. maybe one night, and then that would have been that. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I was like, like this, and that's the thing. The type of places I went to were full of like athletes, and and it, it was a very low key. Everybody in there had too much to lose. Everybody in there, it, there was no beef. Like all of that wouldn't even made it in. Aaron. Because it's the kind of place where everybody's trying to keep it cool on purpose. Aaron. Go ahead, go ahead. Small, Aaron. you know what I mean? Aaron. Go ahead, Daddy. Go ahead. So you're rich, right? 
and you want the no. <laughs> yeah, you know you you want the pickup thing i i give that to you right but i have a question because i i listen very carefully if you never approach why are you say i'll never get rejected because you said i never get rejected i and said in the club i never approach so how do club. you get to, if you never well, approach, let me answer your question let me answer your talk question. about you ready you ready no because the scenarios i gave they weren't in the club where i'm approaching like in an airport or in some other environment i'm not going to get rejected because the conversation's not going to go there i'm going to see where the conversation's going and if it's starting to look like it's headed towards rejection land i'm going to steer it straight into business land so you never got rejected That's, you never got it to the can you give me a number if, if, no, if, you. let me finish answering your question fat i apologize sir in yes. the club in the club that's a different environment i don't chase in the club i don't pursue in the club Fair. but outside of the club and other social events like fundraisers and things where i do pursue i'm not getting rejected because i'm reading the audience okay so in on your 22 years of age on this planet you never got rejected you never come into a woman hey baby i see you you see me can you give me my number and she says absolutely not you when i was 22 i was in the philippines what were you i'm in the what the, that was a different 22 not, aaron i'm in the marines bro i'm doing i didn't ask you where you were i just asked you if you <laughs> ever got rejected the world was the, okay no i didn't get rejected because of we were so you never got rejected by a woman yes i'm confused DJs in the club. He's saying he got yeah. rejected in a different setting than the club. Fatty. DJs of, in the club. Everybody rejected outside of the club. What? Yeah, <laughs> high school. I apologize. Oh, in, so the last time you got rejected was in high school? Yeah. Damn. SPWD Speed bringing it to you all the way live. 95 degrees in the shade with all the ladies in your place. Let me see you shake your body to the base. <laughs> Maybe he was a sniper. DJs don't approach women. Women approach DJs. That's number one. Number two. Number two. Number two. Um, I live in California. I live in a totally different uh, uh, jungle. And you better know just by the neighborhood you in you better know is she single now y'all can say that where maybe where you from from geographically and it might work fine out there here we have sections you can wear the wrong color and be out of the section so much less if she got a man or not so it's a whole different atmosphere now going to what fatty said in jamaican club everything is in because the jamaican club women are jumping and hopping on you i don't care if you will another woman that's just the way they roll with the jamaican clubs out here have you ever got the rejected og most certainly thank you especially when i went visit some other dj club he thank made you. sure i got rejected thank you for not lying like aaron Man. He said, "Let's go to wait, asshole." Wait, 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 wait. He said, "Let's go to oh, asshole." No. Jay Speed. Uh, oh, he wasn't a joke. He wasn't a joke. He wasn't. <laughs> he oh, said, "That right. go." Here come we're that gonna, asshole LG to work the work club out. trying to take out women. Look, I'm not the other one to fight. Man, we we I'm went to every club we could go to. We didn't give a fuck who was who. None of that shit. But you say you rolled twenty deep, though. Everybody don't roll twenty deep. You got damn right. I definitely don't roll twenty deep. 20 or more. See, y'all were all the niggas in the club. Because if anybody do some I don't roll 20 shit, deep. That's too many if anybody, niggas. If anybody do some goofy shit, we, we turning this motherfucker out. Security ain't stopping us. Somebody getting stomped out. Period. Yeah, uh, I guess I ain't, ain't ain't man. Maybe Maybe in Raleigh, Charlotte, New York. That worked. California's a different animal, bro. I wasn't in yeah. 20 no no but 20 deep I out here don't mean anything you got the average 19 year old guy will go up there and try to make a name out of himself and he don't even care if he take one Nigga, what you think what that's you the think mind you? no I'm just no i understand what you're saying angry man but i'm just saying when you did come out here you did see depends where you went at if you went in brentwood hollywood burbank or something like that but when you come in south la that's something different but see, the thing is, OG, look, the thing is, I'm I'm not moving like that. If I was, if I had people in Cali 
and I went to Cali, I'm rolling with my people that's in Cali that know the terrain, know who who, and know all of that shit. You feel what I'm saying? I'm not. I'm, just feel, I'm feeling you. Talking you about know? fighting is drying up the pussy. Okay, no. What I'm saying, what I'm saying is, we were talking about this. I think I think what we were really talking about, and I know it has steered itself away a little bit. No, no. It, we, we, we're talking about should you ask a woman is she obligated or situated in the in the initial conversation? I think that's what we're talking about. So yeah, we can stay on that point right there. Yeah, I'm grilling the hell out of the point though. I'm saying no. That's man. why I'm saying we went too far with it. Yeah, basically, you just, you know, you approach her correctly, right? Um, she, she's in control of that situation, in which case she'll reveal whatever information she needs to reveal based on the circumstance. That's it. I'm not yes, prying sir. into that. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm doing. I'm not prying into if she got a man. And you're using that voice too, ain't you, DJ? Yeah, especially when I get tired. All right, that's when it, work, it works. I'm, yeah, I'm not prying into it. She got to make a decision. But you know, you know what, Jay Smooth. Here's the thing, though. Like, I, I don't know how they do now because I don't club now. But right. in, the damn, in the late '90s, the early 2000s, you know, it's dudes that come to the club. They don't come there to dance. They don't come there to freaking holler at no chicks. They come in there and they stand on the wall like this. That's right. Me. And and, they, uh, and some of them is looking for some them. goofy shit to get into. Mm -hmm. They want to beat somebody up or they want to shoot somebody because they mad about something or they trying to make a name for themselves. So I'm not going up in there wrong. You feel me? Right. Me neither, man. As a matter of fact, I, I don't hang out in spots like that no more either. You know, cause like I say, I'm, I'm older now, so I'm on a different uh, different page. But it, for me, for me, it's more of a security reason. I'm, I'm going to just be straight up with you. Uh, I really don't care. It, it, like most men, just to be honest, if she say, yeah, I got a man, whatever. If she want to take it further, if she do, if she don't, she don't. I respect that. It, it's simple as the fact, a security reason for me, like uh, OG said, man. Uh, I've been in a situation where a young lady lied to me, told me she didn't have no man. And I just kept telling her, like, look, if you got one, just let me know. And uh, long story short, uh, you know, we ended up at her house watching a movie or whatever. And I hear the key turn. So somebody come walk through the door. I looked at her and she said, oh, shit. I already yeah. knew what that was. And and I wasn't pissed that she had a man because I didn't give a fuck at that time. I was all about what, I, what I'm going to do. You get what I'm saying? I just need to know for my, for my protection because that could have been, you know, bad that night. And that's yeah. really why ever since then it's for security reasons, man. Let's, I got to know. Mind, let's mine that out real quick since y'all not outside anymore. First things first is you never relinquish control, especially upon first meeting her. So Dang. when you go to her house, she's in charge now. So Dang. that 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 was the main issue with that 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 situation. You know, when I'm approaching a woman um because for for something sexual or I'm trying to get to know her on some huggy bitch shit, I'm getting yeses all day. I'm not gonna ask no questions that I might get a no from. That don't even make no sense. Um it's sales. You know, it just depends on what it is you're trying to purchase, you know, what you're trying to sell. So I think y'all got to, yeah, you always go to your house or at the very least a hotel got to be neutral ground. She cannot have the upper hand because you don't want nobody to have the upper hand, frankly. But I'm just right. saying even the women, you know what I'm saying? Hey, 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 I, I, I totally hey, agree with you. I, I believe more in the, in the like the middle ground because I got my own shit and I'd be scared to have someone come over here because women, sometimes they act crazy too. You get what I'm saying? And so I believe in the middle ground. I don't bring nobody over here unless I trust them. You get what I'm saying? So, I mean, it worked both hey, ways. Hey, Ham, somebody said, somebody said, I'm going to make a joke on this. Somebody said that uh, I ride horses to the club. Uh, <laughs> that was uh, funny. That was funny. <laughs> that, but that, well, see, this just shows you something, Ham. Two things would get you women yeah. looking at you, a motorcycle and a horse. See, this is what people say. see. They be thinking, look, I'm telling you, you get on a horse, or some woman go ask you, can she get on the horse? That's true. And a motorcycle. Two That's things true. I tell you, bro. See, this is what I'm saying is, y'all wasting time with that damn control in your hand. Y'all need to get out there and get some breathe and go out there and fuck something. Then you'll know these things. So what I'm telling you. <laughs> they, 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 can ride, they can ride horses around Atlanta. Please go. Wait, 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 wait. OG, OG, you had the horse? 
I'm telling you. See, this is what I'm saying. Right. Y'all right. lost in the grass. Right. In, Fatty, in, in Dallas, Fatty, the first time I went there. Trail um, ride. Oh, my gosh, bro. Trail it was ride. like a trail rider shit, my nigga. They had on vests. I thought it was a motorcycle gang. They came back. They came by with horses. <laughs> Hey, but I bet you hell. This shit was the worst thing I've seen. But it was cool as hell. But it was weird. My nigga, I had to get out of there. But it was cool as shit though. But you know there were black cowboys too, right? Hell. Yeah. You know there were black cowboys in our history too, right? And we have them ride around in Compton even to the day. They still ride horses in Compton even to the day. Hey, Jay Smooth. Jay Smooth. All I, I drop down. I drop down. Yeah, hey, peace, all, love, all and always strive for the truth. Hey, OG, Damn. man, you the man. Be safe. All I'll be in the cloud. All right. I thought, I, thought <laughs> it, I thought OG was going to claim that he was the, the first black people person on the Walker. The <laughs> like Walker. Oh, Jay School. All of yes, them, sir. All of them was cow. All of, the, all of the cowboys were black. Right. Mm. Because originally, originally, they called any white man, they called him cattlemen and they called the black ones cowboys right same way they was calling niggas boys back in the day and shit until that shit got popular then all of a sudden they was cowboys yeah well the trail rides do be popping him maybe you should stay man we uh yeah, um, I, I entertained it but it just was i was nervous you feel me hey man listen man i i used to live right outside of philly so i get i get your vibe man so i, I get it man I get yeah, it man. I never seen that before. Wow, niggas on horses. That shit looked oh, wow. crazy. Hey, but the, you, trailer, you, the trucks. That shit was. It was. It was dope. But it just. I couldn't. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't like, the thing, right? The yeah, only. The yeah. only horses. The only horses I'm riding is the 550 horses under my damn hood, nigga. I'm not getting on no fucking horse. Fuck damn, that shit. Another like rich that, person. Like that, shit like that. Yeah. Damn, man. Hey, but did you see the lady? Did you see the women in days of dudes and cowboy boots? <laughs> that that'll mm -hmm. make you stay right there. You know what oh, I mean? I see, yeah, yeah. No, I was I was in Dallas for work though, so I was kind of you know what I mean. But yeah, I just well, you know I was out that way. We was doing like a move. I forget what I was doing, but it was just it was a mate. Like it was, it was like a proud yeah, moment. Yeah, that's gonna be honest. You know? That's gonna be honest. Damn. What'd you say, Lauren? Nothing. Nothing. What'd you say? You want to smoke with me? I know you don't. You already seen what I be doing to love in them. I know you don't want to smoke with me. You mean when you lose? Oh, Damn. Oh my God. <laughs> Lauren got tired, everybody, man. She had to go, man. Salute the Lord. <laughs> Damn, man. Oh, man. This, this was fun as hell. I, I got to get out of here, man. Damn. Uh, Pookie, you just got to get on get camera, man. Not hard. Huh? Nothing. Huh? You lucky you, you talking while I'm talking. I can't hear you because you got a terrible microphone. Yeah, let let ah. amp, amp let if yep. there's the real Pookie, let him shoot his shot. He's going to do the mm, 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 mm. he was <laughs> up here, but he, he bounced, he he left. Yeah, because he did the mm, 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 he's like an excellent. <laughs> Yo, this Pookie, hit the link, man. You go shoot your ass. Hey, you got man. this, bro. Hey now, um, Kelly. When you was talking to Jay Smooth, uh, how you did it? It felt very, very friend zone esque. Was that your goal? Yeah, because he was talking about he was talking about you know like immediately he wanted to uh, talk to me in private and all this kind of stuff like that, and then he wanted to uh, slow <clears throat> dance and shit. So I was like, okay. no, that ain't what I said. That ain't what I said. The private, the private. You said, said we want to talk. Let's go ahead and talk further. Mm -hmm. But I mean, we hadn't no. even really talked at all right now. What I'm saying is, is that I'm glad you mentioned actually the VIP. See, the thing about it is that uh, normally in clubs, the music is very loud. So when you're trying to have a, a real conversation, you know, I don't even her to me. I don't take it as serious because you can't hear anything. What I told you was I see you after the club when there's no music so that you can hear what I'm saying. That's what I said. I didn't want to take you to somewhere private. I said I will come get you, meaning that after the club, I'm come seek you out where there's no music. I like clarity when I talk. That's what I was saying. Oh, no. See, how I operate is 
check the vibes or whatever. We didn't okay. even have no vibes to see if I even wanted to hang with you out. You know what I'm saying? After the club. Now, I'm approaching this as a single person. Okay? Yeah. Just FYI. Yeah. You know what I mean? But, um, yeah, check the vibes first. See if we have a good time and everything like that. And then, you know, if I want to talk further, then we can go ahead and exchange telephone numbers yeah. or whatever. Okay. I, I get it. I got ahead of myself. I got you. Okay. Yeah. I wouldn't, yeah. I wouldn't, and I wouldn't take a social neither. I mean, at my age or whatever like that, if I give you my social, that means I don't want to really talk to you like that, you know. Hey, hey, I hey, I got a lot of yeses, but I got no's too. I'm you know, being realistic. It happens. Yeah, I mean, Can't you know, everybody. it probably work for like the younger ones or whatever, but forty three, that would have been, you know. <laughs> and, and you know what? You, you're right. I'll be 42 <laughs> next month, but that's that's why I date younger, honestly. But yeah, you're right though. You're very pretty though. Yeah. Yeah, Kelly. Kelly was so like happy and shit. I'd have been like, "Yo, what's up with you? Like, why are you still happy in the middle of the club and all that?" <laughs> yeah, yeah, I would have been in the station. Uh, fast as hell. I'm not like, gonna be rude. At a roll. If she agrees to meet you at Waffle House later, it's a win. If she agree to go anywhere after the club, I'm winning that evening, hundred percent. Right. So, Callie, let me ask you a question: What true conversation you're gonna get while the music is blasting to get to know that person? We can talk about anything. Where we from? You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, I'm from Cali. How long you been out here? This, that, and the third. We out here having a good time. What part of the city you live in? You know what I'm saying? Stuff like that. It ain't got me yeah. No, I feel yeah. you. I, just, I mean, we both get those. I know our hearing ain't, ain't that good no more. So that's <laughs> shit. I definitely won't be able to hear. Jay, you gotta lean in, it's like it. right next to that. You know, if, she, if she feeling you, then y'all will be really close, and she's talking right exactly. in your ear. You know what I'm saying? Especially yeah. if you go on dance floor with two steps. Yes, sir. Yeah. Jay, smooth. They can hear you if, if they steps, feeling so. you. Oh yeah. If they, if they okay. feeling you, they can hear you. Yes, yes. Why not lead with yeah. money? Lead with money? Send fifty dollar mm-hmm. cash app and say there's more <laughs> where this came from and bounce. Because they, they, they not all mid they not all mid tier YouTubers like this, so they not $50, used to dollars, <laughs> fifty dollars cash app and say hey there's more where this came from, lady. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, bro, they they get too much, bro. They not used yeah. to getting super chats, bro. Nah, no. they, uh-uh. <laughs> My bad. I was just right. I was just right to see. Something. You know what I mean? They not used to it like us, bro. Damn. Fifty dollar cash app, man. Nah. Damn. Uh-huh. I, I, if somebody came on the club like and send me fifty dollars, I would dance for them and them. Like you know the little <laughs> things that you do, shit. I would do it in real life. Damn. I watch man. Daddy got the moves. Kind <laughs> of. OG got the moves, but there's a story for yeah, that. Yeah, hey, one one question. When are you guys going to tell OG that he needs to stop dancing? Like, we need to actually I do like anything. Let him I enjoy like his it. last years. I'm just playing. You last stretch your beard. Years. Well, somebody needs to tell OG because me and OG are friends, so he doesn't take me seriously. Like, somebody from outside needs to say, OG, come on, bro. I mean, his dancing is fits his age group. He's actually, he's his dance is actually newer than his age. So, his <laughs> pop, he's a pop locker. That's actually more 80s. So... <laughs> Maybe that is his 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 thieves. Shit. Nah, nah, nah. Hey, did you see after after Usher performance? I was in the in the mirror trying to see if I still could pop lock. Damn. Oh, you do the, <laughs> the, 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 the. Yeah, I was trying, but that shit ain't look how it used to look. You feel me, Paul? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. <laughs> What's that nigga Usher? Yo, Mm-mm. that nigga. Yo, Damn. I'm telling you, man. Damn, man. Damn. Like, like share subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend hit that like button right now if you can that helps the channel the most i hope that we learned something from this one thing i will have to say is the ogs held it down today shit like that shit like that shit like that the prince of the manosphere man mr fantastic oh, man brother 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 <laughs> salute to mr fantastic damn. damn fatty any final thoughts yes nah i actually didn't i am so tired i have nothing to tell you <laughs> uh, yeah it was actually good and aaron i apologize for actually testing you i just don't like liars it was a joke again but it kind of worked. 
<laughs> like, come on, brother. Everybody got rejected after high school. He's like, come on, that's just me, Lord. Like, everybody got rejected after high school. Yo, you know what he said, though, Fatty? That was key. He was largely operating from a place of leverage, which I think helped. That's what we tell yes. men to do. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. Yes. But even Jason Momoa got rejected after high school. Let's be honest about this shit. So, yeah. that was successful. I think Aaron actually won the pickup game. I just don't think you have to oversell it by saying that never got rejected after high school. Unless he got married when he was 19. I will believe that if that's the case maybe hey yo hey yo jay smooth you should have told cali yo i'm about to go roll up i'm trying to burn one cali's been like yo let me grab my oh, yeah i know, I know, I know she smoked i know she smoked like let me tell you something hey uh mr anger man you know i feel you man sound good and all that but this youtube man i'd have got her it's all good <laughs> trust me i'd have got her sound good in youtube but i got i'd have got her Wow. Like, I got my old weed, but you know what I'm saying? We yeah, have the old you. Yeah. Match up. No, no, no. I, I, I respect. Trust me. I, I totally respect. Yeah, the old you. Trust me. I'm with you. Yeah. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Yeah, man. Yeah. Scam, man. You've been quiet, man. Any final thoughts? Uh, do whatever works for you. That's it. <laughs> and by the way, I'm sorry that Scam actually fucked yeah, with Huh? Say it again. I'm, I'm sorry that you, like Scam actually found your page. I apologize, brother. Scam <laughs> actually found what? Oh, Whoa. Man. I don't know. <laughs> Damn, Jay Smooth, any funny thoughts, my G? Uh, yeah, first of all, I just want to say <clears throat> I've been watching your panel for a long time and uh, I really like what you're doing. I'm not just saying that you're different than everybody else. You hold everybody accountable. Uh, second of all, like I said earlier, you know what I'm saying? Um, you just got to be authentically you. The person is going to, one thing I learned in all my years, I've been married, all that good stuff. One thing I learned is that uh, you're going to get some yeses and you're going to get some no's. I don't know what Eric's talking about, but trust me, you're going to get some no's too. That's what makes you who you are. And that's what makes you better is to learn from your mistakes. So um, just be authentically you. If she likes you, she likes you. If she doesn't, she's not for you. You got to find your lane, like I said earlier. Word. And I will become a member, Hemp. So just to let you know, I like what you're doing, bro. No doubt, Slew, my brother. I appreciate you. The support means a lot to me. You know what I mean? All right. Let's take a village. You feel me? So thank you. Cali. Right. Any final thoughts? Go out, go out to have a good time just to mingle and everything like that. If it goes further than that, then it goes further than that. But don't be so pressed. Um good advice. Yeah, that's that's, that's about all I have. And the um don't don't trip off of no no. I done got rejected before too plenty of times because I used to approach as well. So I already know what dudes be talking about. It's all good. Just hey, move on to the next. And if you're not that pressed, then it don't hurt that bad. Right. <laughs> Word. Devin, any final thoughts, my G? Yeah, uh, just don't think about it too much. When you go in, just have like a set of questions you want to ask, you know, ask her some things about herself. And uh do ask her if she's in a relationship, because that's just another little question to pass a little couple seconds over and you know, you can know how you're going to uh, either make your exit or uh, continue on with the mission. But, uh, yeah, I like you guys. It kind of feel like a big family. Got the, uh, yeah. Uh, I'm going to be yeah, late to work in the morning. Since we family, uh, we didn't need your advice. Okay, you All you <laughs> needed to say was, thank you. I'm glad y'all let me stay up here after my performance. And what? you could have ended after that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, good night, y'all. <laughs> Love y'all. Y'all have a good one. Are you, bro? Be safe. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to sleep. <laughs> Aaron, any final thoughts? Yeah, I want to thank the ladies for, um, you know, coming up here and, and allowing themselves to be um, kind of the, the, the classroom. You know, that we learn on what's the right and wrong way to come at women. Um, I will clear this up. It seems to be everybody's on this rejection shit. If you just position yourself to have a bunch of women in your environment constantly all the time that just know you naturally and you're their friends, 
then every time you shoot your shot, you shoot it at someone that is already confirmed to have interest in you. It's that simple. It's leveraging and positioning. If you do that, you can't get rejected. It's that simple. And I think DJ Hank, you understand what I'm saying. When you're working in clubs and stuff, people that work in the club, they know everybody in the club. They're all there all the time. So all you do is just pick the ones that have already shown indicators of interest. That way you can't lose. It's that simple. Um, but yeah, and like Cali Bev said, don't be pressed. Every time you introduce yourself to a woman, it's not to get the pussy. It's just to make another relationship, just to make another connection. It might not even be her I want. It may be somebody in her crew. I don't know. Like I said, sometimes it's just networking, but just keep it light, man. Stop being pressed. Just make connection. Meet people. Build your community. It's that simple. Like DJ Hans been doing here, building a community and flying a spaceship. I'm loving it. Angry man is always a pleasure, good brother. Ladies, thanks again. You ladies are beautiful. That's all I got. Word, man. No, salute. Definitely. E, salute. Thank you for the super, uh, excuse me, the cash app. E, I appreciate you for supporting the movement, man. We doing well, man. We doing well. We doing it together. You know what I mean? Lauren, any final thoughts? Um, As we can see, I'm not the uh, initiator. So I don't know how to talk to men up front, but I do know how to respond well, which is what I do in the chat. So I would just say go into it very genuinely, however you are, and then hopefully it works for you with that lady. If it don't work for you, she's not the one for you anyway. So work. that's all. <laughs> hey, you're right, Lauren, but you got to cite that. But well, go ahead. My bad. Right. <laughs> Nick, angry man. Yeah, so oh, okay. you good, you good, I'll mess with you. Shout out to Jay Smooth. All right, psych that. Uh, <laughs> Angry man, any final thoughts? Yeah, um, I actually agreed with what some of Aaron's what Aaron said because I've I've been approached a lot by women. And it's because when whenever we went out, whenever me, y'all know is whenever we used to go out to the club and stuff. We just went out to the club to have a good time. You know what I'm saying? So we out there having a good time, you know, looking like a million bucks or whatever, chilling. Women are attracted to dudes that's there just having a good time, not really pressed and trying to holler at them and all of that. And then if you do have a conversation with somebody, you you just having a conversation and it might lead to something else. But it's, it's just all about the vibe. Like, if you're not in there being creepy and shit, like some dudes do, like staring and all that goofy shit, if you're just in there chilling, having a good time, you know, it's, it's cool. Word. Yeah, no, nah, man. Um, I think that's righteous. I think even when Cali, if you just take Cali as an example, or uh, just do with that vibrant energy, like that rubs off, you know? People are comfortable around that. You know, you're not taking yourself too seriously, you know. And I agree, mm -hmm. we used to have fun, we used to be dancing the whole nine yards. Um, my man's we had got we got in a fight. I think we lost for the most part. And then we was getting arrested. And my man was on his stomach with his hands behind his back. He like, yo, shorty, remember we was talking in the club? I'm like, my nigga, we going to jail, B. But like <laughs> it gets just like whatever, like that's that's probably too comfortable. But like it just like it he just sound like, like a, yo he sound like a legend like yeah, like oh, real yeah. shit he was getting arrested and he was still like bro still spitting I'm like yo crack crack yeah crack a <laughs> <That's> <laughs> next level right <laughs> he doing good now but you know you 18 you know what I'm saying like he just like you know um but now nah, this, this was interesting and like you said um. Uh, like Aaron said, I appreciate the ladies for coming up and just having the conversation, willing to. If you notice, as soon as we got in the box, the ladies didn't hesitate. You know, normally it's like, oh, I don't want to do it. So that was that was helpful, man. Salute yep. to y'all also for revealing some of the things that dry up vaginas as earlier in the show. Because uh, people could take away from that shit, you know? Um, for sure, man. Um, I, I need to do more assessing of the Riz thing. The Riz or what we used to call it, Mojo or whatever the case is. Um, but no, no, clout, clout. Maybe that's the word. You know, I think that's still pretty important, man. But I think they call it Riz emotion now. And I think that's what Aaron was speaking to. That's why it resonated. Just being a DJ, oftentimes I was in the club, I was there to work. 
you know um and so you get you get a preference though when i'm not on so like in dc for instance it's four djs during the night so usually i'll go like second to last to last so you in there you know you support the other djs you got the section you're not paying for nothing so that gives you a level of um clout you know people showing you preference what does make a difference when you're having those conversations so all of it matters you know what i'm saying all of it definitely matters man for sure y'all can get out of here if y'all want just gotta make sure i acknowledge all the super chats man <clears throat> you know i gotta Appreciate walk my dog so i gotta go no doubt <laughs> the dog walked backwards it's all good go walk that ugly ass dog go <laughs> that dog price slow <laughs> <laughs> class became a member I'm earlier you, bro. yes sir uh bravado thank you next level appreciate you ap thanks for locking in hank the og jess was talking mad shit, but she held it down homeboy you've been rocking all day appreciate you i ranger salute jerice in the building matt p in the building thanks for moderating zo i think it was your first time my brother welcome appreciate you for locking in jeremiah man i'm gonna get you hooked up with rope man i gotta get her off my hands man you know what i'm saying Devin, salute Devin over here <laughs> took an l today but he stood his ground though you feel me og og oh, 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 <laughs> joel for hitting the panel mike brown my og appreciate you mike been locked in from day one Caesar's palace always locked in appreciate you marcus thank you for moderating Underground Zone, thank you for becoming a member. What up, boss and boss and girls, flip a dozen, dozen. Holla at your boy, boy, you got your cousin, what's it? Uh-huh. Lady Di was in here. She probably took her ass to sleep, though. <laughs> she was here from the beginning. Zach Goo, thank you, my brother. HQ, appreciate you. My brother John, salute, salute, salute. Thank you, John, for being self-aware. John is 6'4". He got muscles and still gave himself a six. <laughs> Mr. Fantastic talking about he is seven. Mr. Fa Mr. Fantastic be trolling me, man. <laughs> like thoughts, my brother. Salute, CD. Appreciate you. <laughs> the whole judge so mad. <laughs> if he hey, feel like he is seven, you locking in with us, man. Hank mm. Deezy, appreciate you. Let me see, my brother Congo. Salute. Oh, I got Jeremiah. Omar. Omar was in the building. Thank you. Striking it rich from the UK. Thank you, my brother. You've been locked in for the shit past couple weeks. Rubber Rose, man. I was good. To, glad to see you. I ain't seen you in a couple weeks, bro. Hope all is well. Let me see. Sun Kiss. Shalawan. Of course. Devin. Got Matt. T.O. Salute. 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 Granville was in here wilding. <laughs> he said this. When we ask him what a two look like, he talk about me. <laughs> Salute to Jay Smooth, of course. Thank you for hitting the panel, my G. Be love been locked in with us for three months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Savage, you was in the chat while appreciate you. Let me make sure I miss anybody. I think I'm good. I think I'm oh, Jay Lynn, appreciate you. Who else we got? Who else we got? Unk man, thank you, my brother. Pookie, salute, man. Yeah, we got to get on cam, so that's the only reason. YKS, my young boy, appreciate you. Trigger Mike was in the building. Salute. Shout out to Quentin, man. Yeah, we wanted to see the black white boy game, man. You should have hit the link. You talking about learn how white brothers do it. Lamar, good shit today on the earlier panel. Ali, salute. Real love was in the building. Thank you, brother. Flow was popping. Did I read this one? No. Oh, no, I didn't. Hold on. Flow with the five dollars says, keep your relationship status till the morning. <laughs> <laughs> KP with the five says, Callie was able to friend zone this dude in a hypothetical role play. Joe uh, with the five dollars says, the approach you run on a woman you're not interested in, you're interested in is not the same approach you running on someone you want to be friends and partners with. 
um yeah i think i think uh aaron identifies it during the process and then just switches the game so you're not wrong yep yep Yep. bro joe custom car therapy okay with the two dollars he would be a mark in cali lamar with the two 200 yen said ogb on a horse with the stacy adams on (laughs) flow with the two dollars og bagging them on a horse pound goat status striking it rich with the two pounds said aaron ain't been rejected since high school <laughs> uh, no, angry man and Aaron, thank you for your interjection, brothers. God speed indeed. Striking and rich with the two two pounds and OG had a horse. Damn, this lion thing is contagious. Nah, bro, you'd be surprised. They ride horses, they really do. Lauren, good job today, man. Good show, uh, good, great show and panel. Good night, Aaron. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Robin. Robin with his other good work, ham. Expose him more incels. Come on, Robin. Put, put, put him in the fucking bed. Get him out of here. Come on. Everybody spit their game, man. There's levels to everything. Levels to everything. Damn, I'm tired. I see y'all tomorrow night. Um, oh, angry man, you missed it last time. Um, one of my boys, he not a YouTube. Uh, he he just kind of watched my show and that's about it, right? Mm-hmm. And so he was just kind of complaining essentially about some of the manosphere things that happened. And so yeah. he came up, he battled the likes of Mr. Fantastic, Jay Prince, Tommy, um, Chaotic, uh, uh, Fatty. So he went against everybody. And needless, uh, maybe was it Joseph? I don't know if Joseph was there. Joseph was there, I think. And neither say he got destroyed. So he coming back, but he got some backup. So if you around tomorrow night, 9 p.m. Eastern, he, he want to talk. He want to talk to the manosphere. <laughs> hey, help! How I get on the panels, man? I'm gonna get a membership, man. I like I like what y'all talk, man. Yeah, usually I don't really set them per se. So it just hits the link like that. There might be some preference. So if Aaron comes, you know, I make sure he get on. Even though Aaron just be chilling. You know, angry man, things of that nature. But yeah, if you click the link, pretty much everybody come up. We rotate, and usually, if it's too many people, I usually like rotate myself out for a little while, just to try to yeah. get everybody in. Um, if I ever do a set panel, depending on what people's strengths are, I usually will reach out. But just shoot me an email. This might be risky at Gmail. Um, okay. And I try to respond to everything as best I can. You know. Um, yes, sir. He's one hundred like that, man. He's he's real rap. Yeah. All yes, right. Sir. Best man. Um. So yeah, so angry man, if you ain't doing nothing <laughs> tomorrow night, yeah, I'll oh, come through. It's gonna be crazy. Yeah, it's gonna be good because he he got the Snoop Dogg shit beat out of him last time. Because <laughs> 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 oh, he was saying niggas is lame, basically. Um, Word. but then he had to defend the arguments. It didn't go high, and then so I talked to him. He's like, I ain't never coming back on that. <laughs> <laughs> Angry man, you know he somebody get mad when he told he told chaotic I spit on you. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like yo, why you going in? Like, <laughs> you know, and then yeah, him and Jake Tommy, better. yeah, I'm a, I, I'll shoot you the link. And then him and Tommy, they got a fight set up apparently, so they supposed to fight when they see each other. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So that shit was crazy, man. So 9 p.m. Eastern, he bringing some backup with him, man. So it should, it should be a good time for sure. Word. But I love y'all, man. I appreciate y'all. Thank y'all for all the support, man. Especially the OGs, Aaron, Jay Smooth. Thank you for supporting, man. Angry man, you know, y'all coming over here means a lot. It does something for the algorithm. And you know, I always like to acknowledge the things that are helpful. Um, because Word. people want to talk about manosphere and being pro-black. Pro-black is is support. You know, right. we talk shit, but yep. what do you do for each other? The manosphere will talk that shit, but who do you give back to? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right. So I'm not as big as Angry Man, so him coming over there helps me, and that's why things like that inspire me. Make sure I coach the kids, 100 Black Men of America. You know, giving back and pouring into people. That's how you build up men. You know what I'm saying? Right. So. I'm right. Yeah, real quick, real quick, Hemp, man. And, and you know, to give is just a gift from the heart. A lot of people give expecting something in return. And I think that's what, what's wrong with our people, man. Like, we don't understand that we as black people 
what we do for someone else indirectly comes back to us because we do look alike. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, once you help someone, man, don't look for anything in return. Just do it because you support. That is what you call uh, black love, man, and uh, black empowerment. And that's why I support and I will continue to support, man. I like yeah. what you're doing. Real talk. So. Yeah, no, 100%. Pay it forward. Yep. 100%. Mm -hmm. Pay it forward. So I know y'all not expect nothing from me, but I could do something for the kids and how y'all support me. Right. Everything can be inspirational right. in that way, regardless if somebody said it, you use it for what they meant it for, you know? Right. When right. the brothers be, when the brothers be kicking each other on and off, people be like, damn, they spending money kicking the person off. But in actuality, they supporting the channel. That's right. Know? And and that's what they actually do it for. It just give them a reason to do it. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? So um, so just shout out to like Doughboy, Caesar's Palace, you know, just people who did it, La, La Garrett, you know what I'm saying? RBN, mm. like just all of it, man. So I just wanted to say it out loud while there's still 250 people here, you feel me? Um, mm. to keep this money in the community, you know what I'm saying? Like, right. for instance, last thing, I went to Angry Man channel, um, I think after he came on and I had to do something. So my, I got a personal page. And then this might be risky page. So my DJ Hampton Stampede email, I was subscribed. My this might be risky wasn't right. So I clicked it, and you had to be a member for twenty four hours or a subscriber for twenty four hours. Yeah. And I didn't even know you could do that shit. So I yeah. took fucking two hours trying to find that shit. But little <laughs> things like that make a huge. Because imagine if I was doing that, you know, eight months ago, right? Where you had yeah. to subscribe, you know. Yeah. So, but just that, right? And he didn't like what did he he had it up there which gave me an opportunity to see it and say low let me implement this you right. know what i'm saying so yeah. you know little shit bro you gotta it's make sure you an operation it. yeah yeah man so i see y'all tomorrow angry man i send you the link red pill i send you the link aaron you be you be kind of middle of the road but it might be good jay smooth yeah. everybody man there. i love y'all yeah. be safe right, do man. the right thing man i'm out of here yeah, like, share. All right, yes, love sir. You, bro. like All right, share, like share, subscribe Tell a friend and tell a friend, and we out.